Good morning, good morning. How's everybody doing? Hello, hello, hello. Miha GG's on the first. Cat, thanks for hanging out. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Thank you for the hydrate as well. Jen, hello, how you doing? Fazu, good morning, Little Red. My goodness. <laughs> Bo, Pika, thank you for coming in. Sally. <laughs> Thanks, Cindy. How you doing, Melanie? <laughs> Thanks, Fatsu. How you doing? Thank you for the support. How's your day? <laughs> Ooh. Hey, Fomers. How's it going? <laughs> this is Zafira. Good morning. How's everybody doing? <laughs> Red, 
they doing? Yeah, the sound alerts and stuff are still on. Um, I thought about turning them off, but I think I think we would have everybody would have rioted. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> it's your birthday, Zafira. It's your birthday today. Happiness to you on this your day of birth. <laughs> Happy birthday, and you're not at work. Yes, congratulations. <laughs> I hope you have a fantastic birthday. Mm. We're going to ride anyway, Sally. I mean, I believe it. <laughs> I believe it. I believe it. <laughs> Imagine a little red demon dancing when little red police. Yeah. Right. <laughs> you can actually program the redemptions and alerts based off the game you're playing and fireball. I think so too, Fazu, but. It's fine. Good to see you here and watch Tadpole suck at Stardew. Sounds like a <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong, but mm, I have a request. Oh, boy. Rebu, hello, GGs. Can you say, but Tadpole? <laughs> like that? I need to learn how to. Yeah, I think it is an option. I haven't learned all the things. Miha, hello. Welcome in. How you doing? Thank you. <laughs> I got to get one for small. <laughs> I think one for small saying, but small. I have to record that later today. I was going to do it last night and I got busy. I got busy doing things and stuff. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Miha GG's on surviving your meeting, by the way. Well done. That's not always easy. Did you get something for that burn? I did. I did. Andy got me good this morning. <laughs> Oh, okay. So we're struggling for some reason, I think. Uh, are we all right? No, we're all right. Just a little weird. Yeah. She got me good. She got me good. <laughs> can you do a butt foamers when you do smalls? Yeah, I can do that. I can. There have I. I was troubleshooting for about an hour last night before figuring out what I had... That instead. Oh, I got you. I got you. Yeah, the commands. Crazy, crazy. Some co-op style to do. Yeah, every every uh, Wednesday. Every Wednesday. DBT, I guess. Welcome in. How you doing? May have taught Little Red how to get your player head last night. I saw that, Bo. I saw that. <laughs> Those look amazing. Those look amazing. I mean, the builds aren't bad either, but like, you know, the tapples are, are so good. <laughs> I mean, you're good. I'm good too. I'm good too. I'm glad you're doing good. Steve Furnace, how you doing? Good morning. Morning, morning, morning. How, how was stream last night? I was able to catch the beginning of it when you started the dragon fight. But I was unable to finish watching the whole thing. I was lurking, but I had to do other things. <laughs> I hope it went well. <laughs> you actually defeated? You're cracked. You're cracked at Minecraft. Well done. <laughs> well done. That's amazing. <laughs> After dying in the first 30 seconds. Hey, as long as you got it done, you got the thing done. It's fine. It's fine. Only took like five deaths. First try. <laughs> First try. It's morning for the Americans. Of all oh, your Aussie, you're doing right now. It's twelve forty. Oh my gosh. So are you just getting up or staying up late? <laughs> I'm assuming you're staying up late. Oh my goodness. I hope you had a good day. <laughs> Oh, thank you so much for popping in. I appreciate it. It's so late. It's so late. <laughs> it's so late. Oh my goodness. It only took like five days. I'm changing exclamation melanin DMing you now. Okay. It was hilariously fun. You're officially at our spawn at the post office. I saw a little red. I look so good. I look so dapper. 
We got wings and two shulkers. Nice. You you won. Now what? Just you might as well just go play Roblox because there's nothing left to do in Minecraft. Once you beat the dragon, get choker boxes. Everybody knows that. <sighs> thanks for lurking. Thanks for being there. Oh, it was fun. I wish I could. I wish I could have stayed longer. I wish I could have stayed longer, but so much stuff. Uh, the wither tomorrow, tomorrow, maybe today. <laughs> You did great. You did great. <laughs> Zephyr is 3% toxic. I mean, it's your birthday. You're not supposed to be toxic on your birthday, right? But it was so nerve wracking with. <laughs> you don't like the pumpkin? Fifty percent milk. Ah! <laughs> All day, thank you for 22, 22 months. Oh my gosh, almost two years. All day, thank you so much for the resub. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh my goodness. I hope you're having a good day. And as always, happiness to you <laughs> on this your day of birth. <laughs> so once we once we get going i'm going to turn the spotify music off the redemptions are off for spotify music and we're just going to listen to starting music today like in-game music and stuff which is good this is fine i don't want it to be like confusing so oh i know i know i know it'll be back on tomorrow Starting music is good. I like it. But that way it's not Stardew ASMR. Yes. Jen, and I hope I hope the storms were not too bad for you. I hope everything is calm now. And it wasn't bad. I never went and knocked off the stuff my car yesterday. Now it's probably frozen. Oh. Yep. Give yourself plenty of time, Aldi, if you have to go anywhere. Plenty of time. You had some branches fall, Melanie? Oh, my goodness. We had nothing. We just had rain. I mean, literally just rain. It's like above freezing now, so nothing's frozen either. So, all good? Okay, good, good. You guys, everybody's getting crazy storms. Uh, we got nothing. We just got rain. So start the car and crank the heat and let it sit for 30 minutes. I mean, as much snow as Aldi had, it would have to be like a couple hours probably <laughs> if you don't knock the snow off of it. I might have to play Stardew today. Can't find anything else I want to play. It is a very fun game. I, I will admit it is extremely fun and in-depth and there is so much. There's way more to it than I thought. Almost a foot. Yeah. <laughs> so much Aldi oh my gosh you're gonna have to shovel you're gonna have to shovel the snow off your jeep to get in your jeep <laughs> Sally you had storms yesterday too oh my goodness you had an emergency alert tornado watch last night Zafira god wow yeah everybody's having everybody's having the weather we're having we had rain I'm, and I'm not complaining could have sent the snow my way Melanie stop no, no, because then it has to go past me first. No, absolutely not. No, 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 no. I have 1,233.7 hours in Stardew. Whew. Just a little bit. Zafiri, you like it a little bit. <laughs> I still brushes in the car. <laughs> oh, no. Honestly, I would take the house broom out the corner broom and brush off the doors at least so I can just open the doors out the inside of my vehicle filling with snow. That's what I would do. That's the plan. <laughs> it's like, something's got to get this off. So when I open, the, because I've been like, I don't want to deal with this and open the door without brushing it off. And it's just somehow it all lands on the seat and then it instantly starts melting. <laughs> 
So then you have this much snow on the seat of your car and it instantly melts. It's like, no. <laughs> We got half the amount all he did was out of power for seven, eight hours. Whew. Ooh. I'm starting to think all he doesn't want to go anywhere today, right? Harvest Moon game is what inspired Stardew. Is it really? I did not know that. That makes sense though. That makes sense. We had storms and we're under a tornado watch all night too, Rebu. Man. Passenger side that we have a dry touche. Honestly, yeah, that's a good shout. But I never think of that, Miha. I never think of that. I'm always like, let's get in the driver's side and turn the car on so it can start warming up while I'm cleaning it off. So then I open the wrong side. It's like, Pfft. I'm definitely not going anywhere, but we don't have temps above freezing for at least a week. Oh, so I need to get the snow off before it becomes, yeah, it'll become, it'll literally become a giant block of ice. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> we had flood watch yesterday but the watch ended before i left work and the drive home was fine nice it drives me crazy how many people drive with the slab of snow on the roofs yeah as soon as that comes off <laughs> back in the day i had hundreds of hours in harvest moon did you really you get the snow off the snow plows to go by and put it back <laughs> i so i feel bad for little red uh, without a computer house is under renovations doing the floors get everything put back together power goes out for seven eight hours <laughs> no hopefully that is all behind you smooth sailing Smooth sailing, smooth sailing. <laughs> I hated dealing with the packed snow at the end of the driveway from the snow plows. I do not miss snow. Yeah, I, I'm done. I'm so done with snow. I hate it so much. That guy, I'm good, good. Sarah, hello. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm, I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. I'm doing fantastic. I hope you are doing so good. <laughs> it's lovely to see you. Don't remember the last time I saw snow in person. I remember. I remember. <laughs> and then you'd be out plowing the snow. So you go out where the where the driveway meets the road. We call I call that we've always called that an apron. Um I'd be down there cleaning the apron off. And it's always deeper there from the snow snow plows cleaning the road off and everything. So your the snow is like sometimes it was like almost chest high down there. Where you're snow plowing and stuff or snow blowing and then a plow truck would come by and the roads still have snow all over them right and it's just like <laughs> just disappears like ah fun times fun times <laughs> waiting for my cousin to get home to pick up a stream deck oh nice remember the last time a hurricane came through i've never been through a hurricane and i'm i don't not something i want to experience to be fair it's not it's not on my list of things i want to do <laughs> so if you guys were hanging out yesterday died for the second time in nine lives that was fun that was fun I'm still kind of mad at myself for doing that. It's fine. It's fine. I've been through hurricanes. Worst one was Sandy in 2012. So Melanie, I live in Northern Ohio and we got remnants of that. Oh, come on, Tadpole. I know I did. I died. I died. It's fine. <laughs> oh, why don't I want to live through a hurricane? I'm good. There's no way. There's no way. Yeah, we, we lost power. Avoidable death, yeah. 
Yeah, we got we lost power, uh, like flooding everywhere, and like where I live, where I live. Think about where I live. You know, nowhere near an ocean or anything like that, and we got hammered so bad. Like there was limbs down everywhere, like trees down, not just limbs. Floodwaters were I've never seen them this high. Like things were flooded that was like what? Uh, it was power outages everywhere. Now I'm good. Like I we've had tornadoes and big bad thunderstorms and stuff, but hurricanes, heck no. Hey, no way. <laughs> I'm good on that one. Like I got, I drove, was hilarious a while back. Ian came through, shut us down for nearly a month, not even flicker on the power. Then Nicole, I think, came through a month later. Yeah. It's wild. It's really wild. Like, I mean, I drove, I had a truck at the time. I drove all the way in and there was a hill. At one point there was a hill. I had to go up a hill. Like, there, you know, roads are what, whatever roads are. And there was a, it was a low point and you go up. And the low point was dry because it was all drainage and everything was good. But I'm going up and the water, there was so much water. It was still raining. Like you could see it looked like a river and it was on an incline like this. It was going down, but it was water. Like it was deep on the incline. That's how much, that's how much rainwater there was. And I live where, you know, I don't even live where it was bad. <laughs> it's like, oh, what in the world? I've never seen that before. <clears throat> Subtropical storms when it hit me, lost power for nine hours. Crazy, crazy. Yeah, it can be. It can be extremely intense. But I drove all the way into work. I drove all the way into work, and I live in like I live in the rural area, so everything's like pitch black anyways at night, early morning. I got all the way to work and the town I worked in was dark, but I'm like, I'm literally on autopilot because I've worked here forever, forever. I've worked here and I get all the way in there and I pull in and it's dark and then and the driveway's flooded, parking lot's flooded. I, I walk all the way in to turn the lights on and they don't turn on. I'm like, oh yeah, <laughs> there's no power. <laughs> it was crazy. Like until I clicked that switch, it didn't even register in my brain. There was no power. There's a lot of flooding in East Tennessee. Gatlinburg has really gotten flooded yesterday. Really? Oof. Hopefully that is better. Okay. I think we're going to hop in. It looks like Archeoplays is already over there. So let's go hop in and say hi. Let me pause the music. Boom, boom, boom. Turn that off and then let's jump in live to here. I'm pushing buttons. Okay, that looks good. Close that. Join. Ooh. I think, I think we're ready. I think we're ready. So we didn't have power for five days. Oof. This one. Are we in? Hello? Hello? Hello. <laughs> Sorry, that was probably really loud. You're fine. It was I wasn't paying attention to volume. I was just excited. <laughs> <laughs> you guys let me know if everything sounds good to you. Yeah, also uh my chat let me know if uh either of us are too loud or something. We also should uh the time is moving now. So, shall we water our water our things? Yeah. See if we can do we need more do we need more things to plant? I I don't think so because nothing grows in only two, in only like one day. So you only get 28 days in a season, which means that tomorrow is the last day of spring. And then we're going to summer. That's right. So, uh yeah, the end of the season is always like there's less to do farming-wise and the beginning of the season it's like there's there's stuff to do, but at the same time it's uh it's less it's like all at once and then there's not much it's a lot of waiting around so like kind like, of the middle of the season that's busiest i i know how to speak today i promise well you're better than me then 
Well, that's good. <laughs> uh, yeah. He got okay. one up on me. So we have geodes we can take into. Like, oh, that's true. I don't know if that's something to do in this like downtime or whatever you want to call it. Yeah, we could do that. Um, they cost twenty five G to open. We have. But we can definitely we, do that. We have thirty of them. Oh, we can't do. We shouldn't do all thirty. Probably right. Thirty times twenty five is a lot. Um, what? but. Well, we don't have the money to do all 30 of them, but maybe if we do... Oh, that's true. Is it... How lucky are we today? I don't know if that affects geodes. I believe geodes are just like a a set order that you uncover them in. Keeping things moist is good, yes. The spirits are in a good humor today, so we could also go into the mines and uh, and see see if we can get a little further down. Oh, although we have separate luck, don't we? Uh, mine it's says luck, mine says I'll have a little extra luck. Yeah, that's 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 more or less what mine was. I think that might have been exactly what mine was. Let's do like rather than 30, let's do like Lux doesn't affect how much... geodes is what Zephira says. I don't Yeah, I was I was thinking cuz there's a so there's actually a tool online called Stardew Valley Predictor mm -hmm. and it will tell you what you're going to uncover it in your geodes, for example. And I was like, for that to be able to work, there's no way it can be, it can be connected to luck. Um, so, uh, so yeah, the, let's, let's do like four each. That would be like 200 gold total. Okay. If you want to grab four and then we'll go over to the, over to the thing. Blacksmiths. <laughs> Words. I can word good. Words. I'm uh, um, thing. How many should I grab? Two? Four. Okay. Then we'll go this way. Summer, I'm... We have approached summer far faster than I thought we would. This time situation oh. is, uh, is worrying me a little. <laughs> so... So we'll, uh, we'll, you know, if anybody's expecting us to get four candles from grandpa at the end of year two, maybe adjust those expectations or hold <laughs> off on those expectations, at least until, uh, <laughs> un until you've seen us play through, like until we're in our second year. Maybe. I, lo I love how you like expectations. I'm like, what are we doing? <laughs> yeah. Maybe like temper those expectations. <laughs> we, I mean, we probably... Aw, oh, man, Lewis, did you have to? Right now, I was going to raid your garbage can. <laughs> you know what's great is if you block them in, then they get angry, and then they'll storm past you. It's pretty great. <laughs> I mean, it's not necessarily something you want to waste time doing, but um, it's fun they're that, <laughs> sometimes. They're, they're that touchy, huh? Mm-hmm, yeah. Wow. They'll, they'll pause for a while, but if you're still in their way, they're going to be like, they get a little angry rea reaction over their heads, and then they're just like, they speed off. Ooh, I think that's a new artifact. Yeah, cool. Okay, I got a dwarf helmet Ooh, nice. and a bunch of copper and an earth crystal, which I think we've already given to Gunther, and a limestone. Is that good? I don't know what any of this stuff is. It's, oh gosh, I'm hitting the wrong buttons. The limestone, it's like, it's only good for the museum. Um, so any duplicates we find, we can just sell, basically. Uh, in terms of archaeological artifacts, we probably shouldn't sell those just because, you know, as I have to put my professional archaeologist hat on and be like, selling antiquities is a bad idea. Uh, but the game player in me is like, oh, yeah, sell it or give them to Penny because Penny loves them for some reason. Okay. I went, did I, you? I, well, I did. I found an artifact, but then it kicked me out. I have two more. Oh. I have two more, buddy. So you should be able to... Earth crystal. Yeah. And... A limestone. Okay. Oh. I wonder... Oh, sorry. <laughs> that was me clicking back into the screen. I'd clicked off accidentally. I wonder if the... The geodes, they don't... Are they per individual? That would be weird in multiplayer. Because I got a dwarfish helm, a limestone, a earth crystal. Where's my other thing? Oh. Did he keep it? I don't know. 
Here, you can you can donate the strange. Yeah. Said I have an artifact and Gunther would like it, but like does he automatically take it there? No. I don't know. I wonder if it just glitched out. Hmm. Glitches. That's a shame. Imagine where where do you put the dwarven helmet? Wherever you want. Oh yeah, you're gonna There you go. Is it... <laughs> I know That's fine, that I know, works. Yeah, you're going to be like, no! No, no, that it. works. <laughs> Zavir said, luck mostly affects gonna... finding stairs, ore in the mines, and chance of finding treasure chests while fishing. Also drops yeah. on the arcade game. Ah, okay. Yes. Also, yeah, it, it affects how many monsters you encounter sometimes to an extent. Like, uh, yeah. It, it Luck affects a random assortment of things. Hello, Willy. If the local fishing scene got a bit more lively, I might expand the shop's stock. I think, did he did he already expand to a better fishing rod? I can't remember. Maybe he did. I know. I don't know. We didn't buy one. Oh, well, I didn't. Elliot says that I probably wouldn't like it inside of his cabin because it's dark and full of spiders. And I will have you know, Elliot, that my dad is an entomologist, so um, spiders don't scare me. I've I've lived in a house with worse. So I, I wanna, it's fine. Why, why does Elliot choose to live in a cabin that's dark and full of spiders? I mean, that's a good question. It's he is, I don't know. It, yeah. I think he likes the romance of it all. I mean, I'm not. <laughs> Maybe he's friends with the spiders. Yeah, I'm not judging. I'm just asking why. If you're okay. if you're warning warning me against it, why are you? Make sure your boots are clean before stomping around my house. Wow, mm. why are you so angry, Pam? I've never been in I your know. house. Goodness. <laughs> and Shane's just like, why are you bothering me? I want to be alone. <laughs> okay, Al guys. Alex is getting buff. Wonderful. Yeah. Why are you following me? You want to be alone. You don't have to be oh, alone, it's Shane. It's fine, Shane. You don't have to be alone. Oh, hello, Joel versus Arthritis. Welcome in. Um, that guys, if you remember the podcast I was mentioning, where or talk show thing, that's the that's the thing we're doing on the twenty first. That's the YouTube link I posted. That's the guy. <laughs> that's Joel. <laughs> Hi, anyway. Joel. Um, hi, Joel. <laughs> hello, hello. Um, yeah, the... What am I doing? Um, it's already 6 p.m., but, 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 but maybe we can get further in the mines. We can try. We can dream, although I have a fairly full inventory. I don't know. This might be a bad idea, probably, but... Probably is. We should probably, honestly, go clear farmland or something. You know what I mean? See, look at you being the sensible one. What? How? When did that happen? <sighs> well, I, I, I'm sensible when it's like multiplayer. When it's by myself, I'm just like, oh, uh, what's You're that? just like chaos reigns. <laughs> yeah. I don't know how that works out, but you know. Oh, Spiders are so romantic, aren't they? There's, okay, so there was a, a while back, there was a little spider, um, like an animation kind of thing. Mm-hmm. It was, there was like a, oh gosh, I don't remember what his name was. He was this little spider and it was very cute. And I don't remember his name, but it was on YouTube and he's adorable. And that's as, that's all that I remember because words exist in my brain today. So, <laughs> so, yeah. so it's not very helpful, but it was adorable. And if I, if when we're on a break, if somebody reminds me, I'll try to find him because it, it's very cute. I will only post the link. Don't click on it if you don't like spiders. Lucas? But, uh, but Lucas the spider. Yes. Thank you, Robert Sketch. Lucas the spider is great. It was super great. Zafira knows too. That's who I, that's how I knew what it was. Like, I don't know. Yeah. Lucas, Lucas the spider is amazing and I adore him. I haven't seen any new Lucas the Spider videos in a long time. I think they stopped making them, but they're adorable. It's very cute. <laughs> Thank you, Clara, for reminding me. <laughs> Clara just put a quote up in. Uh, there's a quote that I said at one point during a stream where I said, um, I think it's getting dark because of how dark it is. And so now every time words don't work for me, my my chat reminds me of that quote. It's it's pretty great. I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> I'm not wrong. <laughs> But you know, it's words. <laughs> I cannot, I cannot, yeah. I cannot argue with that logic. I mean, it's spot on, basically. Yeah, you can tell it's getting dark because it's getting dark. You know, yeah. doesn't doesn't matter if it's a if it's a 
Does that count as a tautology? I don't know. See, this is the thing. I shouldn't be using big words when simple words aren't even necessarily working for me. <laughs> Zafir said uh, Lucas has a series. Yeah, Lucas has a whole... Uh, wait, like... Since since all of the YouTube videos? I don't know. They were, oh, that would be exciting, though. Okay, we don't need to water anything. These things aren't going to give us more crops. I was hoping that they would give us one more, but I couldn't remember when we last harvested them. I have a neutral yeah, neutral day today. Neutral day. Oh, I should check. Claire is saying that the, uh, the dark quote is her favorite. That and the Gandalf one, where I say that Columba, Gandalf, Nessie... You, you, oh, make sure to watch the cooking show. Oh, I watched the weather. Yeah, it's a, it's on Cartoon Network, as the first said. Wait, really? Yeah. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay. You have to check out Cartoon Network. Okay. I need to check. Yeah. Omelette. I'll have to figure out how to do that. I have a neutral luck day as well. Thank you so much for subscribing for 16 months, Lazagod. Oh my goodness. You can, you can tell it's an aspen tree because of the way it is. Yeah, see, it it works sometimes. It's it's fine. It's all fine. I love that. Okay. It's simple. It makes it's, sense. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we should check the traveling cart lady. With our, the, our the, 162 gold pieces we have? You know, we might be able to afford nothing it's it's fine we'll we'll see you we can buy at the very least we'll get depressed about what we can't afford it's fine so real life yeah exactly wow Stardew just got more realistic oh no <laughs> part of the sunday ritual wow we literally can't afford anything in here <laughs> <laughs> oh, yep. Story of my life. <laughs> All right. Well, you know, it was, it's fine. It was nice to go window shopping, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> do you want to do you want to go in the mines or we could go fishing? Probably. Uh, Those are probably the two best things. We can go we can, we can go to the mines. You know, at, okay. least, at least we can get money, right? Yeah, that's true. I mean, fishing, you can sell the fish to get money, but um yeah, neither, but, uh, yeah. FYI, yeah. chat, in case you weren't here last time, <laughs> neither one of us really likes the fishing mini game in Stardew. So we're probably going to be like fishing the amount that we have to and then right. uh, and then not fishing. It's not that I don't of, it's not that I don't yeah. like it. I'm not good at it. <laughs> so it's like... I I don't like it because I'm not good at ah, it. So, yeah, yeah. yeah. Like I don't mm -hmm. I don't want to say I hate it. It is a challenge. Yeah. I'm just I haven't been able to figure it out yet. So maybe one day, May one it's, day, one day. Yeah. Zephyr says it's also on Netflix, 26 episodes. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I know what I'm doing this weekend. Hello, Linus. No, I haven't come to throw rocks at your tent. Someone else was throwing rocks at his tent last night though. So um, I'm very sorry. Wow. I have, here, have a salmon berry. This I is a great gift. Thank you, you're welcome. I brought no food. Yay, I'm prepared. You're fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're, what level have we gotten to? Have we gotten to... There's one bug steak in the thing, so that's pretty good. Ramen noodles and mac and cheese for the next 30 plus years. Listen, st stay out of my head. Oh, and we have... We got the backpack upgrade. I forgot about that. We could carry so much more stuff. Yeah. Okay. We did so... That. Are we going all the way down? How, 25? Yeah, let's go all the way down and see how far we can get. Um... Yeah, I was debating whether to warn you about something, but I'll warn you about it when we get there. It'll be fine. Oh, well, that's encouraging. That's not ominous at all. It's all it's all fine. Everything's fine. Um, It might have helped to maybe come slightly more prepared than we did, but not in terms of food. You're probably fine in terms of food. You're it's fine. like a, a yeah. It's, it's a it's a different piece of equipment uh that might have been helpful. Oh, cool. Sorry, I hit that into you. <laughs> no, you're fine. There we go. Just take all the achievements. It's fine. <laughs> Look, it's, yeah. It's all good. <laughs> yeah. Uh... I didn't, that one I didn't send to you. That was the AI. Oh my gosh. Okay, maybe, maybe. Oh, but you got a diamond though. Did I? I don't yeah. Even know. I'm, I'm, I saw it. I'm literally just trying to stay alive here. Okay, hold on, hold on. So many bugs, so many bugs, but I found the staircase. 
Oh, Is there did... anything valuable down here? Oh, GG. Probably not. Are you guys planning to sell some stuff so you can buy seeds tomorrow? I, I, are we? I don't know. Oh, that's true. So, we'll see what we have at the end of the day and probably it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. It's all fine. Do you like things fine? Do you ever come back and remove like all the blocks from every level or do you just go to the no. bottom, go to the bottom and move on? I, I go to certain levels to farm things. Mm -hmm. So like if uh if i need i mean i rarely come to these levels again because i hate the flies oh. and i rarely go to levels 30 to 40 again because of reasons um oh yay yeah but then like there's some levels that are cold like icy levels i go to those levels all the time and then like the lava based levels or the volcanic levels i i tend not to enjoy going to those but i'll go to them if i have to if i need gold for some reason, I'll go to those ones. But if I need like copper and stone, then, oh, here's a staircase. Then I'll go to like level zero to 10 so that I don't have to deal with the flies. Cause I, I don't like the flies. Why? Cause they're annoying and they, they hit you half the time even when you swing at them to knock them away. Yeah, well, you know, they're flies. Have you ever swatted at a fly before? I, I mean, yeah, I have. I just don't, I don't like it when art imitates life sometimes. <laughs> this is too realistic for me. Yeah. <laughs> I have to deal with flies in my day-to-day -day life. I don't right. want to have to deal with flies in Stardew Valley. Right. Yeah. It's just like, you know, not being able to afford things. It's the same thing. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Just let me get unlimited amounts of money. It's fine. I don't know why I can't have this. Uh-oh. I'm hearing a fly. Yeah, it's over here. Okay. I'm currently dealing with some of the grubs so that they don't turn into flies. That's what I was doing. Right. And then another one spawned in front of me. Oh, that's fun. So do the minecarts... Look, Tap will be illogical. I'm trying to be smart. The minecarts, huh? do they always have coal in them? They always have coal if you haven't been to the level before. Okay, but so I mean just like... follow... No, nothing else, right, is what I'm getting at. Nothing else. No, yeah, they don't have other stuff in them. It, it's helpful for coal, but uh, but yeah. <laughs> Okay. Thanks, Clara, for adding, I don't like when art imitates life sometimes as a quote. I mean, that's a good quote. <laughs> it is a pretty good quote. I feel like we, we get some good quotes in these streams. We've only had two of them, but I feel like we've got some pretty good quotes. <laughs> did, did we, did I, we haven't already found a staircase, have we? I don't think so. No. No, no, go away. Another one. Okay. Any any more any staircases? Any staircases at all? Well, there's a lot of rocks. <laughs> there are a lot of rocks. That's true. And we did only have like a new, well, it wasn't a neutral luck day, was it? Neutral? Yeah. Hey, there we go. There's a staircase and an omni geode. That's cool. You can make your own okay. luck today. So um, I'm going to prepare you for finding the next staircase. You know how we've gotten a reward on floor 10 and floor 20? We got like boots and a better sword. Yeah. Um, we don't get anything on floor 30. Well, that sucks. I know. It's the only <laughs> mine floor where you don't get a prize. And well, the one like that that ends in a zero where you don't get a prize. I found it. And I don't know. I don't know why that choice was made. But it makes me sad. Should I wait or can I go? No, you can go. No, we can go down. Oh, there's an elevator. See, yeah, there's oh. an elevator, but there's but there's no treasure chest in yeah. the middle. We don't get we don't get an extra sword okay. or anything. I got also, you. also, um, okay. Well, no, actually, just experience this level for yourself. Let's um, do that. Grace, hello. It's dark. How you doing, Grace? It's very dark. So, um, pro tip: if you use your pick on the torch, there you can carry the torch. Oh. oh, also there are little guys who uh, are in the dark and they uh, they will fight you. Oh. Yeah, there we go. What? They're zombies. They're, they're like stone golem kind of things. Stone golems. 
But the thing about these levels is that sometimes the staircases, like the, a lot of the time, this oh gosh, they're bats too. Glad a lot you do of the good. time, the staircases will just be in the level, but they're in the dark bits, so you can't see them, which is frustrating so when you, it happens. So you have to walk around with the torch in your, above your head? Yeah, sometimes you're lucky and you get something called a glow ring before you reach these levels, which basically is a ring that lets lets things glow around you, or like it just is a light that you wear. Is it a... Um, it's a, a well, ring. We haven't found a... Yeah, it's just a ring that you wear that glows, but we haven't found one of those yet, which is frustrating and sad. <laughs> so, oh, wait. No. Oh, oh. I found a staircase. It's up here. It's up here. There's a, oh. there's a creeper in my chat. How star do you go? There's a creeper in your chat. Okay, well... Uh, it's the, going good. The staircase, um, the staircase is up, but, uh, but yeah. There's a zombie there. Or stone golem. Whatever he is. They drop coals. <laughs> Golems. Yeah, absolutely. Look at you flexing with your diamond. I'm not. I don't know what I'm doing. Sure. Sure. <laughs> sure. Not flexing at all. I'm new. I'm glad. Yeah, it's going good. It's, I'm having a lot of fun. Uh, We're learning. It's fine. We're learning. Well, I'm not learning. I, I'm. Well, I'm learning some things. I'm learning what co-op is. <laughs> I love that I'm not learning anything, but you know. <laughs> I'm. <laughs> it's fine. I'm teaching. It's what I do. I'm not learning. I, I've been. It's, I've only been teaching for like decades. <laughs> oh look, free staircase. Yes, please. Let's get out of the dark levels <laughs> as quickly as possible. That's right. Somebody has to be the expert. I'm just glad it's not me. Oh, hold on. There's Golem, dude. I miss the this... I miss I miss the flies. Do you? <laughs> really? No, I don't. Okay, good. Cause <laughs> So just so you know the skulk shriekers from Minecraft sound alert fits really well right here. <laughs> oh really? Does it sound Oh a staircase down this way. Yeah, with the ominous wind blowing, yes, it fits really nice. well. Nice. Really, really well. Nice. Is that mushroom? Wait, there's, there's a mushroom. I got it. Okay, we're at floor <gasps> 35. Should it's 11 p.m. though, so we should go home yeah, if we don't want to collapse. Yeah. Let's maybe not lose our boots. Let's let's try our <laughs> best not to lose the boots. Okay, all right. I'm gonna leave that. I'm gonna leave the torch in the box. I'm gonna take those. Okay, maybe leave your torch in the chest as well, just so that. Not every level in those dark levels have torches, <laughs> so uh, sometimes you're just running around aimlessly in the dark. Right. So, uh, so yeah. It did show you, Geeky. Thank you for the support. Sometimes my sound alerts will show you who did the supporting, and sometimes it won't. It's weird. Mm. It's really weird. Mm -hmm. It's finicky. So. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like literally everything about streaming is finicky. It works like 70% of the time. Right. But the 30% of the time that it doesn't work is the time when you're live. So right, right. it doesn't. <laughs> exactly. Turn Can for... you hear game sounds? You're supposed to working? hear okay. game sounds. You guys should be hearing us walk. Hopefully you are. Uh, here, let me, let me Look. reach. Let me get into bed. Or else we're gonna quirky sound alerts, right? Yeah. Oh, we should have. Mm, not. Nah, we're just gonna go to bed. We're not. We're not. For anybody thinking this is good? an efficient playthrough, it's not. <laughs> it's. We're just. Gonna... Oh, were we supposed to do something else? <laughs> well, we were thinking of selling some stuff so that we could buy some. Oh, and we didn't sell anything, so time hasn't paused. But yeah, for some reason, you guys. Okay, hold on, hold on. For some reason, uh. The audio isn't coming through, which is bad because that means my chat has just been. Um, well, the, the 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 songs just now started for me. Yeah, but they hadn't been hearing any of the. Uh, oh, hold oh, on. Wait oh, a oh, the footsteps and no. Uh, yeah, they hadn't heard any of that. Oh. Okay, you should be able to hear it now, chat. Sorry about that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It's again the you know not everything likes to work. So is is the diamond 
Gunther can tell you more about this at the donate the museum. So you donate the diamond, you don't sell it? Uh, y mm, so, uh, I would recommend that we hang on to that diamond. Okay. Because it's the first one. Um, I thank you guys for letting me know you can hear stuff. If it's too loud, let me know and I'll turn it down. Um, sorry about that. <laughs> now you get the music. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll hang on to the diamond. We won't give it to Gunther quite yet, because that's not the the nicest use of a diamond, necessarily. If you- there are machines that will duplicate gemstones, <gasps> because diamonds are a bit rare. Dupli- um, Oh my goodness. Yeah, I know, but it takes like a week. <laughs> well, for diamonds, it takes like a week, so... <laughs> So it, it, it feels like cheating until you realize how long it takes, and then it's not cheating at all. Okay, it's summer. We should probably sell some stuff. Can we sell some stuff to Pierre? We have stuff to sell. What I like how is... we, we both can't be in the same bin at the same time. I know, right? Oh, oh, right. It's fine. Okay, that's why that's there. It's fine, it's fine. What does Pierre buy? Pierre will buy anything, pretty much anything. Uh, but especially like vegetables and forageables and such. Forageables, that's what. Yeah. Um. Let's see. So like, let me, let me, like, like dandelions. Uh, yeah, he'll buy dandelions. Potatoes. New fish. We could probably sell a couple of those couple of those daffodils right yeah but not like the star ones you don't want to sell those ones yeah don't sell the star ones and maybe don't sell all of the ones that we have so i would say um like, maybe keep like three or four behind just because sometimes people ask for them mm. out of season you get more for it you yeah oh from the people and you also get friendship points as well Oh, oh yeah, friendship's a thing. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes, at least. Sometimes. Okay. Okay. What am I? We've got. Okay, let me put stones away. Hold on. Let me. Let me. Let me just put all that away. We're selling this, and then we're hanging on to like, the Omni Geode. We're gonna hang on to the algae. I'm really shocked that. Well, no, I guess it makes sense. Red no. mushroom as well. Okay, I'm all right. I'm kind We're of, not gonna have. Kind of surprised they don't have you. Well, I guess it'd be they break it up, but like plant in late spring for like summer harvest, and then plant in summer for fall harvest. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. A lot of farming sims do that. Um, they'll just have things be grow in a certain season, and that's it. Yeah, there it are. Easier. A couple of crops in Stardew Valley. Oh, we should check for forageable stuff, especially because it's new because it's summer. But there's nothing here, so never mind. <laughs> Scam. It's fine. It's fine. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh gosh, sorry, hit my mic. Um, so the what am I saying? There are some crops in Stardew Valley that are multi-season crops. So ancient fruit is one of them. Um, corn is another one. Uh, and then I think wheat can grow in... Oh, hello, Marnie. Well, I love animals. If you treat yours well, I'm sure we'll become good friends. Okay. Let me in. There we go. Marnie, move. Summer's here. It's not really my favorite season. I mean, I hear you, Abigail, but um, it's fine. Hello, Leah. You can tell it's summer by the sweet smell of nectar wafting through the air. I definitely was hoping that she would say, you can tell it's summer... By, by how summery it is. Uh, would, you know, it's it's fine. On Wednesdays, the shop is closed. Helpful information, Caroline, but it's also not Wednesday. Yes, we are okay. doing shared money. Yep. We're going to do strawberry and potato. Oh, and I have some fish that I can sell to Willie. Let's get... What do we... Okay, hold on. How do I sell Let's... to this guy? If you talk to him over the counter, oh. like I am, I just was in the menu. No, 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 you're fine. Well, you I just didn't know. You should be able to Okay, so the now. menu opens, so do I just click on it? Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah, so then you click on whichever thing you want to sell, and he'll buy it. There you go. I sold. Um, I, don't, I don't know what to buy. Yes. <laughs> Sorry. Summer crops. Okay, so we need a tomato, a hot pepper, a blueberry, and a melon. 
And now, this is important. <laughs> we ideally should get a lot of melons because we need five gold star melons so uh for the community center so i would say if we do how do you know that like okay so if you if you hit if you open your inventory and then you go to the the little tree scroll thing on the right hand side uh mm, yes yeah okay. and then there's the tree on the right hand side and yeah. then in the in that first window, if you hover over the yellow one, it says summer crops bundle and it shows you which crops you need. Oh. So we need one of each of those. But then also in that bundle, there's the quality crops bundle, which is the blue one. And that you need three of the four things that it lists. Oh, okay. So yeah, so it's it's a lot. Um, so, but we do need a pepper, so wow. I'll get a pepper. These are from different seasons, right? The parsnips, melon, pumpkin, and corn? Yes. Wow. So parsnips are spring, melon right. is summer, pumpkins are fall, and then corn is summer and fall. Wow. Yeah. That's a so, lot. That's a lot. It is. It is a lot. <laughs> it's a lot. Um, we might not get it in the first year. We might have to have to work on it for the second year, but that's fine. Um, Tomato, hot pepper, blueberry, do... melon, not the best combo. I mean... I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it um, might might be good. I got some corn seeds. I'm gonna pick up a hops starter as well because they take forever to grow, but we need it for a quest for Pam eventually, and I don't want to wait a year on that. Um, okay, so we have 412. Do you want to buy as many melon seeds as you can, and we'll we'll go from we'll go from there. Just keep buying melon seeds. Yeah, just just buy a whole bunch of melon seeds. You can hold shift and click, and that'll also give you them. It. Yeah, okay, all right. <laughs> cool. we, got, we, got, we got five. That's. I mean, that's pretty good. That won't be the total number that we need, but you know, we can we can. I went shopping last night and picked up a sap on sale for only two G. Wonderful, Pam. It was gross. No wonder Pierre was selling that garbage for so cheap. Pam, what did you expect? It's tree sap. Like, did you eat it? Pam, Pam said, oh, my head hurts to me. <laughs> well, I mean, maybe if you're going around eating sap. I mean, maple syrup I can I can see, but just regular tree sap? Gonna get such a nice tan this summer. Just keep buying, keep buying, buy it all. <laughs> Lies, we might you actually, doing? I do have a couple things I can sell to Willie. I have some fish. I'm here. Oh, I'm but here. it's after five, so he's closed. Never mind. It's fine. It's uh, I. Okay. Time goes so fast in multiplayer, you guys. Are you saying it's not relaxing? It's relaxing. Fine, don't talk to me. Uh, well, one of you sold sap to Pierre then. We did, fine. We must have, yeah. Ooh, a rainbow shell. We need this eventually. Are you on the beach? Yeah. I'm on the beach, yeah. Did we, we also did this bit, right? The tide pools, cool. Doing pretty cool. See you later, today. Harold, no one, no worries. Thanks for dropping in. Glad you're doing good. What else? Anything so do, else? Do we rebuild all this stuff eventually? Yes. Well, or have no. the, have the opportunity to build it? The the stuff on the beach, no. There's some things around town that we rebuild, but none of it's on the beach. Unfortunately. I'll be like your big brother when you grow up. I mean, that's good. I'm glad that he looks up to his big brother. A gentle little sunbeam woke me up this morning. I've never felt so refreshed. Guess who I'm talking to? Oh, he's so dreamy. <laughs> Maybe that's why he lives in a cabin on the beach. Because because the gentle little sunbeams. But then he didn't realize it was going to be a, a spiders as well. But Maybe, that's, Maybe yeah, that's the thing. It's full of spiders. It's fine. Surprised when you were visiting Alaska and there was a place selling birch syrup. That I wouldn't have guessed, but birch beer is really good. It's like root beer, but um, but birch instead of sarsaparilla. That I think is root beer. That was um, that made. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. It's like root is beer. It? It's like root beer, but birch. Yeah, it's it's really tasty. So non maple tree sap isn't all that unrealistic as a food. That's true. That's true. That is true. Kennedy, hello. GG's unscrolling away your coconuts. 
I mean, rubber tree sap is rubber, so that wouldn't be very tasty. I mean, yeah, that would give you interject, you know, probably bind you up a little, maybe. I don't know. We have not good. I've had not that many. <laughs> I've had it was called birch beer. I don't know if it was like real birch beer, or just labeled mm -hmm. as such, but it was good. Yeah, I I had birch beer like the first time I had it, I was like 10 or something. And yeah. I was like, this is delicious. Why is this not being sold in more places? Same. And uh, yeah, and now I live in the UK and I don't think I've ever seen birch beer here. It's not, it's very much not common for whatever reason, but you can find it. It was called, uh, the place I had it the first time was, was hello, it was called Pioneer Days. It was like oh. all, all rustic, old timey stuff, mm -hmm. and that was the first place I had it. It was really good. Okay, right. Our ten seeds. Look, we're it's we're gonna have an empire. We're just in the starting phases of it. It's fine. Yeah. You're watching a YouTube video about a guy who tried to make maple alcohol and accidentally made maple vinegar instead, and now he has a vinegar making business. I mean, I, I actually I approve of that. Where he's right. like, well, I didn't make alcohol, but this is pretty good. So I guess. Right? Oh, birch beer uses birch oil, not tree sap. That's good to know, Glenn Pixie. That makes sense. That so, makes more sense, huh. actually. It does make more I, sense. I did, I did find trash. It's junk. Yeah, we can recycle that eventually. It's in the middle chest. Um, but, uh, okay. Cool. First beer's am good. I, Haven't I... had it in a while, right? Kate and Dragon, hello. Or it's bed. Is it time? Oh, it's bedtime. It's, yeah. If, if we want that sweet, sweet energy in the morning. <laughs> sweet, sweet. I do want sweet. Energy. We've learned our lesson from last yeah, time. It's bad. Yeah, yeah. We don't get the energy. It's like, oh no, birch beer. Yeah. Yes. See, there we go. Now we can buy more melons if we want to. We can also, can we make fertilizer yet? Probably not. Have you never had gin? It's good. Okay. What luck have we got? Spirits are very displeased. Let's not go to the mines today. Uh oh. Um, I just got pine tar. Oh. Cool. Oh right, because we had we had a tapper and we put it up here. Yeah. Cool. Nice. Woo. Um. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what I to might, do with it, but I'm happy that we have it. I'm happy. I might swap it from the pine tree. Mm hmm. And put it on this little scraggly tree, because I believe that these ones are the maple trees. They're either maple or oak, and both maple and oak are. A useful and B uh, sell for more. So, <laughs> so the pine tar it, it works once we have sheep. It's useful, but it's it's less useful until we have sheep. Okay, we could go buy more melons. We could. I mean, if they take a long time to grow, now would be the time, right? Yeah, we probably should. Oh, that was what I was going to do is look at. Okay, so we can make basic fertilizer from sap. Okay, so let's do like a bunch of fertilizer. And let's just, this is just going to, oh, really? Because sometimes it doesn't have to, see? Oh, it, what? <laughs> Wait, you, you what? Can't, you, you can't fertilize the melons? I, I guess you can fertilize the seeds, but you can't fertilize once it's grown into a little plant. So that's uh, fine. Can, here, let's go. Let's go buy more melons. I and got then you. We'll, we'll so you, you got to put it. Well, I mean, actually, that makes sense because fertilizer will burn your crop sometimes. So. It does. I think I've just gotten too used to um, doing it. The, I think I've done it the same day every time I've fertilized something mm. or I may have been playing a modded version where that was possible. I don't remember. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, Grace said, <laughs> I don't keep my mods straight. <laughs> Grace confirms only seeds. Only seeds. That so makes. Sad. I mean, when you plant a real garden, it makes sense. It's pretty much how it is. It does. It does. Abigail wants to pull a prank on her dad and give him some wheat, but there's no way we're going to get wheat in time. So, too bad, mm. Abigail. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Melons. We got four more melons. 
Yay. I can fertilize those ones. So hopefully, hopefully we get, <laughs> <laughs> hopefully between them. Now, is they there, take 12 days, my goodness. Are there like special parameters for growing melons? Like if you, you know how in Minecraft, if you alternate your crop, they grow faster. Oh, I wish. Is I there, wish is there mechanics any, like that existed there, in farming sim games, but there, no. There's no tricks like, like you'd think there'd be more things no. like that in a farming sim game, you know? There is stuff called speed grow, if it, like where eventually we'll have enough oh um ignore ignore my weird planting of the it's fine you know sometimes i'm organized and sometimes i'm not it's it's fine i mean it's fine i mean it's they're planted they're planted they're just we just have this one if anybody has ocd don't look it's fine oh don't watch me play anything if you no know. <laughs> if you have ocd yeah you're not gonna be you're not gonna have a good time uh, <laughs> ask anybody okay. in my chat about my organization it's, it's literally uh, everywhere <laughs> That's not where sap goes. Put sap in here. Okay. All right. Um, what do we want to do? Should we maybe, uh, maybe we should fish. Oh maybe my goodness. Fish. All right. Fine. I know, but like there's, there's less to do right this in, although we are looking for forageables. Okay. Wait, maybe let's not fish. Let's, let's find any excuse not to fish. <laughs> wow. Wow. Okay. It's fine. Everything's fine. I'm not making a Pinterest worthy farm. No, sorry. No, not <laughs> not at the moment, but we will probably like I will. You I'll will make a Pinterest worthy yeah. farm. Yeah, somebody will. Not somebody me. will. <laughs> not, not me. Once I've finished organizing the chests for the 57th time, I'll uh, I'll I'll build a Pinterest worthy farm. Don't leave. I'm learning. <laughs> <laughs> oh sorry i'm i'm already in the woods hold on <laughs> you're fine i'm just wandering around looking for forageables yeah that's all i'm doing and then also doing some of this the no. better fishing mod exists for a reason i know but i was like oh we should do a vanilla playthrough so that tadpole gets the vanilla experience right then i can hate it like I everybody very, else and go i was very <laughs> tempted to install better fishing because uh, it's it's such a game changer for those of us who are not fans of the fishing mini game right. <laughs> in Star. But this way I can hate it like everybody else and be like, yes, we need that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, so far I've found one flower, so you know we're we're moving up in the world. It's we're doing well. We've got we've got a single flower. Hey, that's more one more than we had when we started. That's true. Maybe we'll have more. Maybe? I mean, the spirits are very displeased today. There's a reason we're not in the mines. So Why are they how so... does better fishing change? Why? So be better, the better fishing mod, basically once you get a hit on the fishing rod with a fish, like as soon as you click to go into the fishing mini game, it auto completes for you. Okay, L wait a minute. <laughs> yeah, so you you get a perfect catch every time, and if any treasure chests pop up, you also get the treasure chest automatically. <laughs> I love it's, it. It's basically yeah, it's basically like um like Animal Crossing insta fishing. Fish. Yeah, insta fishing. Yeah, it's insta fishing. <laughs> it's uh yeah, it's so nice. <laughs> it's so nice. The wood does not despawn, Kiki. Right? If I remember, it just stays. Uh, Stays there until you pick it up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, oh, here we go. Here's a spice berry. Okay, so we just need one more. There you go. You found a spice berry. So we just need one more thing for the summer foraging bundle, which is the. Uh, nope, this is not it. It's the plum thing or the grape. It's the grape. I always get them confused about which one is available when. So maybe we'll go to the mountain. See if there's a grape up there. Because then we could complete a, a bundle in the community center, which would be helpful. Now, do grapes spawn just regular on the ground like that too? Or are they like yeah, in a, in they a bush? Yeah, they do. You can, you can grow them, but no, they're just, they, they spawn on the ground like that. Okay. When playing any game with Tadpole, an auto-sorter would be best. Wow. 
<laughs> you're not wrong. I mean, you're not wrong. I'm I'm horrible. Yeah. But like, I don't know. That's why I like Minecraft. I can just, I don't have to be organized, you know? Like in your real everyday life, it makes everything more efficient when you're organized and everything's in its place and you can function better, you know? I look at Minecraft as I don't have to be that meticulous. I can just enjoy and th like the world is my storage chest. You know, it, I'm talking single player world, not SMP, obviously. Mm -hmm. but like yeah. it, it's, I don't, I can do whatever I want. It, there's no time limit. I can, you know, there's no time frame. I'm not under a crunch to do things. It just takes as long as it takes, it's, which I love, you know? <laughs> So I just went and talked to Maru and she just goes, we look totally different. And I'm assuming, I think I must have spoken to her earlier today. And she was saying that Sebastian is her half brother. Yeah. But, but I did just like walk up to her and she randomly goes, we look totally different. I was like, you mean from me? Wow. <laughs> what, what do you mean? You sure do. But no, it's, it's fine. Everything's fine. All good. Come on, grapes. What is that? Is that grapes? Are grapes purple? I can't pick it up, though. They are purple. It's like behind this bush and I can't grab it? Oh, that might be... I think that's just a, a decorative flower. Oh, uh, well, it's like highlighting. Something. That's weird. Oh, weird. It's fine. You're awake, stars? Hello, wake up! Are we awake? Gigi's <laughs> I'm being awake. That's just the map? Okay. How are you doing today? <laughs> I can warn. Dragon says, Dragon says that your nine lives basement might not agree with you. It's so bad. It's so bad. <laughs> uh, if it wasn't for Nushi on nine lives, it'd be like, it's just terrible. <laughs> Nushi is definitely keeping everything organized and I'm just like throwing everything everywhere. <laughs> I feel so bad. You're wonderful. I'm glad you're wonderful, Stars. Thank you for stopping in. Did we already come to the ocean today? I've lost track of what um, we've done today. I, I did. I don't it. think we did. I don't know if you did. I did not. I'm I'm at the beach now, but there's nothing here really, so it's fine. A day of foraging where I hoped to find the entire summer foraging bundle, and we didn't. It's fine. I'll get over it. Oh, probably. Completionist fail. Melly, yeah. hello. How you doing? What mod pack is this? <laughs> <laughs> is this Minecraft? You what can actually this? play Stardew Valley in Minecraft, or like there's a there's a mod pack that has attempted to replicate Stardew Valley. Really? Um, I think it's just called Farming Valley. Huh. Uh, it's old though. It's uh, I mean like it it works on I think it's 1.12. It might even be 1.10. Oh wow. Um, so there's a yeah there's a lot that's not in there. I played some of it. And I was like, oh, this is, this is, I mean, it's pretty good for a, a mod that is designed for that version of Minecraft. Mm -hmm. I just uh, struggled to get into it because, <laughs> because it just, I don't know, it just wasn't the same. I'm like, okay, never mind. You all right, Melly? I'm doing good. I hope you're feeling okay. Here. Let me, let me in. What do I do with the spice berry? If we hang on to it for now, because I'm a hoarder in this game. You? You know what? Actually, we probably have. Yeah, I don't know if you've noticed. I'm slightly, <laughs> uh, maybe kind of, sort of, sometimes. <laughs> no! What? No, you're feeling decent, which is nice. I'm glad you're feeling de decent. We do. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna do some I love organization. How, I Just love organization. I love the fireflies. They're cool. I really like the fireflies. I wish that you could interact with them, Same. but uh, but you can't. But it is cool to just see them on the dark screen, just kind of floating around like an actual firefly. Really neat. Yeah. I really like it. If only if only we could have them in Minecraft. Nope. I mean, I get that we shouldn't feed them to the frogs in Minecraft, but I would really love to just have them in Minecraft. Um, decorative bowl? Can we place this decoration? No. Okay. okay, all right. I We're going to, it's mean, fine. I didn't mean to move that. Oh, sleepies. All right. I'm going sleepies. 
Okay. I will join you in just a second. I'm just organizing things. Don't mind me. You just never sleep. You're just like, we stay up all night. <laughs> it's it's fine. It's all fine. I just I need I need the chests to be organized. <laughs> they'll be there it's in good. the they'll be there in the morning. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Did we sell anything today? I don't think we did. No, we wandered around. Oh, there's an earthquake. What? what I does... forgot about the earthquake. What does there, that... The earthquake happened. Okay, we're going on an adventure today. There was an earthquake during the night. Check your luck. Neutral. That's fine. Is it going to rain tomorrow? No. That's fine. It's summer. Wednesday. Did you oh, it's a rerun. Wait, I have mail. Oh, mm-hmm. I'm gonna my let you read this. I lost my mm -hmm. lucky purple shorts. I'm telling you because I think I can trust you. If you find them, bring them back to me discreetly. I'll pay well. Mayor Lewis, what were you doing to lose your shorts? Well, wouldn't you like to know? I, I actually, I well, I don't. Do I want to know? <laughs> I don't know if you do. I mean, I kind of do, but. Do I, I mean, we're going to have to find them anyway. I know I know where they are. Um, similar to the lost axe, they're in the same place no matter what. Oh. Um, we might not be able to get to that place yet, though. Nope. I can't, at least. So, uh, you know, it's, how do you, it's how, fine. How do you know? How do I? Because I've played the game before. Oh, how do you know if you can enter the, the yeah. location? Uh, you have to be friends with somebody. Oh. You have to, they're, <laughs> yeah. Hey, Loopy. Thank you for the creeper while I'm not paying attention. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. It's okay, fine. Okay, I'm going to show you a new place. There's a new place we can go. We can go up this way. There's a lot. We're going to go into the mountain. I'm not friends with a lot of people. <sighs> yeah, I'm, I'm not friends with a lot of people, too. I think the... Is, am I like actual friends vincent we can get into vincent's room i don't know if we should though i don't know <laughs> i don't know if grown adults should be walking into a boy's room <laughs> randomly no like, I, here, I, I yeah have I, a grape i don't um, think so either i mean yeah yeah okay up here this opened up thank you for this, this hydrate what is this this is the spa slash bathhouse um if you okay, so this is not very useful to us in multiplayer. Um, but if you go in here and you go through a whole bunch of different screens, walking very slowly, then you can get into a hot tub and it'll restore your energy. Oh. And it still works in multiplayer, but we can already do that just by like not sleeping. So um, it's more like if you're up this way and you need more energy, then this will be faster than going back to the farm to get more energy. And then there's also there trains happen. Trains pass through Stardew sometimes, and sometimes they drop stuff. And then also, also, the wizard's ex-wife lives up this way. Oh, okay. So, Very you know, nice. it's just, it's just a, a, a fun place of possibility. My, ch my chat has questions. Which questions? Well, there's get into someone's room. Hmm. Uh -huh. um, yeah, we have to get into. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yep. Exactly. What kind? Air quotes of lucky shorts are those? Hmm. Well, we'll find out soon enough. <laughs> well, actually, it might not be soon. We still need to be friends with that person. Do you do you want do you want the the lore? It's not even lore. Do you want to know where the shorts are? Do you want me to show you where the shorts are? Uh, yes. I can show you where Lewis's lucky purple shorts are. Okay. Are they? I'm concerned. You're concerned? You should be. Here, let's go back to the farm. That's, that doesn't make me feel better. They're not on the farm, I promise. <laughs> also, thank you so much for following Canadian Jen. Welcome in. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna show you. This is, this is, I mean, we've already discovered that Lewis has uh, his priorities kind of wrong. Well, I mean, Lewis creeps around in the middle of the night at our farm anyways. He does, and he now, does. And now he's doing it shortsless. Like. Well, he's creeping around uh, somewhere else. Hello, I'm stuck. Okay, here we go. Are you ready? 
Why are we going in here? <laughs> what, because you wanted me to show you where <laughs> Lewis's lucky pu purple shorts are. <laughs> Whose room They're is through this? through that door. It's in Marnie's room? How They're did, in Marnie's how, room. How did Lewis's lucky shorts get in Marnie's room? How do you think, Tadpole? Uh, no. Look, he's even here. He could pick up his shorts himself. Uh, he could just get them himself. He's right here. Start to be sketchy, no, right? He's he's getting us to do his dirty work for him. Wait a minute. What did you just tell me? I'm just here to make sure all Marnie's business needs are met. Yup. Yup. <laughs> sus. Yes, Moon. Business? <laughs> so sus. Start to be sketchy. I thought this was like a wholesome game. What is going on? I mean, on? It, it is, but... No, um... no, no, no. Absolutely not. <laughs> And then Marnie is just here being like, you can use a scythe to cut feed from grass. Or like, thanks, Marnie. That's helpful. Or you can buy it from me, of course. Wonderful. Can you let us in into your room? Does Marnie like, here's a question. I'm going to I'm going to try and uh. not use <laughs> the wiki while we're playing this on stream. So Marnie, here's a question. Do you like salmon berries? This might tank my friendship with Marnie. I'm not sure. Oh, I guess I'll take it. Okay, well, that's more neutral, I think. Probably. <laughs> Hopefully. Maybe she likes... Well, I almost said no. I was looking at what I have in my inventory, and I have stone, wood, and oh. clay. Guess what I almost said? I wonder if she likes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, mm -hmm. you can try. Nope, I'm but... glad. I, I, nope, I'm not going to say it. Mm -hmm. Right. Well, for the record, she doesn't like salmon berries, so don't give her a salmon berry. Just, just FYI. That's good. Okay. That's good to know. Good so, to yeah. know. So that's where the shorts are. We still need a grape. Right. We're finding do grapes. We, grapes. Yeah. Do we want to find grapes or do we want to just go to the mines? We can do whatever. I don't know. Whatever you think is best. It doesn't matter. Let's maybe, Maybe, maybe let's go to the mines. I know that it's 3 p.m., but if we can get through the dark levels, I know it, we're, it, we're also on neutral luck, but it's fine. Nobody <laughs> likes spending much time in the neutral, in the, in the dark levels anyway. So, uh, we don't, we don't need treasure. It's all good. <laughs> Melly, where did you find the air quote finger emotes? <laughs> <laughs> okay, hold on. Sorry. I need to, I need to see this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Etsy. Oh my Dang gosh. Hilarious. Etsy. You oh, that's amazing. You Oops, can't I do that. You can't do that. Ground. That's hilarious. That's, that's amazing. <laughs> that's so good. Okay. All right. Let's go to the mines and see if we can. Oh no. We can get some um, further down. <laughs> It'll be wholesome as long as you give Lewis his shorts back. That's, yeah, that's true. We, uh, we need to, although... I have, I have so many questions. I you know so, how he says that you have to do it discreetly? That's you, the, that's, two, yeah, that's why it makes me so... I have questions when you put that in there. Yes, well, there are two ways There are two ways in Stardew Valley that you can do it not discreetly, oh. um, just as an FYI. So, Linus, eventually, I promise you'll trust me. Is it... Can I give you another salmon berry? Yeah, great gift. Wonderful. I haven't given. <laughs> I haven't not given him anything yet. It's fine. He doesn't trust me. That He'll get and there. And are powerful combinations. Oh my goodness. The air, the air <laughs> quotes and brows. Oh my gosh. Oh god. Okay. <sighs> put him in the um, soup. We can put shorts in the soup. What? Yeah, you can put shorts in the soup. That's one of the ways <laughs> that it's not discreet. <laughs> he gets very angry, especially because the governor is there. <laughs> It's really funny. <laughs> no one trusts Tapple. They don't. He deserves oh, the hey. eat shorts. Staircase. Marcus, oh, and hello. another staircase. Look at this. Speed run. Look at us go. Speed run. <laughs> Get through these dark, dark levels. You're like just finding everything. I'm like, oh, what's this? What's this? Like, no. Am I fine? I don't know. I'm just kind of running around and they happen to be there. Mm. I feel like me stumbling upon something first doesn't count necessarily as finding it. Watch out. How how has this dude avoided you completely and come after me? Um, I don't know. You got this. I do. No. I promise I do. <laughs> Corbanic. Hello. How you doing? 
<laughs> Thank you, Kiki. Nice, nice. Whoever just jump scared Tadpole, <sighs> well done. Wait, we can be, we can, we can be, we can not give the mayor back his shorts. You could just hold on to them for forever if you want. Can we use them as um, some sort of blackmail? No. Or you no. can really only use them. Oh, hey, I found a staircase okay. by killing a bat. Oh, hey, GG. Sorry, bat. I didn't know if maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Shorts soup. We can wear them. Gross. So if I wear them in front of the mayor, what does that do? Wait, can you actually wear them? I didn't know you could wear them. I have more questions. I would love it if we had gotten a slightly better weapon on floor 30. That would have been nice. Then it wouldn't take forever. <laughs> Wait, did you already do the, the yeah. coal in the coal truck? <laughs> yeah. Coal mine minecart? Yeah. While you were like fighting all the all the things, you can. You can... I didn't realize that that was individual, that like you can both do it. Oh. So that's cool. <laughs> Marcus. That's helpful. That's good to know. So we can wear the shorts, I'm being told. You can wear the shorts. Okay. I heard I heard a dude. Is that over? Oh, I'm hearing a certain amount of. Okay, you can get him. We have, we haven't like, oh, hold on. Please don't. <laughs> oh, the staircase is back over here. How'd you find it? I just ran around with a torch in the dark patches. It's over, yeah, there uh, you go. It's well, over by the ladder. It's okay. right here. <laughs> it was there the whole of time. Of course. Of course. Yep. I was like, it's taking a while for us to find a staircase just by mining. Is there, are we sure there isn't one hidden in the dark? And you want to wear another right person's there. dirty shorts? I mean. Oh, that's true. That is kind of gross. Mm hmm. Yeah, maybe let's not. We could, I wonder if, can you give the mayor's shorts to other people? Is that a thing you can do in my, in, I was about to say Minecraft, but, um, in starting. Dude. Found it. Okay. Found cool. it. Oh my goodness, Geeky. Oh, yes. We're done with the dark levels. We're into the icy levels where our pickaxes won't be as good. And we have a slingshot that I'm really bad at using. Slingshot. You made short soup your first playthrough, Glam Pixie. My goodness. Um, I'm going to I'm going to go up and empty my inventory and then come back down. What do you mean? You went up the ladder? Yeah. So if you go if you go up Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. Then you go back to the entrance, and then we can take the elevator back to where we just were. Do you have to have weapons for the slingshot, or is it just... You need to have ammo, but I think stones work. So you can take some of the stones, if you want, from the chest. Oh, do they work? Yeah, I, I think so. I'm just really bad at uh, using the slingshot. I don't know. Mm, don't think you can crap. You can't gift them to others. Mm, that would be oh, so cool. That's it, sad. That'd be cool if you could though. Like, it would be. Hey, I found a thing. <laughs> <laughs> so the loophole to give the shorts back faster. You can craft a staircase and place it where pants go, and they turn into shorts. What? Wait, what? What'd you? I say? mean, I don't know that I want to test that. I I'm gonna be honest. I always feel sad. Killing um, these guys. It's 1 a.m. Oh. Uh, okay, well, hold on. Okay, all right. We maybe should have paid attention to that. We're going to... Hold on. Okay. Leave the mine. Leave. Leave the mine. Yeah, leave the no. mine. <laughs> leave. Leave now. Put my stuff in there. Okay. Um, One, 1.30. Not going to make it. No, not at all. Not remotely. 
But you know, so long as we're we're not in the mine, so that'll help. And we only have 16 gold, so it's not like they can charge us that much. We're gonna They'll be probably in... charge us 16 gold. <laughs> we're gonna, gonna be, be in debt. It's legit, Melanie. Mm. Oh no, I didn't even make it no. to the farm plot. <laughs> Marcus, you're right. We did not pass. <laughs> I love Robert Skitch tried to warn me in chat. I just wasn't looking at chat because I was looking at yeah. Mm -hmm. It's fine. We're fine. Look, they only charge two gold. We're fine. We're fine. Yay! We're rich. It's fine. <laughs> but we have half health. And Linus found us last night. So, you know, he's, you know, maybe doesn't hate us as much as, I mean, well, he doesn't say that he hates us, in fairness. Doesn't to, uh, like to Linus. us. Doesn't like us either. No, not yet. They kind of did pass out. We did. We did. We did. It's yeah, so much, it, it's just so much fun. Passed out. Like, it's too much fun to pay attention. Yeah. It's, you know, when you're dealing with purple shorts. Right. I, right. Sometimes, yeah. The, sometimes the, you pass out. The purple short talk was just too much. The purple short chat was, yeah, we had to. <laughs> Robert Skitch says, I'll warn you when it's 11 p.m. next time. Um, I appreciate the effort, Robert Skitch. No guarantees that I will notice. Uh, <laughs> our, our luck is. I will do my best, though. We're neutral today. Um, maybe, maybe I'll have like a sound command that's like, get to bed or something. Oh yeah, there use. you go. There you go. I, uh, yeah, neutral today. Okay. Um, do we want to go? Oh, everybody take a drink. Thank you, dragon for that hydrate. Uh, also this is your, uh, reminder. If you take medications at this time of day for wherever you are and you haven't taken them yet, take those medications. Getting into Valkyrie other people's kiss. shorts can be, yes. Also, stretch. Thank you, Moon, for the stretch. Oh, gosh. We should, we probably should take like a brief break soon. Maybe, yeah. maybe if we sell something today, then we can be on that screen where, um, here, let me sell something now before I forget about it. <laughs> <laughs> because chances are I'm going to forget about it. Here, we'll sell, we'll sell, nope, not the whole thing. We'll sell, I've been playing a lot of Palea. And Palea, the mouse controls are the exact opposite of Stardew Valley. <laughs> so, oh, really? So, uh, yeah. So we'll sell one sap, and that'll work. The sound of phantoms, Lazugod, you're on to something. Um, nothing, nothing works better than striking fear into our hearts. Uh, okay. What do we do? We want to? We could go to the mines again, or we could go to <laughs> the. We could fish. I don't really want to fish. I don't either. We could go to the mines again. Yeah, that's fine. If you need, if, if you want to take a break, we can always like pause the game and hop out, go take a break, and come back. It doesn't matter to me. I'd say let's get through this day, and then we'll take a break when we're on the screen where stuff gets sold. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. A grape. Okay, hey. never mind. We're completing a we're completing a bundle. We're completing a bundle. <laughs> <laughs> Pivot. Oh, it's also Jazz's birthday. Hold on. Happy birthday! Jazz likes... What does Jazz like? Jazz likes a daffodil. Squirrel! So if you grab, right? <laughs> if you grab one of the gold star daffodils that's in here, we'll give that to Jazz. A, a, a star daffodil? A gold star daffodil. Right. Yeah. Uh, Grace says the host can also type slash pause in game to pause it and slash resume. Uh to play a game. So, okay. I didn't know that. Thank you. That yeah. I didn't know that either. I've never played multiplayer before. Okay. Great. Let's see if we can find Jazz first and yeah. give her the daffodil. Yeah. Grace is a and knower. Then, <laughs> and then we'll uh we'll do the community center bundle and get summer seeds and then we can plant the summer seeds and then we have a lot more crops without having to pay anything. My chat is still There's several in my chat still on the uh the lucky shorts. The purple shorts. Yeah. <laughs> Mm hmm 100%. Hey, Jazz, here's a daffodil. A birthday gift? That's very kind of you. I love it. Wonderful. I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. Okay, see, um, I did just give you a birthday gift, but, you know, I guess we can be strangers if you want. I am now... <laughs> Yay! I'm now... I have the most friendship with the two children and Linus. 
<laughs> yeah. So you know, I'm doing great with the with the adults in town. Let's um, see. It's, it's fine. Yeah, Jess and Vincent are two stars. Yeah. That's it. Just those two. Yeah, we kind of ignored everybody else's birthdays in spring because, um, look, last stream was chaos. If you weren't here, you should check the VOD because, my goodness. Um, but, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Indeed. It wasn't, I, I wouldn't say it was like utter panic, but it was it was up there. <laughs> it's fine. Every, amount of, everything's fine. It's fine. All right, Lewis says the saloon gets lively at night. And then he says, sometimes we even... Oh, wait a minute. Is he not? Oh, sometimes he says, sometimes we even put a coin in the old jukebox. <laughs> it's like only sometimes. Mm. Why not Why not use the jukebox all the time? Really? All right, sorry. I'm, I'm zooming ahead. I've zoomed over to the community center. <laughs> it was fine. Exactly. Oh, hey, sweet pea. And also, hello, Demetrius. How's the farming business going? It's tomato season, isn't it? It is tomato season, but they're not grown yet. Demetrius, I think, likes tomatoes, but I'm gonna see if he likes sweet peas. Do you do you like sweet peas? Thank you. This is a very interesting specimen. Hey, he liked it better than the salmon berry. Oh no! That's I, wrong. I don't even. What was that? <laughs> he likes it. That's pretty good. Was it a salmon berry? No, it wasn't him. Either way, he liked my current gift. If you know, if you know Ted, you know chaos. What do you mean? I'm not chaos. 100%. Also, um, as per tradition, all of the blame for the chaos goes to Tadpole. Wow. Wow. No. Look, hashtag blame Tadpole. It's I didn't. <laughs> it's, I didn't create it. I'm just following traditions here. Oh. No. I could have, oh well. That's fine. We'll do the star sweepy. It's fine. It's not my fault. <laughs> It's it's totally your fault. And look, we've unlocked another one. So we <sighs> unlock. There's so the many. Bulletin board. So we've already. Oh, OK. So we've already unlocked the adventures bundle. I didn't remember doing that. <laughs> yeah, we did. We did something last time. Geologist Sh one. Cool. Chefs. The dies. Oh, my goodness. There's so many. Mm-hmm. The bulletin board one is the hardest one, in my opinion. Of because course. it's like the it's it's a bunch of random stuff. Mm-hmm. I noticed yeah. that. Lots of randoms. Mm -hmm. Not mm -hmm. tadpole's fault. Yeah, write that down. <laughs> Not tadpole's fault. I I I gotta call fake news on that one. It's always tadpole's fault. Well, I'm, That's how this works. I'm so innocent. <laughs> Are you though? Are you really? Are you sure? <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's go play at these seeds. <laughs> now that now that we've all blamed Tadpole for everything. Wait, hold on. Hello, Sebastian. Talk to me. Uh, Hello. Sebastian. Definitely don't want to go swimming if that's what you're going to ask. No, uh, I wasn't. But um, I'm glad to know. Do you like these? Oh, maybe not. Okay. Maybe people don't like salmon berries except for Linus. But Sebastian's a mind reader. <laughs> Rev, thank you for the lurk. I don't know what to say to this for Maru. I've decided I'm gonna build a robot someday. Either that should be very easy for you, you should be more realistic or it sounds challenging. And I feel like you should be more realistic as mean, but something being very easy, I feel like, I'm gonna say sounds challenging. You're right, but I love a challenge. Okay, there we go. Nope. Good. I picked the top one. <laughs> the, which one? The, should be, e um, should be easy should be for easy? you, yeah. What did she say? That's very flattering. Are you just trying okay. to flatter me? I don't know. All right. Something like that. That works. Along those That's lines. Good. There's a sweet pea to the right. We missed a sweet pea. You can you can get it. Do we need it? Wait, to the to the right of the community center? Tapa was innocent. Freezing is important. No, no. Here, I'll go this way, you go that way, and one of us will find it. <laughs> I'm always innocent. So what's this? 30 copper ore, Clint. That's a lot. I mean, I say that. Maybe we do actually have that much copper ore, but um, have we not found the sweet pea? I don't know. I don't know what sweet pea looks like. Oh, yeah. it's it's this. I found it. At There's this one. Three. Right. There. Oh, nice. I didn't know what it looked like. 
Yeah, that's that's hard to look for something that you don't know what it looks like. Thanks, Grace. <laughs> Dragon says, is it only when you're streaming with Tadpole that we hashtag blame Tadpole or is it always? I am going to leave that up to you, Dragon. Never. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave it up to you. <laughs> The fishing bundle being the hardest. That's true. The fishing one can be can be quite difficult. I feel like the the fishing bundle I care less about, like the fish tank. I mean, like it's fine, <laughs> but the reward for it is kind of meh, in in my opinion. Whereas the bulletin board <laughs> one, you get two hearts with everybody, and so I I just remember that being a struggle. Uh, Little Red, I didn't realize you were the Queen of England. Congratulations. Little Red's the Queen of England. Yeah. Because if oh, I'm, I didn't know that. If, I, if I'm innocent, Little Red's the Queen of England. So, congrats. Oh, congrats, oh. Congrats. Mm, I feel like <laughs> that's a totally different situation, Tadpole. No, I mean, it's the internet. Nobody lies, right? Uh huh. You're not going to type something and it's going to be false. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. Man, look at all these crops we have. Do we, we're not, what level are we at? We are at level two farming. We could actually make some sprinklers, but it would require iron. That's we fine. We don't okay. have, so do we craft iron or do we find it like copper? We find Hello, it like copper, but in the icy levels. Friend. So the levels that we just got to. Okay. I've come to talk with you again. <laughs> it's, it's dark out, right? Stop with the finger. <laughs> Lies on the internet, never, never. <laughs> Like when Tabo claims innocence. What do you mean, Marcus? No, no. Yep. You're saying Tadpole is innocent. That's what you're... The See, chat the, knows. The main takeaway is Tadpole is innocent. Is the thing... No, I don't think so. But they're so fun. <laughs> chat never lies. Yeah, see, Clara... No. Clara's sitting there telling us the truth. Mm -hmm. Chat never lies. Right. How it goes. Sure, 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 sure. <laughs> okay. We're gonna wait. We're gonna we're gonna take a quick break, guys, <laughs> while we while we sit on this uh scene where we sold one sap for two G. Woohoo! Uh, <laughs> so smart of ours of us. we we know what we're doing in this game. It's fine. We're... It's only day four of summer. We have played like a week in game. <laughs> yeah, Glam Pixie. Yes, fire plus existential crisis duck. That's that's <laughs> about the mood we're in. <laughs> we're winning. <laughs> Random fact, oh. the blue part on the bottom of this is a Stardew board game box. Oh, of your emote. Nice. That is so cool. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I haven't played the Stardew Valley um, box board game. That's, I, words, I can I can word good sometimes. Well, I'm glad. It's a, it's a thing. I'm glad one of us can <laughs> because I'm hot. <laughs> yeah. Robert Skitch says 2G. Does that make it GG? I mean, I feel like it does. Yeah. For SAP. Right. You know, it's, yeah. Yep. Day, okay. Day four so summer. GG. Let's, <laughs> let's take a quick break. Yes. <laughs> and, uh, yes. Um, everybody, uh, I'm going to play a three minute ad just so that I can disable pre rolls. Mm -hmm. um, so, th just FYI. But you won't really miss anything because we're going to be taking a break anyway. That's right. Quick break. Yep. All right. Um, be right back, guys. Be right back.
Hey guys. <laughs> Did you enjoy the crickets? All the crickets. Cricket, cricket. <laughs> so many crickets. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Thanks for the welcome back. It was silent. Yeah, I know. There's crickets here. I, after I, I got up, uh, I was like, oh man, the whole time. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I was like, oh man, I should have turned the music on because there's nothing. Usually we have music. It just keeps playing on the BRE screen and there was no music. I had to hear my own thought. <laughs> oh, thoughts, not the thoughts. Oh no. No. <laughs> Oh man. I'm so sorry, right? <laughs> Hello. Hello. <laughs> I was muted. That's fine. Sorry. So was I. <laughs> yeah. It works. It's fine. Hello. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Here, right. wait. Let me get back into Stardew screen. Do, 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 do. I, I muted to go to break, and then I didn't put my music back on that I always have playing in the background. So everybody had to sit in silence. Mm. They were not happy. Yeah. <laughs> Oops. Oops. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. All right, here we go. Are we ready for day five of summer? Yeah, let's go. I mean, we're as ready as we'll ever be, at least. So, you know, it works. The spirits are somewhat annoyed today. So, you know, apparently they're not ready for, for the fifth of summer. They are not ready. <laughs> they're not. They're not interested. They're not having it. So do you get um, experience for farming for watering crops or is it only for harvesting? No, it's only for harvesting. Okay. Which is sad. Well, I mean, I wish it weren't so. <laughs> I wish you could get some experience for watering. Right. You do get like more experience for harvesting a crop than you would for like picking up one of the items that spawns on the ground kind of thing, but no. Uh, you also do get points for like taking care of animals. So if you say hello to them and if you like milk a cow or pick up some chicken eggs then that also counts but otherwise no dice mm. um it's friday so we should be available to go and see people at the saloon because that's the easiest way to get friendship points in this game oh that's right let's go see all the people that hang out at the bar yeah <laughs> so i i hate to do this but maybe we should maybe we should fish wow all right Maybe I mean, we should. I mean, it's part of the game. It's part of the game. It's fine. I'm going to, I'm going to, I say we fish in the, where am I? I'm stuck. Hold on. I say we fish in the, in the woods. Where? Because there's a fish just down where Marnie's ranch is. Because there's a fish that, um, spawns here that you can fish in summer oh. from the river. But I think it's only in this map. Hydrate at the bar. <laughs> yeah, we're going to hydrate at the bar. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> so um, as as an archaeologist, archaeology has a pretty heavy drinking culture, uh, which I don't generally partake in the actual alcohol consumption. But like I have spent a lot of time in pubs as an archaeologist. <laughs> and uh, oh, gosh, hold on. Really difficult fish. There's no way. GG. <laughs> okay. Well. Mm. Almost um, so close. Not even. It was that was so bad. Uh so Oh. 
so there, okay, so like every week there would be this lecture series in the department where it's like, okay, at 4 p.m., there's a guest speaker who gives a talk for like an hour and then everybody goes to the pub at like five, mm -hmm. right? And what that means generally as, as somebody who did a lot of these as a PhD student or went to a lot of these as a PhD student is that you haven't eaten since lunch. It's now dinner time and uh, it's you're hungry. Okay, all right. I can't talk and fish at the same time. <laughs> um, it, it, so, it, is, uh, it is difficult. It is difficult. So, uh, so, um, so basically you haven't, you don't necessarily have food in your stomach when you're having the alcohol and they'll like people will stay there for like three hours and so like a friend of mine would just um they would just order a guinness mm -hmm. and be like well but it's you know it says it's basically a meal right so that's fine <laughs> every time we'd have to be like no <laughs> that's not how this works <laughs> so uh so yeah well i mean that's they're not wrong Oh my gosh, what is with these fish? Okay, I, I refuse to fish here anymore. Well, I got one fish <laughs> so far. You got one? Which yeah. one did you get? Uh, Sunfish. It's got a silver that's, silver star on it. That's pretty good. I keep getting... So there's like a Dorado that you can get in summertime there. Mm -hmm. And I think I keep hit it, hit, hooking Dorado or Pike. And I'm not good enough to get them yet. <laughs> so I'm going somewhere where the Dorado aren't so that I have a higher chance of getting sunfish. I mean, I was just happy I got a fish. Oh, hey. Uh, yeah. A trout. At at the level that we're at, oh. sunfish and rainbow <laughs> trout are good, good, uh, geeky, what was that noise? It was was a that a Ravik? It was a creeper. It was geeky. A creeper. <laughs> nice geeky. I love that they can still jump scare you with creeper noises, even though we're not playing the creeper game. I don't think it matters. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it's, it comes out of nowhere. It's not like there's a, a warning or a flash or like the text is on the in the chat first so it's just like a this explosion out of nowhere you know <laughs> so, yeah it gets me like cereal with mountain dew excellent breakfast exactly <laughs> i don't know i don't know i i've spent three hours in a bar before but i don't know about having conversations after <laughs> so long. Yeah. Conversations with colleagues even. At least, yeah, like I caught a pike. GG's. I have a, a oh my gosh. shrieker yelling at me. <laughs> <laughs> Another sunfish. A new record. Needs to be an easier fish to catch. Okay, this is significantly easier. That's good. Be, be like a I don't know, a smallmouth <laughs> bass or something. Do -do. Rainbow trout. Okay, well, <laughs> that also works. When, uh, when I was doing my PhD, we would be... Because when you do a PhD, you're in the office a lot because you're having to do all the research and write it all up and do it quickly, as quickly as humanly possible, basically. So uh, w we spent a lot of time in the office and my friends and I occasionally would, uh, at like 6 p.m., would just look at each other and decide that it was an ice cream for dinner kind of night. Uh huh. <laughs> so there was this really great ice cream place that was near the university, well, near our building at the university. And unfortunately, they've shut down now, but um, uh -huh. we would go and get ice cream sundaes from this Italian ice cream place, and it was pretty great. And uh, so, yeah, if we're talking about shameful dinners while a PhD student, I feel like the ice cream sundaes for dinner are, are probably top of that list. I mean that's a good dinner. I don't. I, I, I don't think I'd call that shameful. <laughs> I mean, there's you know there's protein, there's dairy. Sometimes there would be fruit in there. Balanced meal. Right. Oh my gosh, this fish. I got a chub, a fish. Chub fish. What is that? Nice. Is that I got another pike. Yeah, chub is good. I think we have a couple. Okay. But um, there's one of them is definitely need you definitely need one chub for the community center. That's good. It's a silver one. I don't know if that means anything. <laughs> ah, that means it'll be we can sell it for more. They need to have a different name for these fish. My chat is not. They're latching on to these names. Oh, nice. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? 
So ice cream for dinner. Yes. Ice, yeah, ice cream for dinner. What's the? I love how you're pivoting back to ice cream for dinner <laughs> rather than tell me what chat has done with the names of these fish. Trying to be nice. <laughs> it's fine. I'll just, I'll just have to look at your chat and see for myself, and then you know, it's all fine. I used to have, uh, so we get ice cream cake. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Don't be mean. <laughs> I think they like to see me blush is the thing. <laughs> Canadian Jen, I unmuted at an odd time, right? <clears throat> Tad Bowl was saying that he got a chubby. What's <laughs> not? Oh, oh, man. Oh, this is another pike. I don't really want to catch another <sighs> pike. Hard to catch pike. <laughs> not the right level to catch pike. What do you mean the right level? Because every le fishing level that you gain, the bar gets bigger and the fish escape Oh, less oh, 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 well. yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I remember so, now. Not the right level to get a pike. Ooh. They take forever and they're hard. Yeah, that was not... Does it... Now, does the bar... <laughs> fish, a fish, of course, yes. I know why... No idea why you're giggling. I don't know. Is there, um... The different rods. Do you, does your bar get bigger for different rods? No, but you can use bait. Oh, so you just get a hit faster with different rods? Yes. Okay. And then the iridium rod, you can use bobbers, which have they're different ones with different effects. Um, so some of them you'll get more treasure chests. Some of them the fish will escape slower. Some of them the bar might get a little well the bar doesn't get bigger but it like sticks to the fish a little better that kind of thing oh okay oh that's good oh we should also get to the saloon <laughs> no it doesn't geeky it doesn't <laughs> oh is it time to go to the saloon now yeah it's seven o'clock okay uh saloon Another pike. Too many pike. Did I did I gain a fishing level there? Maybe? I think I might have. I think that's why that pike was slightly easier to catch, because I've caught three pike today. My goodness. Okay. Hello, Robin. Robin is busy. Hello, Demetrius. Demetrius is busy. I don't care if they're busy dancing. I want to say hi. You made it way faster than I did. <laughs> I was in town fishing, so <laughs> so that helped. Uh, poor Sam, he's not good at pool, and Sebastian won't let him win. Kind of wish I had a cat. Unfortunately, my dad is allergic to pretty much everything. Sorry to hear that, Abigail. We have a cat. I could have added more to that sentence, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> don't you have work to do? I I mean, technically yes. <laughs> Weather doesn't really matter to me. It's staying no, in the shop they left. Your they left. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Sorry. Also, prioritize these guys like Abigail and Sebastian and Sam. Fishing rods, of course. Oh, no. Oh, right. Ninja. Wow. <laughs> wow, geeky. <laughs> Yeah, yes. Yeah. Again, I'm getting distracted. I don't know why. Uh-huh. Yeah. I mean, it started with the purple shorts and, you know, it's the it game from there. It's not me, it's the game. Mhm. Mm it's the purple shorts. Entirely the purple shorts. Yes, it's the game. Marnie doesn't notice me. It's not me. Wow, I can't yeah. believe, I can't believe that Marnie and Lewis are doing whatever it is they're doing and they're ignoring me. Yep. Ridiculous. Yep. <laughs> That's what they want to run. <laughs> They're not fishing. Also, everybody take a drink. Thank you, Robert Skitch, for the hydrate. General medication reminder. If you're supposed to take medications at this time of day, wherever you are, <laughs> take those meds. Pam. So angry. The purple shorts dance? Is that is that what these two are doing? The purple shorts dance? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, right. Hydrating since we're at the bar. Well done, Robert Skitch. All right. Okay. Handling salty fish all day makes you really thirsty. 
I, I was... Oh, that was close. <laughs> <laughs> I was rummaging in the garbage when Shane walked out the door, and it was like a split second. I have to, I still have to reiterate that I was lied to. I thought Stardew Valley was a wholesome game. It is a wholesome game. It just can get turned not wholesome really quickly. It's not that it gets turned that way. It's the game. <laughs> the game just isn't wholesome. I mean, it's like, it's wholesome adjacent. <laughs> Wholesome adjacent, like family friendly adjacent. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we spend, we're, we do a lot of adjacent <laughs> things. It's fine. We do. We do. Okay. Um, oh my! It I, is I, I, approaching. Honestly, yeah. A bedtime. I ended up with. Let's keep hold of this. And those. And those. And that. It can okay, get terrifying with certain mods, really. Hmm. Which the oh. Stardew Valley? Yeah. That's oh, that's true. Because there are certain like. Yeah, that's true. I'm going to sell some of these fish. That's okay, because I just put more in there. Yeah. I should, I'll, I'll go to bed. I'll sort the chests in the morning, I promise. <laughs> you don't have to sort the chests every day. It's, it's I I it's like fun. it, though. But look how much time. I like it. How much time you're losing by sorting chests. All the time. Oh my goodness. It's it's fine. It's all <laughs> fine. Oh, we probably should have checked the traveling cart and see if we could buy anything with our 14 gold. I don't think we could. No, I don't think we could either. Some spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed today. They just haven't been happy with us recently. Why did you make this... them angry? Meow. We have a pepper! I got a pepper! Yay! Yay! Okay, I'll put this in the chest. Because we'll need it for the community center. Also, Lewis likes hot peppers. Um, I don't know, like, just in case you ever want to get on his good side, I don't know if he would. Well, when or, we put the why. once we put the shorts in the soup, he's we're gonna need to be on his best. You know what I mean? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Where oh. Are we going to put the shorts in the soup? That's the question. Yeah, we have to stay tuned to find out. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, that's cool. We no. even have, guys, we have a gold star cauliflower that would get us the best response for the soup. Actually, in order to put the, the shorts in the soup, we need to be friends with Marnie to get the shorts in the first place. Marnie hates us. I don't think she hates us. She just doesn't notice that we're there. Doesn't acknowledge we're alive. She doesn't acknowledge our existence. Can you hate something that you don't know exists? I don't know. Maybe, probably. She's doing a pretty good job. Okay. Okay. Peppers for um, the blueberries, melons, etc. Right. Yeah. Tadpole equals chaos equals shorts and soup. I mean, I didn't even know that was an option. <laughs> now that I know it's an option. Now that you know it's an option. Uh, see, I shouldn't have told you. Mm. Can I tell you the other thing you can do? Sure. Although this, I mean, mm, I don't know which one would be worse for our reputation in this village, though. Well, I know which one would be worse for our reputation, but like, which one has the worst consequence? There's also a festival in fall where you set up a whole display that showcases, like, everything you've done that year. And you yeah. can put the shorts in that display. <laughs> and Lewis is the judge, and it's in front of the whole town, so uh, you can you can do that too. You you like you don't win, but I think he pays you off. I mean, gold is gold. Well, it's not in gold. <laughs> it's in like Stardew Fair tokens. But those, if you have enough of them, they get you a star drop, which gives you more energy, which is really good. So uh, yeah. Um, spirits are mildly perturbed. Let's, it's Saturday. Let's do a forage run because it's going to reset on Sunday. So we have chaos options is what you're saying. We have chaos options. Absolutely. The, uh, the, the soup is not the only option for the purple shorts. Okay. So <laughs> <laughs> Dragon just says when to go outside today. It was cold and full of people. Would not recommend. <laughs> I feel like that's such a vibe. Fair. Yeah. Right. Oh, there's people there? Nah, I'm good. Nah, I'm good. Yeah. 
So, you know how we're foraging, where we just walked through on the farm, nothing will ever spawn there for foraging and all that grass and such? No. Okay. Not on the farm map that we're using. Yeah. So, there are different layouts to the farm that you can use, and there's one that's like a foraging farm map. And then that map, things like forageable items will spawn on the grass, but you have less space for farming and farm buildings and such. Okay. Yeah, I thought, I could have swore that's what you said, but I'm like a second time playing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, totally fair question. I, I, I really wish that they would spawn on that map, but that was like, the map that we're playing on, that was the only choice that you had for farms when the game was first released. Oh. You just had that lot of land there was no like foraging one so there's a foraging one there's a fishing one there's a combat one and there's a what's the other one the other thing a mining map okay and then there's also the beach map which is like uh, just a slightly different semi-challenge map it has its own perks but you can't use sprinklers which um which is rough so uh <laughs> And then there's the Four Corners one, which is good for multiplayer, but only if you're doing like separate kind of things. Mm -hmm. It's better for that kind of multiplayer. Yeah, I know someone so. that's doing that now. Like one person's farming, one person's fishing, one person's adventuring. Yeah. Like, like caving, so yeah. Which we, I mean, like we're, we're probably going to do at some point of like one person going and doing one thing while the other person goes and does another, but um, it's a little easier to combine it, at least <laughs> at least until you have, have experience playing the game. No, I get it, I get it, I get it. Yeah, because yeah. I, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm basically just following you around. <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, you poor little thing. Go get some rest. No, his skin is too <laughs> delicate. Go inside. Nobody wants to people today anyway. Nobody wants to people today. <laughs> We say as two streamers who are a hundred percent peopling today, right, but you know. Right, right. <laughs> well, I don't. I mean, I guess it is. But I look at more as like just hanging out with friends, not really peopling. Peopling to me I is do. is like interacting with people that are more than likely strangers that you just have to interact with. Yeah. For one reason or another. Yeah. Or coworkers you don't particularly like. You know, mm, to, to me, mm -hmm. th that's to me, that's when I say peopling, that's peopling. Yeah. I'm sure everyone has their own. Their own definitions yeah. of what peopling means. Mm -hmm. Loopy people enough at the gym today. Yeah. That's... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. A prime peopling location, the gym. Now, see, when I went to the gym, I didn't people. I would. Like, put headphones on and have a hoodie and, like, no eye contact. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here to I'm here to exercise, not, not socialize. Yeah. I used to do a lot of work in coffee shops because they're the perfect place where you can exist with people around, mm -hmm. but you don't really have to interact with people. True. But you're still there, like, you're still able to witness the, the <laughs> kids who are, like, purchasing something on them their own at the counter for the first time sort of thing yeah, like yeah. you still get to you get, you get to see the fun moments without having to uh, engage i get you i get you you're people watching yeah yeah yep. people I, watching is fun it is people you have gonna, to interact I, with instead of those you choose to interact with yeah there you go yeah Doo, doo, doo. Best i found friend. a thing on the beach so i'm gonna donate it ggs yeah. I do not have anything interesting to tell you. Best friend, boyfriend, and a couple friends aren't peopling. Everyone else is. There you go. Oh, hey, we got more melon seeds Woo! from the museum. Hooray, melons. That means that means you can pick up some melon seeds from the museum, too, boom, boom, I think. Boom, 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 boom. We can it. have 18 melon seeds. I'll make my way that Look at way. That. As I talk to these people that don't like me. Went to the beach last night after dark. Sometimes you can see strange lights. <laughs> Aliens. Aliens. They're not being awkward seems to be hard work usually. Yes, a hundred percent. Right. There's a certain point, especially as an adult, where you just embrace being a bit awkward and you're like, you know what, people can deal. It's fine. I'm good with At it. least that's that's what I do. Yeah, right. 
I'm an archaeologist. I self-select to dig holes in the dirt, so I'm already kind of weird. <laughs> the, no, that's, this sap. That's Evelyn's like, I bought the tastiest sap from Pierre's shop the other day. He said he found it himself while exploring the mountains. I didn't know Pierre was such a talented forager. Pierre, you liar. We sold you that sap. Where's the museum? Um, it's near Clint's. It's down this way. Why can I never find it on the map? Um, it's the building that's that looks smaller than the actual building is, and it's all the way to the right. Oh, well, I didn't go all the way over there. Yeah, yeah. There were friends, but also strangers, and I tried so hard to not be awkward. Oh. Here's not peopling, here's friends and awesome peeps. That's well said. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Everyone is so into that sap. I know, right? So so much sap love. Museums are always the best place to get melon seeds. <laughs> <laughs> it's locked. I can't get in. Oh, it might have closed because it's after six. Wow. Yeah, sorry. That's okay. We'll pick up those melon seeds tomorrow. Fine. I didn't want to go in there anyways. <laughs> you will say people do come up and say something about your art sometimes but that's rare yeah for coffee shops yeah i've i've occasionally had people be like so what are you doing and and i don't mind that it's uh it's I, i've rarely had somebody strike up a conversation that's lasted for like more than five minutes and if it has usually it's very interesting there was this wasn't a coffee shop but um there was a guy who i i was writing an essay in a bookstore once <laughs> because a friend of mine was with me and they wanted to peruse the bookshelves and I really needed to write this essay so I was like okay we'll just oh this is this is all kinds of ignore <laughs> the planting pattern that has happened just ignore it don't look at it it's if you don't look at it it can't hurt you that's how that works um but yeah so this guy came up this guy uh his name was Chuck and he was a, a an older gentleman probably like in his 80, late 80s to early 90s at the time. And this was a decade ago. So unfortunately, I'm not entirely sure that he's still alive. Mm -hmm. But um, he had been, he was like traveling. He had traveled the world and started telling me about how he'd been to Antarctica. And there, you know, he was like, until you, I went to Antarctica, I didn't realize that there were like infinite shades of turquoise. So he just kept going on about his travels. I was like, this is actually like, I don't mind being interrupted by you, dude. You're pretty great. And then, uh, and then, so every week when we would go to that bookstore and my friend would peruse the books and I would write essays and such, uh, Chuck would come over and say hi. <laughs> so, well, that's good. So yeah. That's but cute. you're the good kind of weird RQ plays loopy. <laughs> don't make me blush. I, I'm a kind of weird, at least. I'm glad that I'm some people's good kind of weird. I feel like that's the most you can hope for, is that like some people enjoy your brand of weirdness. We have a fish thing that I don't have a spot for, so I'm going to put it in here. I know, I have to put it in a different chest. Gasp. If I don't look at it, it can't hurt me. Gasp. We've just established it's, that. It's not organized. Like, how can I <laughs> sleep? How can I? I can't fine, even. Fine, I can't. I can't. I can't sleep. Oh my goodness. Drawing or painting, people always want to ask a million questions. Yeah, I can imagine if you're doing artwork, people people want to know what's going on. Oh, it's raining, and we don't have to water our plants. What? What do I do now? Yay. What do I do? I didn't check my luck. Yay! Oh yeah, that's true. Also, we should watch the cooking show. Hold on, cooking show. Here we learn how to make baked fish. Oh my god. Whenever gosh. I make this one at home, my two cats go bananas. I saw bananas before I read the rest of the sentence and was like, who puts bananas with baked fish? Um, but uh but no, bananas aren't required for the baked fish, apparently. <laughs> okay, what's the luck situation? They're not mad. they're not happy. Somewhat annoyed. These spirits. Fish um, is not going in the fish chest, the whore! <laughs> I know, I know, but there's no space in the fish chest. It's... And yes, while I could move some of these things, they always go in the fish chest for me. I'm used to them being the... I could move the trash. We could move the trash. Okay, hold on. But it's the trash. Could... Need a second we fish chest? The we could get a could just... second fish chest. We could. We're not going That to. is something 
Well, we could. We have like 678 wood. We could totally afford a second fish chest. But um I don't I don't know how I feel about Okay, okay. okay hold on. There is there is Okay. We're going to I'm making executive decisions. <laughs> we're going to put the garbage in with the mining stuff, etc. Oh and no! We're gonna, oh, that's, hold on, wait a minute. It's not intuitive. That's not intuitive. What do you mean? That's not intuitive. <laughs> it's know. fine. You I can don't... handle it. We're gonna sell the muscle. <laughs> Is that? Oh, it's a thunderstorm. Yeah, I was gonna say, was that my screen getting ready to crash, or was it? No, it's a thunderstorm. <laughs> so thunderstorms are nice because um, you can, if you, once we get lightning rods, you can get batteries from the lightning rods. But they're also not nice because the lightning will strike trees and knock them down, or it'll strike your crops and kill them. So, um, so yeah, it might be good to not spend too much time on this particular map today. I oh. mean, it'll still happen, but, you know, we can dream. Um, maybe, maybe we should just go to the mines, even though they're somewhat annoyed. Maybe we can up our combat skill or All something. Right. But I'm going to check the traveling cart first and see what we can't afford with our 140 G. <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> Why are we making Canadian Gen's with me on the organizing. Yeah. Yeah, everybody I likes have allies in chat. Yeah, everyone loves to organize. I do not. I don't. <laughs> I, I, I'm so indifferent. Like it's so. It is. It is extremely useful. It is extremely satisfying to see organized chess. Okay, uh, it, it is very very pleasing. But I don't care enough to do it on the regular. <laughs> Thank you so much for the bits, Valkyrie Kiss. Welcome. I mean, I said welcome. You've been here for a while. It won't help at the cart, but it's the thought that counts. Valkyrie Kiss, you're fantastic. Hi, Vs. Hi, Vs. Also, Vs. there's a duck egg <laughs> at the... Oh, and there's a regular egg, too, but the duck egg is the big one. Okay, we're buying this duck egg. We're... We need 145 more G. We're poor but if again. We buy the... <laughs> if we buy the duck egg, then we don't have to buy a duck. First thing... When we're able to have ducks. We're poor again. No. We are poor again. It's fine. I'm going to sell some stuff to Pierre and maybe Willie. We're going to, it's going to, I'm, I'm on a mission. <laughs> I'm on a mission. <laughs> we're going to get this muscle out of here. We're going to sell it. Sell uh -huh. all the trash. I could sell the trash, but it's not going to sell that much for that much. Probably. What can we sell though? We can sell. Hmm. We can probably sell some of these spring onions. We can sell some of the sap. I'm in the mines, by really the way. I really want to sell this stuff. You're in the mines? Okay, cool. I'm I'm trying to uh, get a serious deal from the traveling merchant, so I may or may not join you in the mines today. <laughs> okay, let me do a parsnip. All I feel comfortable trying for. Let's see. This will get us at least... I mean, the sap alone will get us 102. And then the rest should... Yeah, we should be fine. I just want the duck egg. Because then we can incubate the duck egg. It's going to save us like 1,200 at least G. <laughs> I don't even remember how much ducks sell for. Oh, wow. I'm really slow now. Oh, have you become sluggish? Yeah. Did you use all your energy? Uh, no, something poisoned me, I guess. I was green. Oh, I was the slimes. Green. The slimes will do that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was green. Yeah. That was interesting. Oh, let's do that. Okay. Organizing. Cool. Aladdin's girl, hello. Oh, no. GG's on squirreling your coconuts away. Come on. Pierre just goes, so you know that sap that you sold me the other day? We had it at dinner. I can't say that it was a hit. Look, Pierre, everybody else in town is raving about the sap, so I don't know what your problem is. Right? You just want to be a negative, negative right? Pierre. And then he, he had the nerve to tell Evelyn that he was the one who got her sap from the mountains. Wow. He took credit for it, and he still doesn't like it. No trash means more storage. That is true, Loopy. That is true. And a lot of the time recycling the trash just gives you relatively worthless stuff, but I can't help myself. I I need it. I need to oh. be I need to maximize <laughs> the value of things. I almost died. I have like no oh. I have like no health. 
Oh, it's fine. You may want to eat something. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> okay. We have a duck egg. I'm very happy. That's going to save us so much money. And it guarantees that we can get a duck as soon as we have a big coop. Which, honestly, that's, like, the plan. That's, like, living the dream. When you can have ducks in your coop <laughs> with a pond. The ducks in this game go swimming in the pond. Kind of great. Do they give you anything? Oh, yeah, they give you duck eggs and okay. sometimes feathers. That you can do what with? That you can uh, you can sell or you can turn the eggs into duck mayo and oh. that sells for a lot. Okay. I'll come. I'll come join you in the mines. Oh, you're even fine. though you're, I'll die probably. Even though you're, in, even though you're dying. <laughs> right. Can we roast the duck? You can't in Stardew Valley. There are mods that will give, like, that will have meat products from the animals, but most farming sim game sim games don't don't do that. Enjoy lunch, Canadian Gen. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't know, like, if. Uh... Like you got the eggs and then you got this and you had a recipe or yeah. you, had, you know, I didn't know. Yeah, so you can cook eggs. It, like you can cook stuff with eggs in this game. The thing about cooking is that in some farming sim games, cooking makes an item more valuable, but in others it doesn't. And this is one of the ones where it doesn't really make it more valuable. Okay. Unfortunately. So these, cry oh, hello. these crystals, are they worth anything? No, they're just ice. Oh, okay. So oh, you just I have to. It. You just have to. Oh, cool. You just break them to get them out of your way. Yeah. <sighs> Fulmers. <laughs> Grace, good night. Thanks for hanging out. Rest well. Thanks for being here. Oh, found a staircase. Mm, blending, hello, GGs, and scrolling those coconuts away. No joke. You get lost on a lot of the nuances. Thank goodness for the wiki. Yeah. There are also some mods um, for anybody who's interested. There is UI info suite and there's look up anything. Oh gosh, I'm gonna, this is gonna be a problem. Hold on. If you're nearly dead, you may want to stay away from these slimes. Uh, I'm stuck. What's going My on? My goodness. It's clicking outside of the. <laughs> it's definitely <laughs> clicking outside of the window. I end up clicking weird things. Hold on. What is going on with my screen here? Oh. Oh. Okay. Hold on. Let me see where you are. I got it. I went down. Okay. Okay, good. <laughs> I just kept hearing the damage. Oh gosh. And then there's slimes. Whoa. Oh, I'm going to die again. Okay. Maybe, uh, yeah, maybe head back up. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I was like frantically clicking and I clicked outside of my, I don't, I, okay. Uh, all right, we're good. Uh, yes. Fine. Okay. So the two mods that tell you, that tell you stuff, uh, one is UI info suite and that gives like, it'll have a little thing in the, in the corner that tells you what your luck is. And then, um, it'll, it'll have some other useful information. Excuse me, slime. Um, it'll, it'll have some stuff like if you hover over a crop, it'll tell you how many days it is until that crop will, uh, be harvestable, that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. There we go. Okay. I'm going to leave cause I'm going to die soon <laughs> as well. And, uh, and then there's also look up anything, which is a mod where you can hover over something and press F1, or you can bind it to any other key. And uh, it will tell you all of the information basically from the wiki. So you do still need the wiki for some stuff, but it's pretty it's pretty rare at that point. But we don't have those mods, <laughs> so we're well, we're doing we're we're doing it. I'm not even sure if I'm still streaming because my browser just shut down on me. Oh dear. Okay. So two seconds. Yeah, no problem. Here, let me. I'll refresh the. Like all my windows just dream. shut. So that was weird. Okay, you're back. Which is a good thing. Mm -hmm. Let me see if I can get my stream back up. It's, OBS says we're still streaming. So. Zephira says. Ah! I can see you. Ah! Okay. 
I can see you in multi-stream, but multi-stream is sometimes delayed by quite a bit. Wow, that was really weird. Yeah, like everything Keep an just, eye on the time. Yeah. Everything just shut down. I was like, what the heck? Weird. So, well, we're good now. We're back. Hello. Yeah. Cool. Okay. <laughs> um Let's 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 go sleep before <laughs> before the computer decides to to make you pass out in the mines. Yes. Yes, yes. <laughs> it's fine. I mean, we have a little bit of health. <laughs> I have no health whatsoever. You have so little health. I have some health. It's like, don't uh, don't stub your toe. You're going to not make it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know what happened. Just everything kind of just... It's, yeah, weird. It, it fired back up. It never happened before. So I, I wonder know. if, like, I don't know, if your computer was updating in the background or something and something, I don't know... It glitched or something? Well, I don't know. It did. The, the browser did update in that because there's a little thing like, hey, we need to update. But usually it's like, wow, it'll be uh, oh. it'll be like I have to allow it, like not on its own. Yeah. So, yeah, I don't know. Strange. It's fine, though. I mean, everything's good. I think. Oh, we can sell the limestone. We like, don't need the limestone. <sighs> I like how the H is bleeding out. It, I mean, it's slightly concerning. <laughs> It's fine. It's all fine. Everything's fine. It is shooting droplets everywhere. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> no, let's not use the sword on the cat. Let's say hello to the cat. Oh, apparently I've already said hello to the cat today. Well, Never mind. Wow. I always make sure my hands are empty when I go near that thing. <laughs> I mean, the good thing is that if you use the button to pet the cat and you have your sword in your hand, you block, so you're not actually hitting the cat okay. with the sword. Well, that's but, good. Um, <laughs> but yeah, that only sold, limestone only sells for 15G. Goodness, I thought it would be a little bit more than that. I mean, it is limestone. Oh, it's raining again. again? It's another thunderstorm. Gee whiz. Wow. It's summertime. We've... The spirits are happy with us today. Yay! They're going to do their best. For everyone with good fortune. Okay, so it might be another mining day. Yeah, okay. Okay, yeah, okay. I, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Thank you. And we don't have to water crops. Tadpole has a buddy bed. Ick. Oh, no. No, wait. I have to put myself away from the last mining trip. I'm going to check whose birthday it is. If it's somebody's birthday. I don't know if it is. I'm going to check if it's somebody's birthday. And if so, who? There are certain characters where I know when their birthday is, and then there are a lot of characters where I'm like, eh. <laughs> so, uh... Oh, it's Gus's birthday! I like Gus, You're though. like, eh. Eh. I mean, I become best friends with everybody because the game wants you to, but, like, some of these people is like, eh. <laughs> eh. I love um, it. I okay. Love it. What can we get Gus? What does Gus like? For his birthday. He likes oranges. Mm, anything. But we don't have oranges. Anything else? No, it's fine. Um. Maybe he would go for grapes? But that's not like tree fruit. So he only likes let's, tree fruit? Let's remember we don't have to people please. Very true, Loopy. He doesn't only like that. It, like, everybody has a bunch of likes and dislikes, and that's part of why nobody can remember what everybody likes. Okay. Um, part of me is tempted to look it up because it's his birthday, but also I don't want to spend time on a wiki. You know what? We have we have seven leaks. I'm going to give him a leak. You're going to give him a leak? Yeah. I'm going to... I'm going to... Um, or no, wait... Apparently, he likes daffodils. Do we have daffodils? I mean, like, I know we do, but do we have a decent number of daffodils? I don't think we have daffodils. Yeah, we do. We have four. We 100% have daffodils. We have four. We have four? Yeah. Okay. And they're, mm. they're not gold stars, but, I mean, you know. That's that's fine. That's fine. It's fine. What if he we doesn't just... need to take it? Stop. got to stop reading chat <laughs> <laughs> really i i feel like i need to get better at reading the message silently before i read it out loud my chat is usually very well behaved but i'm paranoid like i've seen several instances where you'll just read the message without 
recognizing the the innuendo until you read it. They're like, oh, I need to remember to try and avoid that. <laughs> well, I mean, oh, wait, we're going to Gus. We need to give Gus his his. Yeah, da- I, I, daffodil. I always may. Yes, I should. I mean, I should know better by now. But like, the people that are in my chat and like chat like a lot. Oh, it doesn't open a, for two a, hours. A lot, a lot. Um, are good people. Like, we've chatted yeah. a lot. We've discussed things. But having said that, they can get a little, a little spicy. I was gonna say you can be a good person and still yeah, do yeah, a, yeah, a certain yeah. amount of spice. Right, right. And, it, it, <laughs> and I, I'm just, I just love the fact that we're genuinely, <laughs> genuinely a a wholesome group of people. You know that have yes. found each other, and it like and just enjoy each other's company. So I'm just going along, playing the game, doing my thing, and then just reading out stuff, and then it's like just reading stuff. Ah. <laughs> Mm-hmm. We yeah. getting yet? We still have fifty minutes. Oh, hey, do you want to pick up your melon seeds from the library? Yeah, let's go get my melons. We have fifty minutes before, well, in game, before Gus opens the saloon. We good people, but we be trolly. True, Melly. True. Mm-hmm. <coughs> she doesn't love me. I feel like that's fair, though. We met her like a month ago, so. There's books. What do I do? I interact with these yeah. or no? You can you can interact with them, and then they give you some uh, tips about how to play the game. Kinda. Hello, Ravik. Welcome in. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Touching his mouth. Excuse me. Sorry, guys. Do my cheeks hurt? Okay, they do. They do hurt. Uh, let's go give uh, give some daffodils to uh, Gus. From smiling, not from the whip crack. Yes, yes. Uh, I was looking away. I mean, that's what happens when you look away for a second. <laughs> <laughs> Sound alerts happen. Oh my goodness. I hope you're doing well, uh, Ravik. A daffodil. A birthday gift? That's very kind of you. I love it. No worries, Gus. And then he just asks if he can give me anything. It's fine. You remember my birthday? Thank you. This is great. Nothing. I get nothing from you. Not yet, but eventually he'll send you stuff in the mail. They're so needy. Once you're good enough friends with them, they have to they have to figure out how to ship it from here to our farmhouse. I'm always here. They don't have to ship it. Hello. I know. We had one of those parsnips you sold at the shop for dinner last night. I guess it was starting to go bad and my dad couldn't bear to throw it out. Wow. Okay. Unfortunately, it tastes like crap. Thanks, Abigail. She didn't say any of that to me. She said it looked better in the rain or more interesting in the rain. Oh, that's nice. I guess because I was the one who went and sold the parsnips. It's like they enjoyed the sap better than they enjoyed the parsnips. It could be... Uh, where are we going? The mines? Mines! Oh, a grape. Another grape. Frog! Another book. Found a lost book! Yeah! All right, I'm putting the melon scenes in here just in case. Yeah, yeah, makes bad, sense. Badness happens. <laughs> fine, oh, gosh. fine. Geeky. Maybe you need to give Abigail. Mm. Don't read it out loud. <laughs> don't don't read it out loud. Stop. <laughs> Silverfish thinking for the lurk. <sighs> We need to upgrade what? our pickaxes. We need to we need to make some money. That's that's what we really need. Yeah, I was gonna ask you, do you upgrade by buying or by leveling up? Well, that's a that's by a... buying. So it costs two thousand G to level up to copper, but you also have to bring five copper bars. 
Oh, wow. And then iron, it's 5,000 G plus five iron bars. And then gold, it's, I think, 10,000 G plus five iron bars. And then uh, iridium is five iridium bars and 20. 15? I don't remember what the price is. Maybe it's 20,000. I don't know. It's a lot of money for the iridium ones, but by that point, yeah. 20 grand isn't actually all that difficult. I mean, it seems Whereas like it, right now. Yeah, we have 100 <laughs> gold. Mhm. Mm <sighs> yeah. The the whole the whole uh money-making thing. We're not we're not doing so great on. Um I've gone down. Sorry, I was on autopilot. I've gone down a couple of levels. A couple. <laughs> a couple. I was looking for I'm sorry. Wow. I was on autopilot. I forgot. I found the staircases and then I was like, oh, let me let me go down. I'm on floor 49. She whiz. Sorry. <laughs> Corrigan, hello. How you doing? There you go. I made it. Yay. What is that? Oh, because there's a... Oh, because there was the bounty hunter. The, okay, on the board. We're, we're, okay, I have so many staircases over here with these dust sprites. Like, all the staircases, they just all are over here. Oh gosh, that slime. Okay. Whoa. Damn. Okay. There are, there are three staircases over this way, FYI. Three? Yep. Just to... leaving the tadpole to flop about on their own. Oh my gosh, Valkyrie. Right? <laughs> like, I'm trying. <laughs> we get tundra boots. Oh, cool. Boots. So these give us a little bit more defense, which is helpful. I'm going to go empty my inventory, so that I mostly so that I don't have to carry around the boots, um, but also just so that I'm not carrying around all of this stuff. You don't wear them? You don't, you don't wear them? Oh no, you wear the boots, but then you have to replace your leather boots with the tundra boots. Right. And then you have leather boots in your inventory, and so I've just dropped all that off at the top. Oh, this is one of the best ways to make money in this game, which you basically have to dedicate a person to it. And that's boring, better to be poor and have a good time with friends. <laughs> What's the best way to make money? Fish. Oh yeah, fishing is probably, and also clay harvesting. But uh, I don't really feel like clay harvesting. <laughs> it's it's not super fun. Ghost, come here. This sounds boring. Clay harvesting. I don't like. Honestly, I don't like harvesting clay in Minecraft. Real life? Minecraft. Oh, ew. Mm. Real life? Absolutely not. Look. Yeah. Oh, you need to people have fun peopling, Loopy. I'm sorry. Yeah. You I'm sorry. You have to people. <laughs> I know how much you love it. <laughs> Oh, hopefully it's... Hopefully the peopling is nice yeah. this time. This ghost is taking forever is to beat is it with the sword that we have. Yeah, I was going to say, is it strong or is it just because our sword is trash? No, it just it's just that our sword is trash. Uh -huh. I would really love a better weapon. You have a sling? We could get to the skeleton levels. Yeah, I'm so bad at slings, though. I don't... My brain doesn't it's nine, understand how they work. It's 9.30, by the way. It's 9.30. That's okay. We can... Yeah, we probably won't get to floor 55, will we? We can try, though. Okay. Just make sure we get out of the mine before, uh, what? 12? 1 o'clock? Yeah. 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 I'm still, I'm literally still trying to take on this ghost. I noticed that. I'm doing like one to three damage per hit. Dude. The sword is so bad. Hey, I got a staircase though. Okay. Oh, and this, this kind of level is like the minecart level. Yeah, it's a backpack. I found it. Mm-hmm. And I got a sword. Oh, nice. I don't know what, what it is. Sword? It's bronze, I guess. Uh -huh. Forest sword, level three. Oh, okay. Yeah, that'll do more damage. I guess it's wood. It's wood. Yeah, the, the swords don't really um, update in terms of like oh, a logical progression of skill. It's hard for them to see the time because my chat scrolls up over it because it's set for Minecraft stuff, not... 
Party Valley. Ah. Uh, gosh, these bats. Go away. What is this? This is aquamarine. Oh, staircase. Okay. <laughs> oh, I was about to say, I don't think we're going to get a staircase, but if we can find one more. Oh, but we're about to get all the bats. Okay, so maybe stay close-ish to the, the ladder. Oh no, it's midnight. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's just leave. We'll get it some other time. It's fine. Should go home Can now. Can we? Yeah, we should go home now. Okay. All right, sword is in there, sword is in there. I guess they take everything else. I didn't know you could find a weapon in the mine like that. Yeah, so you can find, there's the forest sword, there's like an ice dagger, and then there's also a bone sword. And there's some other stuff. There's like a shadow dagger, I think. The daggers aren't great, but they're okay. There's also a bunch of clubs that you can find. I don't remember all their names. I'm not putting stuff into uh, chests right now. We should be going and sleeping. Right. How did you get home so fast? I know the way. Apparently. <laughs> I do not know the way. Do you go the the way with the, on the mountain, or do you go through town? I went through town, I guess. Ah, that's I, the long way. Well, that's why I can't see like at night. I'm just and I passed. Yeah, out. I made it back well, to the farm, but I that's okay. Out. You're on the farm. We'll uh, <laughs> when we when the first glow ring we get can be yours, <laughs> so, so that you yeah. can see. At night, it's like mm, well, I I just kind of go, and if it lets me progress, that's yeah. where I go. And I imagine that's significantly harder when you don't have as good knowledge of the map itself. <laughs> oh, the spirits don't like us today, so maybe let's not go to the mine. That's fine. Wow. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, Corrigan, the exclamation stop is like, uh, hey, Tepo, look at chat. Hey, you missed something in game. Something like that. Yeah, Geek, you warned me. <sighs> 11, 11 gold. Uh, okay. Fine. Do I'm going to do some smelting. We do, we could actually make another one. I just put my stuff in there. <laughs> Is this you telling me that it's ready for me to organize? Rebecca, hello. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, poblanos are in are roasting in the air fryer. I don't know what that is, the lads girl. Ooh. Is that good? Peppers. I didn't. I mean, I never really thought of it. I didn't know you could. I was about to say I didn't know you could roast poblanos in the air fryer, but I I also feel like that's one of those things where like. I've never thought about it, but now that I now that I think about it, it makes perfect sense. Uh -huh. I'm so used to like people doing it with a flame instead of Archeo in nose. the oven. Yeah, I'm Archeo not. Plays knows. I'm Do not. You know. I'm not well versed in food things. <laughs> ah, we're pretty much. You want to pick this pepper for some farming experience? Yeah, we were pretty much like meat and potatoes here growing up, so. Um, I watch a lot of food channels on YouTube. That's uh, the only reason I know about <laughs> about roasting poblanos. Oh, hold on. I was going to put these in. Is this where this goes? I don't know where you're putting these things. That's that's fine. This is the fish. No, nope, I found it. I found it. See, I just takes me a minute. Good job. Yeah. Yeah, I do. I do light green as like crop stuff and dark green as forest stuff. Okay, <laughs> don't don't question the coloration and the organization. I mean, you can't. Not me. Not um, me. <laughs> the spirits don't like us today, so. 
Roasting any pepper there... makes the flavor elevated. Ah. Mm, yeah. And poblanos often get roasted because they're not quite as spicy of a pepper, but they have a little bit of, like, yeah, they're a nice pepper to roast. They they do really well with roasting. Um, maybe let's fish today. Oh, you know, we don't like fishing too much, but maybe let's fish. Today. I mean, we'll never get better unless we practice. Exactly. So we'll just go practice. Just go practice. So I'm there... gonna fish in the river in town because I don't. I still don't trust the river in the forest yet. <laughs> I'm still. I'm still getting over the insanity of of the river in the forest. So it's fine. Watch your. My energy is so low. Like, oh really? Yeah. Oh right. Yeah. Mm, fishing takes the most energy. So maybe do you want to run around and look for forage items because that doesn't require energy? Yeah. Can I, if I, <laughs> if I eat something, will it get me energy back or no? Oh yeah, yeah. If you eat some stuff, it'll, it'll give you energy back. Um, you could probably, well, mm, they're not great for energy, but we have a bunch of spring onions you could probably eat for energy. Or if you find like a grape while foraging or something, or a spice berry, just don't eat the sweet peas. They're not going to do anything for you. But I like this this one. <laughs> I mean, you can eat the sweet pea. It's just not going to do anything for right. you. The biggest difference between Sunhaven and Stardew that you preferred not having to eat all the time for energy. Does Sunhaven make you eat all the time for energy? Or just Stardew. I, I played a little bit of Sunhaven, but I'm I'm not great at like PVE or PV. I mean, I'm not great at PVP either. But like PVE, I'm real bad at the combat stuff. And Sunhaven has a lot of that, or at least it's like I like in Stardew yeah. that there are certain areas where you're gonna run into combat, but unless you're in those areas, you're safe. Um. Whereas in Sunhaven, it was just a lot of <laughs> a lot of stuff everywhere. I was like, eh, I don't know if this is for me. Right? Yeah. I have. But I've heard a lot of good things about that game. I just I think it's just not quite what I do in a farming sim. That's all. I have onion breath now. Is that going to affect my interaction with the other folks? Nah. <laughs> Should be fine. Spice berries. Oh, friend, I'm terrible at combating games like this. That's why we use magic or ranged. <laughs> yeah. I'm I'm also yeah, I panic when there are enemies. That's my general reaction to enemies in a video game is panic. So uh the only reason I don't panic so much in Stardew is because I've dealt with these enemies enough that I can panic less. But the panic is definitely still there. Panic. Oh my gosh, this fish. Don't panic. It's fine. Except at the disco. Right. Got to panic at the disco. Canadian gents having onions in the salad. Gonna have bad breath soon. I mean, onion breath. I'm not gonna say. <laughs> I'm not gonna say onion breath is bad. It's just onion breath. Yeah. Maybe people like onion breath. It's fine. I can't have onions anymore. My no. chronic illnesses will flare real bad, like yeah. really, really badly. <laughs> so, yeah. so I can't have onion or garlic or shallots. Like I can't do anything in the onion family, and I can't do anything in the mushroom family. Oh wow. Yeah. They're all, they, yeah, the dietary restrictions are frustrating because there's a lot of them. Like, it's I, like, what am I supposed to eat? Well, like I said, meat and potatoes, because when I was growing up, that's like legit all I ate. Yeah. And yeah. I've just, in the past, uh, I'll say six years, discovered like mushrooms and onions and fla oh. flavoring with those mm -hmm. things and cooking with those. And yeah. yeah. I, basically, it's like super bland. My diet was really, really, really bland. Yeah, enjoying the, the discoveries, but you can do it. Yeah. <laughs> Just... <laughs> Can't do mushrooms either allergic and no mushroom and vegan is a pain. Yeah, that would definitely. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Not fun. Yes. <laughs> I can't do anything in the onion family, anything in the mushroom family, and I can't do any legumes. So I can't do like beans of any kind easily. 
and uh, my my husband is vegetarian. Okay. So so it's like, and I also can't do a lot of soy. <laughs> so, so I was like, oh, okay. So like the easy <laughs> vegetarian options, I can't do. Right. So uh, so we we don't we have found some things that work for both of us, which is really helpful. But uh, but yes, we've been. There's a, there's a degree to which we've both been hitting our heads against a, a wall for like two years now because like what are, right. what are we supposed to eat right. <laughs> that both oh. of us can eat? Yeah, that would definitely be – it's a challenge. Yeah. Is there anything interesting in the sewer? I would imagine I don't have a key to get in yet. Yeah, we can't get in the sewer yet. I'm going to imagine. we got to donate a lot more stuff to the museum before we can get the key to the sewer. I'm going to imagine there is something. You like mushrooms? Did not like them as a kid. Same. Soy's in the legume family. Probably why. Oh. Yeah. You guys are. You guys know the things. I think I was already down here. I, I think I'm walking in circles, but I do that a lot. So. <laughs> okay. Wow, this is the easiest fish I've had so far. Did I level up in fishing? Canadian Jen loves them. They just hate me. <laughs> Did level up in fishing. GG's. You love mushrooms, they just hate you. Yeah. I would I not. know the feeling. For different reasons, Canadian Jen, but I, I know the feeling. <laughs> <laughs> I would not have anticipated that the museum would hold the key to the sewer. I guess it's as legit as any yeah, because it's you know you have to unlock it somehow, right? Yeah. We we had that whole cutscene with the kids last time. Right. I remember, I remember that. Indi yeah. Indiana is the country's leading soy provider. People don't stop talking about it here. Oh. Oh. Ah. I knew that a surprisingly large amount of soy is grown in the U.S. I probably I didn't know. Yeah, I didn't know that either. Yeah. I have enough energy to do a bit of fishing. I want to do it close to the house, though. Yeah. I mean, it's 740. I don't see that's the thing. I don't know where to fish. I'll go look. I'll go look somewhere up here. You can come into town where I am. I did forge some things, so that was for good. fortunate, I guess. Oh, there's some grapes. There's some more things. Got another pike. And there's another. Man. Oh, there's a whole bunch of these things. Oh, well, there you go. Spice berries everywhere. More grain. Oh my gosh, I was so close to catching this oh, fish no. and then I totally failed to catch it. <laughs> that was rough. That right was at, rough. Yeah, they get away right at the end. No. Your husband and you had to divide and conquer. You plan separate meals, meal prep them, and then just eat together. Yeah. Uh we we do that to an extent. Part of the difficulty of having seven chronic illnesses <laughs> is that uh it's really difficult for me to stand and cook for any amount of time or oh, to yeah. like meal prep. And the other difficulty is that because all of my chronic illnesses are centered in my abdomen, um, when they're flaring, my appetite goes. So if I meal prep for something for like the week, then three of those meals at least will never get used and they'll go bad because, oh. and that's like best case scenario because my stomach is just like, no, we're not, no, that's not appetizing to me right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so. So, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a struggle. Right. We do a lot of, we have a lot of stuff that's like, there's some frozen stuff that we have. Um, and there's a company in the, oh my gosh, these pike. I mean, I'm giving up. <laughs> I'm giving up. I'm done with the pike. <laughs> no, I say accidentally <laughs> casting the, casting the rod again, but my goodness, I've caught like three of them today, but they were getting rough just there. Um, so there's a company in the UK called Field Doctor, and I am not sponsored by them yet, but uh, I would love to do a sponsorship with them. They are, <laughs> yeah, I would, um, but they are a, a, a frozen meal service that is designed by dietitians for people with dietary needs. Mm -hmm. So like I can just order meals from them and they're perfect. Well, they're not like 100% safe, but they're pretty gosh darn safe for me. Um, which is really, really helpful because they can just sit in the freezer and then uh, and then I'm good to go, good. basically. Yeah. Yeah, because you don't have to worry about it. That's good. Yeah, it's really nice. Okay, what am I, what am I, what are we selling? I'm going to try and sell some stuff. 
Canadian Gen's GG's on squirreling away the coconuts. Well then. I'm going to sell some sweet peas and some spice berries. I'm sleeping so I can move tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. I will get there. I I've... might take a slight hit on the energy levels, but it'll be fine. Okay. Yeah, the meal prep thing, I got used to eating like literally the same thing every day. Mm -hmm. like, like chicken and rice. Like every day for every meal for years yeah i mean it worked and like all the vegetables you could get ready you know oh we're rich <laughs> i mean compared to what we've been doing we're rich thank you for the work yeah. jen we're rich <laughs> we got level three fishing oh whoa yeah that was a way more gold than i thought we were gonna get or g or whatever um, I was just laughing because Robert Skitch says, "Yeah, I remember the cutscene with the kids. That was when uh, that was after Archeo stripped." <laughs> and, That's true. You did, and it is true. I was gonna <laughs> say that. Yeah, it was after that whole accidental stripping situation happened. Um, mm -hmm, yeah, I I clicked on the wrong thing in game in my inventory, and I accidentally removed my trousers <laughs> in game. Wow. <laughs> Wow. It's fine though. That was, it was, it was, I was on the farm. It's, you know, it's fine. <laughs> you can do um, whatever you want on the farm. Luck. And good humor today. I think you have a little extra luck. Ooh, sounds like a mining day, maybe. Tomorrow we're gathering at the beach for the annual Pelican Town Luau. The highlight of the event is the communal potluck. All right, so, um,. Neither one of us is good enough friends with Marnie to get the shorts to add to the soup. So I think I think we'll end up adding uh, some of our, our good ingredients instead <laughs> and and get friendship bonuses with the, the townsfolk. What happens on the farm stays on the farm. Yes, Moon. 100%. This is so much like real life as far as like every morning you got to water your crops. Mm-hmm. Oh, I love it. Yeah, it's like all of the joys of farming with none of the having to actually go out in the rain and deal with pests and, you know, none of, none right? of the hardship. Yeah. All the fun stuff. <laughs> Vs. It doesn't matter. It's private property. Exactly. You know, it, I, I had underwear on. It's fine. Also, I love how I removed the bottom part of my... Like, I'm wearing overalls. I only removed the bottom part of my overalls. So, because because the top part is part of the shirt, apparently. So, you know. Um, <laughs> we were going to go mining. <laughs> Let's try to remember what we were doing. <laughs> it's, it's fine. What are we, like, did, what, 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 who are we? What are we doing? <laughs> we're discussing the, the physics of Stardew Valley overalls and going mining. Really, we're going mining. It's it's fine. It's fine. Oh, it's okay. It's fine. <laughs> Remember the bit where we named the farm nudist colony? <laughs> what? Oh, dear. I missed that part. Wow. wow. That was Robert's kitchen chat. Wow. Yep. I mean, it is called Archeo Milk Farm, so that's, you know, it's, that's, I feel like that's borderline. Borderline? That's a classy name. Is it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> hey, look, there he is. Oh, yeah. It's okay, we haven't come to throw rocks at your house, I promise. Yet. I suppose if you use the slingshot, you could actually throw rocks at Linus's house. That would be so sad. I, but I bet people have done it. I forgot the seeds, the sad. melon seeds here last time. Oh, that's okay. Well, we'll grab them. It's fine. I say this. Will we grab them? Who knows? Absolutely not. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a slingshot and see what what happens. I'm gonna attempt to use a slingshot. It's not gonna go well, but uh, you know, I can dream. Found it. Best oh, of luck. Nice. Best of luck. <laughs> I tried. I tried using it too. It did not go well. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I was like, how do you use this thing? Yeah. It's, I don't think it's a terribly intuitive thing. No. Already? Okay. Oh, out of ammo. You have rocks? Oh, so rocks don't count? No. I have rocks. Maybe you have to, do you have to make ammo? 
Oh, I don't know. Maybe you have to buy ammo or make ammo craft, or something. Yeah, oh, gosh. I mean, crafting it would make more sense. I would love a better sword. But I found the... I found the... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Too many things. There's Too a lot. many things. There's a lot of things in this one. It's fine. We're fine. Everything's fine. So it's like... Oh, there's another ghost? How is there another ghost? It actually, it like, blows my mind that it's not worth looking under every stone for stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. I got a solar essence. Most of them essence. will just give you rocks. Yeah. A solar essence is good. The wizard likes those, but we also need them for a community center bundle. Okay. Here, buddy. I don't like killing the little dust sprites, but they give you a really good ring when you kill like 500 of them. So, oh, really? Yeah. You get the burglar ring, which um, if you're wearing it when you're in combat with a mob, they'll give you more of... They have a higher chance of giving you stuff. Oh, I found a staircase. It's down... Uh, down... Bottom right. I'm on my way. Frozen tear. Les Life, hello. How you doing? Bottom right, bottom right, bottom right. There we go. Uh, my game hey. froze. My game froze. Oh, wait, no. Oh. Okay. I think we both clicked at the same time and the game said no. We might have. Yep. No. Okay, it's fine. You're doing great. I'm glad you're doing great. <laughs> Robert Skitch says that he was starting up Stardew today for the first time since playing in 2018 and was looking through his chest to remember where stuff was stored and found the slingshots. I was like, wait a minute, slingshots are in this game? So uh, yeah, I'm glad that we're not the only people who are like, I don't understand what to do with the slingshots. Bottom right. Bottom and right. or the slingshots are used. I mean, granted, Robert Skitch does pacifist runs, so <laughs> some weapons are gonna be extra useless. Yeah, but, uh, I mean, yeah. still. Uh, crystal fruit. You have yeah. news? Oh, news? Oh. Hopefully good news. Do the do the monsters keep spawning no matter how many times you take them out? No, they'll eventually you'll um well it, it, yeah, when you leave the level if you come back there will be new monsters probably. Oh, ads. We'll hear about the news after the ads. Yeah. Ads are a thing. Is there better stuff under the big rocks? Like if you upgrade your pick? No, the big rocks just give you like 10 rocks at a time, but they don't even give you mining experience, which is very sad. I found it, but there's bats. Oh, good. Okay. Here, I'll come help with the bats. Oh, my energy's about done. Oh, okay. I'll do more of the mining. I have mining. food. I have food. Oh, that works too. That works too. I mean, it gave me a little bit. You're back. Welcome back. Oh, uh, Dwarf Squirrel 3 is only available as a combat drop. That's so sad. That means you can never talk to the dwarf. Is it? Does it some could it sometimes appear at the traveling cart? Or is that does the traveling cart Maybe not. I know that sometimes they they have certain artifacts, I think. I love how windy it is down here. Like I found it bottom left. Okay. It's like no oh, there's some music. Like I was almost <laughs> I was almost gonna say there's no music down here, but there is. <laughs> it's spooky music. Yeah. Or not spooky, but you know. Oh, what? Or did the ghost hit you? Let's I go. can't hit you, can I? No. no. Okay, it must have been the ghost. Lag. Oh now I have no energy. That's fine. Oh I'll my have goodness. Some... I've got salmon berries. It'll be fine. They're all aggroed on you for some reason. It's oh. fine. 
Now they're not. Yeah. Now they're aggroed on you. <laughs> Hold on. Let me, let me get rid of I this was like, I was trying to hit one, and they just kept chasing you, and then they were like, oh, you're here. Good lord. You pass out. Oh, you run out of energy? Yeah. They take your stuff. They, they steal your boots, basically. What is this guy? Oh, maybe get away from him. He is he's very strong. Well, so if if you don't have too much health, yeah. be real careful. My health is good. My energy. Oh, your health is fine, actually. So, yeah, feel free to take him on. Try to corner him up against a wall. I don't know how well that's going to go with the lag, but if you can. Nope, you got me. You got me. Quick. Oh, dear. <laughs> Yeah, they're the ones with the little stars on their heads. They have a an item mm -hmm. that they'll give you, but they're extra strong. Linus fell me. Even. Yay! Did you take all my stuff, Linus? Oh, it's a club. Cool. Left... I'm not good at using the clubs. He stole 200 gold from me. No. I didn't lose any of my items, but I lost 200 gold. Thanks. Okay. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> Fine. He saved me. Okay. Oh, I have no energy. Never mind. Hold on. <laughs> We're not getting the floor 60 today. That's yeah. fine. I have no energy, no health. I'm bleeding out. I'm going home. Yeah, I do I do have some salmon berries, but it's it's not worth it to yeah. I will pick up the melon seeds though. I got them. Oh, you got him. Yeah. Well remembered. Loopy. <laughs> Wiki doesn't say anything about them being available on the traveling cart page. That's so sad. Do this, and then we'll grab this and this, and we'll leave the rest. I'm dying. There. I'm dying, Loopy. No. <laughs> and then I was thinking, once we finish this day, if we maybe do a food break. Yeah. Words on stream food break. Yeah, that's fine. That sounds good. Um, where do I put the crystal fruit? Uh, in the foraging chest, if there's space. Okay, there is. I think that was a foraging cool. chest. That's the first mm -hmm, one, right? The one with the watering cans. Yeah yeah, 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 the dark green one. Oh, wait. I didn't want to do that. Well, yeah, I can't do nothing anyways. I was going to plant the melons, but I'm not in any shape to do that. So. Oh, yeah, and I don't have any energy to water them either. Yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to sleep. I'm going to sleep. Oh, my yeah. goodness. Oh, my goodness. But yeah, we can throw some words on stream, get some food, take a break. Yeah. Oh, I carried the slingshot. It's not, that's fine. Neither of us are ever going to use the slingshot. I, I don't know <laughs> so how to do it. Fine. Like you said, maybe we have to craft the ammunition. Maybe I, we have I don't to know. craft the, I think you can buy it at the Adventurers Guild maybe, but like buy uh, okay. when the sword is free. <laughs> right. I mean, unless it does like double the damage of a sword and it keeps the mobs away. Yeah. Oh, look, oh, we level, didn't... level three mining. Level three mining. I don't think we sold anything though, so I don't think we're gonna get a pause screen. So actually, I might stay on the level three mining screen until we are done with lunch slash dinner. Yeah, we can do that. Yeah, yep. just so that that way the time is paused and we don't have to like sign out of the game or whatever. Yeah, that sounds good. Normally, yeah. what I'll do is I'll I'll go grab some food and come back and just kind of hang out at the PC. So whenever you're mm -hmm. ready, whenever you're ready, just let me know. Sure. Yeah. Sounds good. Let me get some words for everybody. Yes. Let me figure out which of my windows is the words window. <laughs> okay. All right. Let me just get this set up. Hydrate. Thank you for the hydrate. <laughs> oh, and also we can play some more Spotify music. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll go ahead and mute you on Discord. And then uh, when you're ready, just let me know. Yeah, sounds good. Okay. All right, guys. I'm gonna play some music. Get this going. And we'll play some words. So hopefully have fun. And maybe we can make a friend. Maybe we'll make a friend when we come back. I don't know. Maybe. Um, Copy this. There we go. Boom, 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 bo
Hold, 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 hold. All right. Here you go. Words on stream. Uh, we'll take a lunch. We'll get something to eat. You guys, if you've been sitting for a long time, you need to get up, get a stretch. Do that now. Thank you for being here. Have fun.
Hey guys, Archeo's back. Um, you want to finish this round or do you want to hop back into Stardew? Mm, up to you. <laughs> After the round. <laughs> Technically, what is called cloudy apple juice in the UK for all the American peeps. Hello. Um, basically, that's like apple cider. Hello. <laughs> they're still they're they they want to finish the round. <laughs> mm -hmm. Understandable. They're on level seventeen, right? Uh, oh. tw twenty now. Oh, they've moved up. Yeah. My my multi stream froze. Uh oh. <laughs> Loopy wants apple cider. I mm. I generally only drink apple cider in the fall. It's kind of like my pumpkin spice. Oh. You know what I so mean? So here you can get it you can get it year round, but it's just called cloudy apple juice and it's basically the same as apple cider. It's not quite the same, mm -hmm. but it's the closest you'll get. Whereas if you try to get apple cider here, that's going to be like the alcoholic kind of cider. Oh, okay. so uh, yeah. yeah, so you have to go for cloudy apple juice if mm. you want the American type of of it. But it works really well. Like it works the same as cider, so you can stick it in a mug and warm it up. I didn't warm up my my apple juice. I probably should have, but that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we have. I'm literally where I live, surrounded by apple orchards. So they're everywhere, oh, yeah? everywhere, literally everywhere. So like, if you want to go apple picking, they're all over. Mad, everywhere. Mad Molly, thank you for the resub, 11 months. Thank you very much. Whoa, the answers are hidden? Yeah. What is this madness? I hate these levels so much. Oh, I hate the levels that have a hidden letter and a fake letter and that require five letters minimum. Mm. What do you mean the answers are hidden? That'll be like the next level. That's absurd. <laughs> Oh, I don't like that. Mm -hmm. I don't either. I'm no good at these anyways. Like, they're fun. But they're interesting. But, like, after, like, round three, I'm like, okay, I'm going to sit in awe of everybody that knows how to do these. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was saying to my chat that my brain is fantastic at words on stream until it's not. Mm -hmm. It's like, oh, yeah, we're good. We've yeah. got all the answers. And then it dies. <laughs> I'm like, Okay. <laughs> It's enough of that for today. <laughs> yeah, it's like you've reached your quota. Now you're falling over and, you know, can't put words together. Uh, yeah, I, I I used to be really good at stuff like probably cuz you fall out of practice, right? You don't you you don't lose it, you lose it. Mm, so like that's true. like word puzzles and like crossword puzzles, all kinds of stuff like that. I was I used yeah. to be decent, you know, decent at stuff like that, but I haven't done anything like that in years, so. Yeah. I used to do crossword puzzles in college every day um, with a friend of mine. And then my final year, my supervisor found out that I did crosswords. Mm -hmm. So she and I did crosswords like most days. <laughs> we would do the crossword. But I haven't done crosswords in a while. Yeah. It's been a long time, too. It's not my fault. <laughs> it's not your fault? Wait, no. why is it? Oh, Tadpole likes to see us fail. I understand. Uh, yeah. did what? <laughs> Look, you have hashtag blame tadpole. It's you created this for yourself. I did not. I did not. I gave my mods too much power. There you go. That's <laughs> that's that's the problem. But to be fair, I wouldn't be I wouldn't be where I'm at without them. So I mean <laughs> Yeah, there's a there's degree to which we like giving our mods a certain amount of power. Mm -hmm. It leads to better content. <sighs> it does, it does. And they're they're amazing, so V's, you're the exact same with words on stream, but V's, you're doing it in like not your first language. <laughs> I couldn't imagine. I couldn't. Loopy as well. So like, I can't imagine. Yeah. Any, anybody who's doing <laughs> words on stream and is not a native English speaker, mm. like if you ever think that your brain doesn't work as well as other people's in that game, I'm sorry. You're doing it in a totally different language. <laughs> your brain works way better than mine does right? in, in that. Yeah. A hundred percent. Mad Molly, thank you for 11 whole months. Oh, my goodness. Thank oh, you my so much. gosh. I think I was muted when words was on. I think. I don't know. Ah, <laughs> I don't, that makes sense. I thought I unmuted, but maybe I didn't. 
Thank you so much for 11 months. So long. Ah, oh, appreciate 11 it. months appreciate is it. a long time. 11 months is great. So many amazing people. <laughs> Loopy, I hate English. I know, right? It's I can't imagine having to learn English. Me neither. I've learned a number of languages. None of them feel as hard as English does. And I'm a native English speaker. So <laughs> my combat leveled up as well. And then you get to forget how to words in two languages, right? Right. Yeah. I didn't hear you. Almost a year. Can't wait for the next several years. Oh, oh, right in the wow. fields. Right in the fields. Yeah. Thank there you so you much. Go. Appreciate you. Thank you so much. I only leveled up in mining. I didn't level up in combat, but that's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Well, welcome in. Hope you're doing good. I did silverfish. I hydrated. You weren't paying attention. Wow. Wow. Oh, that's a lot of crops. They're somewhat annoyed today. They are. Mm. The spirits don't like us, but look at this. All of our all of our seeds are, are ready. Here, I'll leave the rest for you, I think. I think that's about about half. Uh let's put this in and then these and then I don't need another one of those. Get a gold sweet pea. Okay. And then we'll do this. Oh, and I realized there's other stuff that we need to take to the museum. The two dwarf scrolls. <laughs> you also didn't die. Stop. <laughs> I, w I didn't die. I got knocked unconscious. There's a difference. Wait. Oh, yeah, that's true. I didn't die. That is true. <laughs> I also didn't get knocked unconscious and and lose 200 gold. But, um, what? yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow, same difference. Oh my goodness. It's fine. Oh, there's a grape there. Oh it's my goodness. Fine. <laughs> Everything's fine. You know, we. Oh, it's a festival today. Okay, so. On, wanna... on level 16,416 in another <laughs> stream? That's a thing on words? Holy my goodness. That's a lot. My mind drifts to other languages, and I have to filter those words out. Says Lupe. Yeah, I can only. I mm -hmm. can. I can't imagine. I, like if you can do that, you're on a different level. Well done. I'm. Uh, I'm seeing if there's something super quick that we can grab for the. We're not doing that. For the for the luau to get the best uh -oh. thing. I don't think there is. I think our one gold cauliflower is going to be the best and then oh the festival has started okay all right um oh they do words on stream 24 7 that's how ah that makes sense so they have like pro words on stream peeps in their chat probably oh yeah i got maple syrup oh cool if we can save that then we'll be able to turn that into a bee house soon always saving we need to spend we, we, we are. We're working on it. Okay. <laughs> if you... If you take the the gold star cauliflower... I take a gold star potato. That's probably not going to help, is it? Gold star cauliflower? Yeah, you take the gold star cauliflower. And I'm going to try for the gold star strawberry, maybe. It's probably not going to help too much. But you take the cauliflower. I'll take the strawberry. We'll go to the luau. It's going to be a great time. The luau is on the beach. Mm, helps I'm, with the I'm going south, but you can go the other way if it depends. It, up to you. I don't know where I'm going. I'm trying to reach to out. the beach. I'm trying to reach out and walk through the forest. Oh, do, 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 do. yeah. Commands to show the longest word in chat repeatedly once it's discovered. Helps with the question mark rounds. Ah, I see, I see. Grey Knight is here. Hello, Grey Knight. I didn't realize Grey Knight was in chat. Welcome in. Hello, Grey Knight. Oh, I have music on top of the game music. Thank you, Vs. Sorry, I... For, here, I'll fix it once we're in the festival. Uh, I just remembered to turn mine off, though. So don't feel bad. Yep. I don't even know where I'm going. I'm going the wrong way. We're going to the beach. Uh, there we go. <laughs> Sorry, Vs. Well, everybody, but thank you, Vs. Maybe I should go there and learn more Learned. words. All the words. Hope I can get to the beach this way. I don't even know. 
Oh, hold on. Let me see. Nope. Uh, nope. <laughs> Go through town. <laughs> I was taking it's this. I'll take the scenic route. I'll be there when so it's over. So long as you're at the beach before 2 p.m. Well, I mean, it's gonna be, be fine. I'll be cutting it close. I know. It's fine. You can you can do it. Kepo's gonna miss the luau. I'm gonna miss everything. I'm mi the yeah, Leah's house doesn't have the exit. You have to go between Leah's house and Marnie's. This, this town needs to connect everything. The mm, the, the, yeah. <laughs> the non connecting. Mm. There are need... mods that do that, but uh, but yeah, no. <laughs> How did I know? There's always mods. There's, There's all, always mods. Always a mod. There, there are a lot of really useful mods for Stardew. There are also a lot of really weird mods for Stardew. There we go. See, we're fine. Okay. Easy. Oh, it would help if I uh, were clicked into the game. Hi, Pierre. The governor's okay. here. Yeah, the governor's here. I'm not going to bother. We're not going to buy anything from Pierre. He's not selling useful stuff. Um, so... Let's talk to everybody first, and then we'll have you add something to the soup, and we'll see if that triggers the cutscene for both of us. That would be really cool if we could both get the bonus for the gold cauliflower. That would be helpful. Free buffet, one of the perks of living here. Enjoy it, kid. <laughs> nice, Pam. George is grumpy. 19,425 on the words on the stream. Wow. Whoa. Goodness. This is tiring. Are you ready to visit the buffet soon? <laughs> oh. You stepped on my foot, dear. Uh oh. Look at this one. One year Sam put a pound of anchovies in the potluck soup. She's unresponsive. She's busy. She's working, working her thing on the dance floor. Yeah. I'm bored. Yeah. <laughs> She's just shaking it. Did I talk to Shane already? I did. Music's too loud. Grouchy grandpa. Pam's the best it villager. Does, <laughs> it seems like a weird thing to to do, like a communal soup where nobody's coordinating on what they're putting in the soup. I feel like that's mostly going to end in disaster. So I appreciate that it only matters what we put into the soup. Right, right. We used so to like do... everybody else can put in garbage, but yeah. it doesn't matter. Our ingredient makes it magically amazing. Of course. Do I have the pants? We didn't find the pants. It's tiring. We, so, so yeah. Slight. Yep, I'm with Abigail. Let's just look at the sea. Yeah. <laughs> We're not good enough friends with Marnie to have gotten the, the purple pants. Purple shorts. A pound of anchovies. That's a lot of anchovies. Mm, that's a lot of anchovies. Is there anybody else down on the docks? Did I say hello to... Oh, Willie's down here. Slurp. I miss Willie. Oh, I may have... I may have... Not spoken to Harvey accidentally. Hold on. Governor, who cares? Right? Okay. Who have I not spoken to? We would go camping and one, like usually the last day, whatever was left, would go in the big pot and uh -huh. just cooked it all. And it, and it, uh, it was always good. Oddly enough, it was, it was, and it was always different. Like sometimes it had sim similar ingredients, but mm -hmm. lots, it was just random. Whatever was there. Random stuff. Yeah. yeah. And it was always good. I, was, I don't know why. <laughs> it, it shouldn't have been, but. He says George is my spirit animal, and I appreciate that. Yay. I like George. He's he's one of my favorite characters, even though he's grumpy. He he eventually stops being grumpy. <laughs> I didn't talk to the fisherman. Okay, yeah, he's down. Yeah, down there. Hiding. You miss Willie. <laughs> Taking a breather. <laughs> wow. The truth. I'm glad I wasn't the only one who caught that innuendo, Loopy. <laughs> wow. You can't say anything. Nope. <laughs> Everything can become an innuendo if you say it the right way. Especially with um, the, the eyebrows. <laughs> okay. So 
if you go up the stairs and you click on the like right click on the soup so the stairs that are right up here mm -hmm. if you go up and right click on the soup there will be something about adding something to the pot if you put the gold star cauliflower in you add okay. a cauliflower to the soup okay wonderful can <sighs> okay all right i will i will put I'm putting a gold star strawberry. I don't know if that's going to be terribly good, but it must do something. It's, so that's it's, fine. it's a gold star. Does that just mean like the size or quality of it or something? Yeah, it's just the quality. It's good quality. Okay, so I'm going to say let's start with the luau. The governor's going to taste the soup and we're going to see what happens. Mm -hmm. This is this is where we learn how this works in co-op mode. <laughs> so I got a cutscene. Yeah. About the size and stuff. Well, folks, it's time once again for the potluck ceremony. I trust that you all put high quality ingredients in the pot this year. We don't want the governor to regret his visit to the valley. I mean, like, we tried. Well, governor, would you do the honor of tasting the soup? It'd have been better with some purple pants. I mean, <laughs> of course, I've been looking forward to this all year. Now, is he happy? Oh. Uh, he's still eating. Mm. Okay. Okay. Nope. nope. That's a very pleasant soup. The produce from this valley mm. never disappoints. Okay. So how does it... Oh, man. I'm going to have to look at that up and figure out if, like, we both needed the best ingredients or, like, if you had just done the cauliflower, if we would have gotten away with the best... It's fine. It's fine. I'll quell my need to... <laughs> uh, my my overachieving perfectionist self, I'll I'll, I'll tamp it down. <laughs> You're fine. You're fine. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I gotta. It know. wasn't. The, it wasn't the best response to this soup. Oh, wasn't? Okay. No. It, it was just a. So -so. It was. It was a good result. Like we we will have gained an, a lot of friendship with a lot of people, which is good. So if you look at your friendship tab, you'll now have a whole bunch of people with hearts. Pretty much everybody except the wizard for me. Oh, wow. So, a lot of people. The wizard doesn't go to that festival, unfortunately. We don't go to a lot of the festivals. Yeah. Yeah, just the wizard. Everybody else just has mm -hmm. one. Pam, Pam just, she's just mean. Pam, yeah. I want, Pam, I want Pam. desperately to be friends with Pam for some reason. I don't know why. Yeah, Pam's a little rough. I am debating hanging on to some of these. I'm going to hold on to some of these forageable items because there are other ways that we can make money off them. We'll go to sleep. Pam has a reason, says Melanie. I love the fact that you guys, there's so many people that know the lore in the game and all the things, and I'm still learning yep. everything. Mm -hmm. And like the, oh, they have the reasons. Oh, wait, they'll have a redemption. I love it. I love it. <laughs> Give her a gift card to the tavern. Tavern, Pam will love you forever. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. I believe that one. That one, I believe. If only it were possible. Spirits are mildly perturbed. What did we do to them? They're so mad. I know. <laughs> it's like every day they're angry. Oh. There's what? a tomato ready. What did you do to the spirits, uh, man? I didn't do anything to the spirits. Recipe from my saloon. I only share this with my good friends, Gus. Salmon dinner. Thanks. Oh. Thanks, Gus. Nice. Okay. We are not good enough friends with Caroline, but I think what I'm going to do is craft some summer seeds bunch of them and we're gonna hang on to them until we're good enough friends wait am i hmm, caroline where are you i'm not good enough friends with caroline okay i need to become good friends with caroline and then we can <laughs> then we can make some tea saplings and then the tea saplings sell for a ridiculous amount of money like absolutely absurd amount of money compared well, to what they cost so what, but what? we need to we need we need to be friends with caroline first I think I got everything. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. Oh, and I should put these away. Tomatoes. Mm -hmm. We have tomatoes. Nice. 
Cube tomatoes and hot pepper. Now I want to play Stardew, Molly. Yeah, I, this is my first time ever, so having a lot of fun. I was playing Stardew earlier today as well, um, just like a personal save file, because when I was looking back through my old ones, I found the, the whole like bee only, bees only farm, like bees and flowers. And I was like, oh, that looks like fun. So I started a new playthrough where I'm only making money off of bees and flowers. So you're playing started with me and you're playing started with your own. Yeah, look, this is, this is my comfort game. When I'm having like really rough chronic health days, I'm almost always playing Stardew. I, I mean, I love it. I love it. <laughs> yeah. It's one of the, cause I know, I know everything in the game well enough and the stuff that I don't know doesn't have terribly high consequences. So it doesn't really matter. <laughs> it's it it's like the perfect chronic illness game. Yeah. Everything matters. <laughs> I mean. I like how Tablet didn't see what I said. Uh, Alex can shove sand down his shorts. <laughs> and also, Alex is a doo doo head. I like that. But Alex is so dreamy. Are we doing anything specific today? Just foraging or? No, can pretty much do anything. I, I went to see the traveling cart and I'm not seeing much. Um, trying to remember what. Caroline likes. So I want her to like me. But I don't know, and I don't want to spend too much time on the wiki. Does well, I know she likes flowers, but we don't have huge amounts of flowers, so I don't know if she'll like the flowers that we have. I don't know why Brian's not yelling at me to hydrate silverfish when you redeem that. It should be. Oh. I don't know yeah. what's going on. It was yesterday. Have you turned Brian off? No. Because I don't... Hmm. No, it should definitely be doing... the thing. I'm looking for a flower. Okay. Let's grab a sweet pea and see if Caroline likes sweet peas. Maybe she will. Or maybe she'll yell at me. I don't know. We're going to find out. Stay tuned. It's on. I just heard it. Weird. I was not oh, touching weird. things. Is it tied to the music <laughs> volume? Uh, well, oh. well, Spotify is just off. It's not that it's, it's Spotify is muted. Spotify is just off. So no. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know what the deal is with that. What what uh, item does uh, was Linus, 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 Linus like? He likes any of the foraged items, so he'll go for salmon berries or any any of the stuff that we've found on the ground. Okay. Oh goodness, are you sure? Yay, you like sweet peas. Good. Not enough to be besties with me yet, but you know it's we're we're getting there. Poor Evelyn's like, George spends the whole day in front of that darn television set. George is literally right here outside sitting under a tree. She said it within within like five to ten feet of the dude. He's literally right here, not in front of the darn television set. Like, Rude. what? what? Besties for the what? rest. <laughs> oh, I accidentally dug through the trash. Wow. Before. I was, I was, I was, I misclicked. Uh. I was, I was, <laughs> it's fine. George. Um, it's okay. It's fine. George, Here, George hates us now. No. no, no, he hates me now. He doesn't hate you. He just thinks I'm disgusting. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Pam loves alcohol, but her daughter Penny hates it. Yeah. These likes, Alex. Your nephews want to play Minecraft with you. You'll be back later if you don't crash like a potato. No worries, bees. Enjoy playing Minecraft with your nephews. That sounds adorable. Have fun. <laughs> um, I'm gonna I'm gonna borrow one of these leaks and give it to George to uh, bribe him to right. like me again after going through the garbage. If I put something in this hand, would it help you forget what was in your brain? Yeah, exactly. It's, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah. 
You don't know where I got this leak. Maybe it came from the garbage. Maybe it came from the mountain. Who knows? I just know that you love it enough to not question it. Aw, oh, man. George isn't out by the tree anymore. Uh, all right. Okay. Let's go find you in front of the television set. It's... I mean, he does spend a lot of time wow. in front of the television wow. set. But, um... Well, I mean, you no, know. I mean, he does. But... But sometimes, like, he goes to church every Sunday... And I, he goes, he sits outside under a tree, and you know, then he goes to doctor's appointments. Like, dude is not just in front of the TV. I feel like George has lived a full life and has earned the right to watch television when George wants. Right? Oh. Is this? Oh, that's an owl. I thought this was a cat, like, hanging from the roof. Oh. <laughs> I think it's supposed to be an owl, maybe? I think it's an owl, yeah. Mm. Okay, all right. We are into the days of there being a whole lot of stuff on the beach. So uh, so that's the thing that instead of like a berry season like we had in spring, mm -hmm. in summer, there's a few days where there's a lot of coral and shells that wash up on the beach. So I'm gathering all of them and we're going to sell them and we're going to be rich. Are we though? Aladdin's girl, how can you get a cat and an owl mixed up? I uh, blame Tadpole. Look, it could have been a cat hanging from the rat. You know, it looked like there was arms. Could, Come on. I, I could see it. I could see it. Oh, here, let me donate this thing to Gunther. I should have grabbed some of the other artifacts. Oh well, it's fine. Not my fault. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, just in the nick of time before the library closed. What were you taking to the library? The rusty cog that I found the other day. Oh. So the coral, what is the coral good for? Um, it, they, hmm. eventually we can build a building. <laughs> the wizard will make a building for us that lets us like warp to the the well to the beach or to the island there's one of the obelisks that the wizard makes um but then uh, otherwise it sells for a lot of money this is your reminder to say hello to people at the saloon is it friday it's, it's friday night well someone said to go check the beach out i'm down at the beach <laughs> <laughs> sorry i gathered all the stuff from the beach no you left one sorry i found one. Oh, did i yeah. oh good okay i mean like technically not good but good that there was something for you to find <laughs> that, <it wasn't. laughs> that i didn't send you out there on a wild goose chase accidentally robin is busy wow yeah they're busy dancing well they could stay <laughs> rude I know they're busy, and then Marnie doesn't notice that we're there. Marnie, sometimes hates. Pam won't won't will be unresponsive. But you know, it's there. It's Elliot. I don't. I'm puzzled by Elliot's comment. He's like, "Argue plays. You look puzzled. I guess the hot air can make us dizzy sometimes." And I'm like, "Dude, you're." He said, Do you think it could be maybe that you're drinking too much alcohol? Maybe. He, he said the same thing to me on the beach. Really? Yeah. <laughs> legitimately the same thing on the beach. You look puzzled? Yeah. I mean, dude. Wow. Okay. Wow. I think I've spoken to everybody? Maybe. Probably. I think I got everybody. Did I get Clint? Okay. Now I've definitely gotten it. Mm, did I talk to Shane? Yes. Okay. All right. Why can't I talk to? I'm gonna go. Maybe because I talked to them at the beach. If yeah, if you already talked to them that day, you uh, might not be able to talk to them at the, um, at the thing. They all Does just... tadpole hang cats from the roof? No. That what? is a question for tadpole, Aladdin's girl. What? Your poblanos no. are all roasted. Ooh, sounds good. Sounds good. No. I love cats. No, stop. Are you sure? Yes. <laughs> stop. <laughs> um, what do we want to 
do here. We don't, I don't think we need a gold star. We have gold star oysters. We're fine. We don't need more of these here. I'm just going to, we're going to sell this. We're going to sell everything here. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we can sell all that. Cool. We're going to make bank today. Coral. Okay. All right. We have so much fish to sell. No, we have to hoard it. We got to hoard some of it. I'm not hoarding. Am I hoarding too much of it? Like, I don't know. I'm, do you remember? I'm hoarding like two of each one. Do you remember? You'd your, be amazed how many people want fish in this town. Your, your, do you remember your first playthrough of Stardew? Uh-huh. <laughs> do you, like, do you really? Or is it like, it was so long ago. I, I can't remember. Wow. I don't know that I remember like <laughs> the you. first. I don't remember details, mm -hmm. but I remember not having things mm -hmm. in certain seasons and having to wait a full, like the reason I hoard is because of that first playthrough where I didn't hoard stuff. Okay. And I learned oh. you that learned. you should hoard things. That's, that's, I mean, I guess that's kind of what I was getting at. Like, yeah. you're, you're hoarding because you remember. I'm hoarding because I remember. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember the pain. Like if I didn't have somebody like guiding me and like, this is what you do. This is what you have to do. You kind of got to work on this. I'd be like, sell everything <laughs> yeah yeah i might keep a like, lot of people do oh i clicked like, on the wrong, the wrong one of everything maybe i would keep maybe mm -hmm. someone mm -hmm. annoyed today why are they so mad i know we've got hops again well we don't got a it's raining oh hey those ones are ready did you get any gold star ones uh i got a silver no oh. i mean that's fine Okay, so we still have to wait for the blueberries before we can take all of it to the community center. Now, if you go to the community center with a little bit, but not everything. You can, yeah, you can put stuff in. I just, it's my my need for efficiency is like only go when you have the full bundle. No, but that's just my brain. No, same. I just didn't know if it was an option. Is all yeah, I'm definitely an option. Okay. Which is helpful sometimes. I just, my, my brain doesn't like me. So fishing? Uh, I don't know. I don't know about fishing. We could do fishing. We could do fishing or the mines. Well, I mean, uh, the spirits are annoyed, so the mines might be a little treacherous. We can. Well, it doesn't matter to me. I die either way. <laughs> Thunder? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Isn't it better to fish when it's raining? That's why I asked fishing. <laughs> Loopy says he hung hangs rabbits from the roof on top of cats. <laughs> So. I did not ask for that. Okay, that was a checkpoint redemption. Wow. I mean, I was I was there when there was a certain rabbit that uh, suffered grievously. I tried to save it. It. Yeah. You know what? Let's go to the mines. I don't. I don't know that I feel like <laughs> fishing. <laughs> I mean, you can fish if you want. No, it's I, fine. I don't, I don't fine. want to deal with fish. What was that a Part ghost? Part of it too is because like the fishing, Wait, the fishing. I, I just tank. heard, I just heard something that sounded like a ghost. Is that a thing? Oh no, it's probably just a a sound. There won't be any ghosts in outside of the mines. Okay. Where am I going? I'm going through town. Why am I going through town? I don't know. The wizard wants an earth crystal. Okay, well I'm gonna give the wizard an earth crystal, and it's Alex's birthday. Hold on, we gotta hold on. Change of plans. Loopy told me to. Mm. Loopy told you to. <laughs> then the thunder. I Isn't it better to fish when it's raining? It's it's it, the, certain types of fish can be found only when it's raining in certain seasons. But the okay, so the thing I'm gonna take this and an earth crystal. I'm gonna take a solar essence down to the wizard. What can we give Alex? What would Alex like? I don't know what Alex would like. Would I he? Know. I mean, a sweet pea is a flower. Technically, they maybe I'll I'll see if he likes flowers on his birthday. Hopefully, he doesn't hate them. But it, uh, yeah, we'll see. You, um, you're gonna give Alex a sweet pea? Let me see what I can find. I'm gonna give Alex a sweet pea. I'll give Alex something else. Um, yeah. So certain fish can only be found when it's raining. But the thing about the community center fishing, which is really the only reason we're fishing, mm. is uh, is that when you finish that whole 
room, which technically isn't a room, but it's like the whole fish tank, and you repair the fish tank, the reward for it isn't that great, in my opinion. So it's like the one that I prioritize the least because it's the least fun to do, and I feel like the reward is also not great. Uh -oh. Ah, the item I requested. Your work was satisfactory. Here's your compensation. Thank you, wizard. Look at that, 150. Also, hello. Be aware, you're standing above a potent magical field. Okay, all right. Oh, because you call your tower a hut? Okay, cool. All I know the is that... Likes... <laughs> all, you know, all you know is that the rabbit cat toy is even more cursed than the poor lay next to the tree. <laughs> I'm not yep. I'm not doing these. It's not like my brain. This is what's being redeemed. Mm. Yeah, but you're agreeing to it. But, so you must be endorsing it in some way. But they people hung out and collected those channel points, so you know. I mean that's true. Where I don't know. Everybody what... take a drink. Thank you, Loopy, for that hydrate. Man. Also, this is a medication check. If uh, if you're supposed to be taking medications at whatever time of day it is for you just now, and you haven't taken them, maybe take them. In fact, I'm realizing that there's something I have not taken, so this is as much a reminder for me as it is for you. <laughs> okay, I gave him a spice berry, and he said thanks. Okay. I mean, that's probably at least a neutral gift. He was smiling. Yeah. I could get sunburned. If... It's, it's thunderstorming, lady. Yeah, probably not going to get sunburned in a thunderstorm. Uh, why is the table Although... reading my innocent chat? <laughs> <laughs> Did you know that the majority of people who get sunburn or like the worst day time weather for a sunburn is when it's cloudy because people think that they're not. Yep. Oh no, he's in his room and I can't get to him. It happened to me. I'm not me. good enough friends with him. It happened to me. Yeah. I certainly could get a sunburn in a thunderstorm. <laughs> mm-hmm. And you hypothermia doing? are like the two biggest weather concerns. I mean, well, I mean, some other stuff are big concerns in Scotland, but like sunburn and hypothermia, because hypothermia mostly happens at like 50 degrees Fahrenheit. Mm -hmm. So it's, or like, I don't know what that would be, like 10-ish Celsius, between 10 and 15 Celsius, because people don't realize that they're cold and they're not prepared for the cold. Right. So you can get hypothermia at significantly warmer temperatures than you might otherwise mm -hmm. think. Yep. Especially if it's windy. Alex, I need to give you a birthday gift Jess, that hello. you may or may not like. Welcome in. How you doing? You've been sunburnt within 15 minutes watching a sunset. Oh, yep. wow. Definitely. You let it. I didn't touch nothing. It's fine. It's fine. How you doing today? You did... That kind of drink. Don't visit place. Colorado. It's the only place you've heard of people getting sunburns and frostbite simultaneously. Yeah. That uh, that uh, I can believe. I believe that. Mm hmm. Alex, when do you stop working out so that I can give you this gift that you may or may not hate? I like your clip. I haven't had a chance to watch it. Jazz, I've been streaming. <laughs> <laughs> I will definitely watch it as soon as stream's over. Okay, also okay, got okay, sun poisoning okay. several times. Yeah, your skin does not like the sun. They're immortal enemies. You remembered my birthday. I'm impressed. Thanks. Excellent. Also, apparently, he smells barbecue. Oh, wait. I need a... Cool. Ah. He liked the sweet pea. <laughs> Helpful. Geeky, thank you for the support. I'm Buddy. gonna go into the mines and test my luck. I might regret this, but I'm gonna try. It's like four o'clock. Yeah, I'm gonna try. It's 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 fine. Probably, maybe, kinda sorta. I'm gonna go fishing. Okay. I'm sure this is fine. Yeah, fishing during a thunderstorm, definitely a fantastic idea. I've done it's it. It's a good thing you can't get struck by lightning in this game. I've done it. It's fine. Mm. I mean, it didn't start out as a thunderstorm. It just turned into one, you know? That's true. <laughs> also true. Then it's like, okay, it's time to go. <laughs> you gotta go now. Have a great stream. Thank you for hanging out, Jazz. And I will check that. 
clip out as soon as I get a chance. Oh, see, the thing about the clubs is that they're they're so slow. So I haven't figured out how to use them easily yet. It's like you have a metal... F I don't. I have a bamboo fishing pole. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Oh, gosh. This is a lot of enemies. Hold on. She was great. Hold on. <laughs> What's the matter? We're not, we're not doing that. <laughs> It's so dangerous. It's fine. It's fine. It, it help. The directionality of this game. Oh. Oh, tough fish. Yeah, well, that and you got to be good at clicking the mouse. Just the right way. Mm. Nope. Which can't be uh, no, 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 can't no, no. be easy with the lag on this as well. Right. Well, I mean. No, no, no. Oh, oh, we were doing so good. We were doing so good. I don't think it's like that difficult of a fish. It's just me controlling it. I got a bream. I think that's a new one. Max. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I think I prefer swords. The, <laughs> I'm getting the club, but the club? I feel like I take too much damage. Is it with like the club? Is it like stronger but slower? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Have knockback on it. Looks like. It does, yeah, which is helpful, mm -hmm. but I feel like it's not quite enough knockback to make me feel comfortable. Right. No, I, I don't get know. It. It's one of those things that I will teach myself, but maybe not. I'm, I'm, right this I'm, minute. I'm totally not watching your stream and ignoring my fishing. <laughs> as I as I sit here fighting this ghost. How would you define the difference between a rod and a pole? That's a good question. I, I, I don't know. I think, Someone should Google it. I think I think it just depends on my mood, which I call it. You you may wanna you may wanna um, Google it in incognito mode though, just in case. Could a tuck tuck go? <laughs> oh, I found a diamond. Ooh, that was. I got one piece of junk and one fish, so far. I'm not asking okay. to be sus. I don't really know. So I mean. <laughs> So I'm I'm gonna say so I'll say this a pole would be long this is gonna be so bad Lo like longer and smaller in diameter and a rod would be shorter okay and maybe a little little thicker in diameter so a pole would to, in my brain would be longer okay so like think in Minecraft like a fishing pole is big right and then a blaze rod as a rod is short mm. if that helps. In my brain, that's how my brain would see it. I feel like that's fair. But some people say okay. fishing pole. Some people say fishing rod. It's kind of like, you know, we can go together. I was trying to figure out how to say that. Incognito mode is a good way to say. <laughs> <laughs> but that's how I would think. I would think of it. Or like a uh, like a plutonium rod is, you know, I I don't know what they look like because I've never been in a nuclear power plant but i'm assuming they're shorter and thicker mm. so. ted's definition seems pretty accurate though interesting <laughs> <laughs> oh let's talk to line every once in a while silverfish i know things go okay i did not get Five floors down, but I may have gotten a new artifact. Maybe. Oh, oh interesting. Mm-hmm. Give me this fish. Give me the fish. Yeah. Okay. Oh, well, I got one of those worded fish again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's fishing. it is 12 o'clock. I'm going to bed. Oh, isn't it just one has a real... That, that's probably what it is in fishing. I have never been good enough at fishing to know the difference rod and reel what well that does make sense okay 
have a jade. Isn't it just we don't have anywhere to put one the jade, has a real. Wanna... It's a rod and a reel, so the thing that has the string in it is the reel. If that makes sense. Oh, I should I should go to sleep. At least that's how my brain thinks of it. <laughs> Thanks for explaining. Thanks for clipping it. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's a rod that has a reel. Yeah, I think that I think that makes sense. Mm. <laughs> okay. You did that on purpose. I think so. Luffy's smart, and I think I was set up a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> You think? They're in good humor today. Extra luck. Yay. Hey, remember to watch the cooking show. Yeah, I don't know if I watched it on Wednesday. Oh. That's okay, because I don't think we've missed any. Pancakes. Oh, Linus taught me how to make sashimi. Okay, and Pam wants a pale ale, which we were, we're prepared for once we can make kegs. But kegs are going to take a while. Also, we have blueberries today. So we can do that whole bundle with the tomato and the hot pepper and the melon. It's all going to be good. Also, we should have been fertilizing these melons, but oh well, it's fine. We can, it's fine. Um, okay, so I have another fish that I can't put in there. Oh, yeah. Okay, hold on. Um, should, should we sell some that aren't starred? No, because th those are worth. Hold on. You okay, do, you okay. do it. You I'll, do, you do the I'll thing. sort out. I'll sort out my hoarding tendencies. Hold on. Did you water the crops? I did not. No. I'll do that. <laughs> okay. Uh, no one teaches you that in school. No, they don't. Yeah. And that's just my brain interpretation. I'm not saying that's what it is. I'm just saying if you were going to ask me, that's what I would say. Mm, I guess you have to hold on to the. Yep. <laughs> I sure do. In game. I sure do. <laughs> okay. I'm going to put the garbage in the new chest so that we have a little bit more space in this chest. And we're also going to donate some artifacts today. <laughs> donate an aquamarine. I'll donate one of the diamonds because we have another one. Okay, everything's watered. Yeah, for now. This will also be blue. We got we got a gold melon. Oh, good. We want to save that. It's in the green chest or, or lime chest. Where'd you put the trash? Perfect. I have trash. I put it over in this blue chest here. I'll make it a slightly different blue. Oh, that blends in with the grass. Hold on. <laughs> that blend. Hold on. We can. Yeah. I put it in yeah. that. Chest. Okay. <laughs> I was like, we can actually clear the the grass out. Well, you told me not to, so I've been leaving it alone. I know. No, no, no. It's, <laughs> when it gets in the way, we can definitely clean it out. It's fine. Two. And then we're going to do a pepper and a tomato. We're going to do all sorts of stuff. We're donating stuff. And we're. Do you want to... Okay, here's the other thing that can happen. Do you want to upgrade your pickaxe? Sure. Okay, so if you take five copper bars and go to Clint's, you'll be able to upgrade your pickaxe to a cup copper pickaxe. And then you'll be able to mine in the ice levels a lot faster. It won't take two hits every rock. Or three, however many hits it is. It won't <laughs> It won't take that many. It'll go a little faster. Uh, rod is more often used to refer to the fishing implement, apparently. Silverfish is researching. Oh. We have to go to Clint's. Context is for quarters. <laughs> <laughs> Everything I just clipped out of context. And you know, I'm not allowed to complain about it because context is for quitters. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. Let me go up. Um, so I'm going to Clint's. Where's Clint's? Over by the library. Hmm. Oh, yeah? Where's the library? Near the bridge to the beach, but over to the right. You mean the blacksmith? Yeah, that's Clint's. That's true. Clint is the blacksmith. That's valuable information. What do we get? What do we get? Anything useful? 
A sprinkler. A quality sprinkler. That's helpful. Context is also bad for getting extra clicks on the platform. <laughs> yes. But as an archaeologist, context is also super important in archaeology. Right, right, yeah. Depends on what you're doing. Mm hmm. Archaeology without context is n non existent. <laughs> we could get a copper trash can, though. No, don't do that. Do a copper pickaxe. It's worth more, <laughs> it's way better. Don't spend two grand on a copper trash can. <laughs> <laughs> it's not, it's just a thousand. It's fine. Still. A couple days. I need my pickaxe. Yeah, it takes a couple days. Oh, no, no, it's okay. It's okay. We'll do it. If we go to the mines, I'll I'll give you my pickaxe. And but I mean, we'll like, do... this would have been great to do when it was raining every day. It's fine. Yeah. It's fine. Sunday, so we'll check back on Tuesday. Yeah, it's fine. Theoretically, we might get... This might be a mod. I can't remember. We might get something in the mail that tells us when it's ready. That might be a mod. And that. Okay, G what's our reward? GG's. Gimme. It's a starfruit seed, which we can... Mm, we're not going to plant that this year. <laughs> I mean, we could, but we were... Mm, well... Oh, although we've got speed grow. We can do it. Okay, all right. We'll get a starfruit. It's not... We're not going to be able to use it for much. But there's something with a starfruit where Kent asks for a starfruit at some point. Jazz just said she's thankful for all her toys, and I don't know if I've seen that dialogue before. Okay. I mean, it's a good thing to be thankful for. I just didn't... I wasn't... <laughs> <laughs> wasn't expecting her to save. Real days? Yep. Real days. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All the days are real. Oh, Caroline, wait. Caroline, come back. Wait, I have a sweet pea for you. Be my friend. Teach me how to make tea saplings. Where'd you go? It was too late. Made her man. That's fine. I found her. She is she? Yeah, she's my friend. She's not in her house though, so I can't go and learn the tea sapling ways. I don't think she's not in her house. But it's fine. I'll do it tomorrow, and then we're gonna make bank. This would not be the game for you. <laughs> This is my first playthrough. It's, it's actually a lot of fun. There's so much more to this game than I imagined, honestly. Like, it is way more complex with so many different layers. It's just absolutely wild. Yeah. There are a lot of different ways to play it, too. I mean, it's not quite as versatile as Minecraft, but there are a lot of different ways you can play Stardew, which I really like. Mm -hmm. Um, I got the Caroline cutscene. I didn't think I was gonna because she's hanging out under a tree, but um, apparently she's also in her sunroom. Oh, nice. Um, so, yeah. Thanks, she's Ravik. been meaning to show me her private sunroom. Yay. This is, this is the other, like, one of the best cutscenes in this. Not in terms, I mean, like, it's it's a fine cutscene, but like, in ter you know how the wizard made us drink forest juice and yeah. there was an interesting, yeah. Caroline gives you some tea. And there's also an interesting, um, wow, what interesting, is this, these, interesting situation there. What's with these people getting high all the time? <laughs> <laughs> Ravik, thank you for the support. Crazy. I mean, she does at least give you the option to say no thank you to drinking the tea, but I feel like she would be upset if you said no thank you, so. Uh, I mean, she might. <laughs> I can't believe. <laughs> Loopy's an angel, by the way. Sure, Loopy. Uh-huh. 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 Wow. See, this is the, this is the, like, it starts out nice. And then, you know, it gets a little, a little trippy. A little. In a second. Just a little, right? Just, just a no. little. Not nearly as much as the cutscene with the wizard. <laughs> the, the wizard sends you over the wizard the rainbow. sends you yeah. somewhere. This yeah. one is just, like, going to make Let's you see. feel good. It's yeah, funny. you get a little, like, 
sprite or something. Some some who drinks the tea and then wiggles on the edge of your teacup. And, you know, that's that's that. Now you know the magic of tea. Why am I hearing, like, bees? Why are you hearing what? Like bees? Like buzzing? Is that normal? Oh, it's probably like cicadas or something. Oh, okay. You don't remember this cutscene? Robert Sketch, this is from... Oh, I don't remember which update this was, but it might have been... You might have stopped playing before this update came out. So yeah, she has this little sunroom and the tea sapling that... Well, the tea tree that's in here will grow tea every day for the entire last week of the uh, of the season. And uh, and then she'll send you the recipe for tea saplings in the mail. And tea saplings make a lot of money. Like a ridiculous amount of money for what they cost. But her sunroom is just right through here. And you can go there on the last day of the... La like every day of the last week of the season and pick tea leaves. And if you take the tea leaves and put them in a keg, you can make green tea. And that is like Caroline. Caroline loves that. Um, but we don't have a keg, so <laughs> so we're not we're not doing that. We don't but, have a keg uh, yet. Yet, but we will. But yeah, I think I don't think that was in the last update. I think it was like one dot four, maybe. We're currently on one dot five, which added all like the whole ginger island thing and the volcano and like it, it added so much stuff. It may have actually been added then. Um, let me put sweet peas away. Okay, so we're gonna do this, we're gonna do this, and we're gonna, we're gonna make a bunch of money now. Mm. Oh, we can't right this minute. We'll do it tomorrow morning. It's fine. But I will place the sprinkler. <laughs> It'll be best right there for now. Thank you, Loopy. <laughs> and then we'll sell the sweet pea. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Oh, wait. Speed grow. Uh, star. Star fruit. Hold on. Speed grow, and then watering can. It's fine. I'll be. I'll be done in time. It's fine. Mm -hmm. I'm in bed, so <laughs> I have no energy. You're in bed. Yeah, I know. Good. I was like We're... running out of energy. I don't know why my I, things I have aren't so working. So much energy. Oh, your sound stuff? Mm -hmm. Mine was doing that last week. I wonder I don't know. <laughs> I think I think there might just be sometimes OBS just gets confused. Well my sound alerts are working in my channel. Oh, point, that's good. My channel point redeems and stuff are but like so my hydrate has um a text to speech thing that's supposed to sound so I don't miss it. And it's not working mm. for some reason. I don't know why. Oh. I'll have to look into that. Yay. We're we're rich. Oh hey, just just you wait. This is gonna be amazing. So yeah, so old. tea tea saplings were introduced in one dot four. So that's a that's a one dot four thing. I don't know when one dot four was released. Twenty nineteen. So yeah, Robert Skitch, you would have stopped playing before that came out. They're cool. They're useful. They sell each one of them sells for five hundred G each. And all you need to make them are some wild seeds, some wood, and some fiber. And that's it. Did, did... Thanks, Silverfish. Birds <laughs> are somewhat annoyed today, as per usual. Hold on. Somewhat annoyed. All right. Back to you. Here. Thanks for stopping by my sunroom yesterday. I usually drink tea alone, but it was fun to share with you. I've enclosed instructions on how to prepare and grow your own tea. No pressure, but if you do end up growing some, make sure to bring me a cup. And you get the tea sapling recipe. And then, with our fiber and our wood and our summer seeds, we come over here. And we make 20 of them. So 20 times 500 G, that's going to be 10 grand, if I've done the math right. If we have, that's a lot. Yeah, so tomorrow we're gonna have about ten grand. <laughs> if we have uh, iron ore and copper, should we always be smelting it up? Or no? We probably should. Yeah, at this point, probably yes. Okay. Um, these are crops. This and this. 
Okay. That would explain why you had no idea about the strategy of making lots of money with tea. I didn't know the tea sapling strat until I was watching somebody else play Stardew and they're like, okay, we gotta go for the tea saplings. I was like, why? And uh, and I was like, is there something, does green tea sell for a lot? And they're like, no, no, we're selling the saplings. I was like, what? What do you mean? And uh, yeah, that's how I found out. Same with like clay farming. I found out about clay farming from other people playing Stardew and being like, clay farming is a thing. And I was like, that looks complicated. So uh, yeah. A sunroom sounds amazing with tea and plants. I agree, Loopy. I really want a sunroom. It's that's like a that's like a dream home kind of day. I mean, I do live in Scotland, so sunroom might might be kind of difficult. <laughs> so, I mean, the sunroom will exist whether it gets sun is uh, is another question. Okay, the spirits are not super happy with it. Should we fish? Yep. Do you think? Yep, definitely should fish. Okay. Definitely should fish. Oh, you've already you already grabbed the fishing pole. Yeah, I see. Pug, how's it going? Okay. Welcome in. Yeah, because you know I, I don't have a pickaxe. The spirits are mad. Yeah, we're, we're going fishing. Oh, hold on, let me. I'll swap out the iron. Oh, did, I was waiting for it to get done. And I didn't know how long it would take. So. Yeah, it takes two hours for iron. I think. So long. Yeah. Copper is only like half an hour, so you can kind of hover around and, and wait for it, but iron, it takes a little while. Forage up here. Spiceberry. Hope your day's going well, Pug. I'm only level three fishing. Let's not. I was like, should I go and try to find the fish that are only around when it's raining? And I was like, I'm only level three fishing. Let's let's maybe not. Let's maybe let's maybe just fish. But that's when you definitely should do the thing. When when I don't have much experience. Yep. I mean, guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> Be quiet, you. That's what I got. Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Just put it in a blast furnace, and it'll take half the time. Absolutely, Robert Skitch. If only we had blast furnaces in this game. We have blast furnaces. Nice. No, I said if if only oh. we had blast furnaces. Well, I got a bullhead. Jim. Oh, nice. Hello, welcome in. We fishing. Come on, fish. Is this a pike? That was an easy one. It is. Of course, it's a pike. A carp. New record. Does it? Does the record mean anything? What? what no, one? it's just like it's the largest one you've caught, but it doesn't have a, any mechanical benefit. Quit fishing on land. I know. I'm I'm learning the mechanics. It's really weird. So like <laughs> where you where your mouse is, it'll change your direction. You yeah, know? the directionality in this game is not consistent. No. It, sometimes it follows where the mouse is, and sometimes it follows where you're looking. I don't I don't understand <laughs> how it decides which one it's picking. Yeah, I don't but that's either. one of the reasons why combat in the mines for me is like panic <laughs> inducing because half the time right. you'll swing your sword not the direction you were trying to swing it <laughs> right. and you don't know why. Yep. Exactly. No lane shark. And then the slimes get you and you're like, "Wait oh, a minute, yeah. but I swung my sword. I was looking at the opponent. What's going on?" Yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm I'm doing so badly with this fish. I was like, I'll get the I'll get the treasure, it'll be fine. But no, now I can't. Right. All right, all right. It's fine. It's fine. So <laughs> when you get tre I know you're busy. But when you get mm -hmm. the tre when you get the treasures, do you get mm -hmm. both every time you get the fish or do you have to get like individually? Like you get the treasure and you get the fish. You know what I mean? You have to get both of them. Okay. Individually. Yeah. So so um you will you have to catch the fish in order to get the treasure. So if you get the treasure but you don't catch the fish, then you don't get the treasure either. Okay, okay. So it's like a bonus 
<laughs> more difficult to get. Yeah. But if you catch the fish and you get the treasure, then you get more experience uh, for catching that fish because you've done it harder by taking the bar off the fish. Oh right. my gosh, these fish. I keep missing because I'm chatting and I miss the. Mm -hmm. I'm watching your mm -hmm. screen. <laughs> this has got to be a pike. I don't like the pike. Are the pike? I would love to. Are they good? Ugh. They're they're just they're all over the place. Oh, up and down. Not... Yeah. You gotta love that. Oh, this one. Tricky me. Yay! Oh my gosh. It's like every time I move in one direction it moves the opposite direction. Right? Yep. I love it. You can do it. Oh my gosh, I got it. Okay, that was a pike. GG's. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna go to the ocean and catch some sardines for a while. <laughs> watch watch me end up with like a puffer fish or something, but I'm gonna I'm gonna try and get some not pike. <laughs> I don't want any more pike. <sighs> oh right, we're still in the zone of like all the Coral, hold on, wait, I'm gonna gather oh, all yeah, this stuff on right. the beach. True. On. I, forgot I forgot about, about this. I did too. Mm -hmm. uh, I think today is the last day you for it. You shouldn't read is. just half the message. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I keep getting all the fish that shall not be named. <laughs> and I don't it's love like it. It's like the game is trying to tell you something. Yeah, yeah. Loopy, you do have enough sun for a sunroom, but also a lot of humidity. Yeah. I, yeah. <laughs> I've been places like that. I know that feeling. Did you know that Elliot hates amaranth? He finds it absolutely sickening. I'm not sure why. Okay, well, good to know. I'll never give Elliot amaranth. Watch me forget that by the time we have amaranth to give to Elliot, maybe. And then, you know, it's going to be a problem. It's fine. I am here to catch sardines. That was easy. What was that? A carp. I need to pray, please, my brothers on life support. Please pray for him. Oh, mine data pack. I'm sorry. Yes. Oh, yeah. Sorry about that. Yeah. What's wrong with Chubbs? Nothing. There's nothing wrong with Chubbs. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are you going? <laughs> that one shot right to the top. Fisherman achievement? How'd you do that? I don't know. Did I catch like 10 different types of fish? I said you earned a fisherman achievement, so I don't know. Yeah, I don't remember which achievement that is. I think it's 10 different types of fish. I would look it up, but I'm currently fishing. Right. I'm busy. <laughs> Doing important things. Okay. Collections. Achievements. Ten different fish. Currently, my only achievement in this game. Well done. Like, fish, fish, ten different fish. I love how my first achievement is for the skill that I dislike the most. <laughs> I wasn't gonna say it, but I was like, hmm. You don't like it. You hate it, but you are pretty good at it so far. Well, this is sort of. <laughs> You haven't seen all of the fish that I've failed to catch. There have been a lot of them. <laughs> <laughs> well, I was so mad at the fishing when we first played. I was like, nah. I'm, mm -hmm. just, I'm not doing it. Kept, dish, kept yeah. catching 10 different fish. I keep catching chub. Every time. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> see, this is an easy fish. This is probably a sardine or an anchovy or something. Not even, it's a halibut. Look at that. Easy. Compared to the pike? My goodness. Give me a halibut any day. Got another one. Another chub? Yeah. <sighs> mm -hmm. I don't know. Is there an achievement for catching the most of those? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> This is my last fish, and then I'm going to go to bed. Okay, I'm going to do one more, and then I will also go to bed. 
Did you hear that? Like, what is that? A bullhead. Which? I don't think I heard it. It was like... Is it like the weird spooky noise? Yeah, but it's like somebody talking, kind of, but you can't understand them. Yeah, I think I think it's just like supposed to be little forest spirits kind of thing. It um, only happens when it's raining. Yeah, yeah, and like only when it's dark too. Like mm. not not during the day when it's raining, but like when it gets to be dark time. I said, "Give me a halibut any day," and the game was like, "Okay." It only gave me halibuts. Right. Funny how that works. Which is pretty great. I mean, like, that was that was significantly more pleasant than all those pike. Did we, did we, oh, let's loot the garbage. Like a sleepy voice? Kind of, yeah. Oh, I probably should have. Caroline, we're not giving you a copper bar. That's valuable. That's a lot. It's a big ask. Of course, we're about to have like 10 grand, so actually <laughs> it might not be that that big of a deal, but. Okay. What are we doing for fish? Okay, we have those, we have those. Let's do these two, because we don't have those. We have two shad, but we will need one. Oh no, we already. Wait. Eep, eep. We've already donated a shad. Okay, all right. Well, um, that's helpful. Hmm. I'm sleeping. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Go for it. I'm, I'm, I'm on I, my way there. No, I know. You gotta organize before for an hour. It's fine. <laughs> Fine. It's 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 fine. <laughs> Shh. So mostly so I can sell stuff. I want to know that I'm selling the right <laughs> stuff. When you do, when yeah. you play single player, and mm -hmm. you open any inventory, like you're in the chest right now, does it stop the uh -huh. clock when you're doing that? Yes. Okay. Yes. And it's it also stops the clock when you open your own inventory when you're talking to people. When you're in a cutscene, when you're catching a fish, it stops time. There's so much more. Level so up. Much more Level time. two fishing. Nice. And there we go. Look at look at all this cash. <laughs> Randomly asks for copper bars. Who are you, Caroline? Yeah, I know, right, Glam Pixie? <laughs> what rich. do you expect? We've been here for two months. What do you think we're doing? Mining. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, pretty much. Thank you for the hydrate. That and, and tea saplings. Oh, it's another rainy day. Okay. A copper pickaxe oh, is ready. Woohoo! Hey! And I'm green. Spirits horn. are neutral. It could be a mining day if we want it to be. Oh, I literally just clicked on the same thing. Hold on. I wanted the weather report. Uh, and sunny tomorrow. How are you doing? I've been close to instructions on how to make one of my favorite recipes Linus, sashimi. Hey, I'm going to go get my pickaxe. Evelyn pick sent me an entire chocolate cake. What? Because she's my friend. She sent me a cake. <laughs> wow. And um, and also I got mail from the hat mouse. So that's pretty great. Nice. I did not. There's a mouse that no, sells No, I hats. want sashimi. I'd have never had. What does it taste like? Mm. You've never had sashimi? Uh, no, remember? Sashimi's... I I said, oh, I'm, that's true. That's true. That's true. Meat and potato guy, learning new, learning mm -hmm. new things, learning new things. Yeah, sashimi is good. I like to. Okay, so this is totally not what you should be doing with sashimi because the whole point is to have the fish by itself without the rice. But what I like to do sometimes is get sashimi, like if if I'm getting like a sushi platter, then I'll take the sashimi and cut it up and put it on rice and then make like a poke bowl with the sashimi. You're not supposed to do it that way. Not probably not, but, but but you can. I like it, so I do. <laughs> as long as you like it, because like they'll sell stuff in like combination tray kind of things. Mm -hmm. Um, so yeah, I tend to I tend to go for I like I like sushi. Nice, Pika. How's it going? Oh, they're not open yet. I gotta wait twenty minutes or forty minutes. Oh, uh, yeah. Pika's favorite can... is white tuna followed by salmon. Mm, I like tuna and salmon. 
for sushi. Tuna, tuna first. I like, I like tuna, and then salmon is a close second. Yeah, I've never had it like. I'm gonna say I've had it like generically, but not mm. like a mm -hmm. legit, a, like an actual restaurant. You know. Yeah, I I didn't have sushi until I was an adult. I think I was actually I think I might have been not in America the first time I had sushi. Oh really? Yeah. So, yeah, I think I was uh well actually, I think I had sashimi in the Philippines. Go to a good place? Okay. And I did not enjoy it. Really? When I had it. Yeah. It was a uh, it was not a not a fun time. But then after like when I was in Scotland, I had tried some better well not better but like different sushi mm -hmm. oh i didn't grab enough coal and uh and i quite liked that so i was like oh maybe maybe i should give sashimi another go maybe i was just like <laughs> either my taste buds have changed or maybe i was just like not in a mood to enjoy sashimi you know you know how sometimes you need to be in the mood for mm. sushi because it is raw fish so it's like oh <laughs> maybe i just wasn't <laughs> wasn't finding that appetizing um at the time I mean, if it's good, it's good. I, you know, and I, mm. so many people like it. It's got to be good. Yeah, I. Um, Robert Sketch was saying that he takes, he likes inari sushi. I also really like inari sushi. It's um, so it's tofu sushi. Well, it's like tofu that's been hollowed out and then rice has been put inside. It's delicious. Really? I love it. And I had that the first time. Um, in Japan, actually, I was in an airport in the Osaka airport in Japan, and I had been left in charge of this random woman's child. Uh, oh, okay. So I was stuck for like, yeah, it was it was weird. I was coming back from Indonesia, and there were there were like a few Americans who were on the flight with me, and they decided that we should all stick together. And then this lady like went off for a cigarette break, and then three hours later came back for her son. And he was like eight years old, <laughs> so it's like, oh, lady. Wow, yeah. We are not free babysitting service. That would -uh. never. I could never, ever, do something. Yeah. Like that. I couldn't even. I can't even fathom something like yeah. that. But uh, but I had I had tofu sushi, and that was that was great. Everybody everybody keeps talking about this sap. I only sold one. <laughs> We didn't, we didn't sell that much. Oh, I guess, well, no, I did sell actually like 50 of them at one point. But like, I've sold other things to Pierre. Why is everybody, hello, Sebastian. Not okay. good quality sashimi is bad, very bad. I mm. believe I believe it. To me, mixed textures yeah. for Pika. How are you doing, Pika? It's Tuesday. Yeah. I, I nodded off shortly after you hit it off. Handed off the pickaxe to get worked on. Yeah. <laughs> Freak. <laughs> yeah. My mom prefers yeah. not having sushi because it's not warm cooked. I mean, yeah, I get it. I totally get it. Mm, yeah. I also completely understand, like, sushi, if you have texture stuff, try a bit of somebody else's sushi rather than ordering it yourself. Just because it is a, a lot of people have a texture thing with sushi. I'm going to the mines. I'm, I'm coming with you but i don't have a pick because i'm upgrading it so i'm gonna take a weapon and i'm gonna fight off the bad guys well there's a whole bunch of them i'm gonna so. i'm gonna see how well that works did we were the spirits annoyed today is that did we no they were good, we had good luck we had good luck okay no oh i'm stuck oh this is not great <laughs> this is gonna be a problem <laughs> it's fine it's fine Switch directions, character. You can do it. Okay, all right. I didn't lose as much health as I thought I was there, but still. This ghost is not wanting to give up. Lurks to get ready for tender meetings. All right, Geeky, thank you for the lurk. Ooh, gold ore and solar essence. Nice. Oh, I found a staircase. Oh gosh, there's another ghost here. Oh, he got close. What the heck? 
His bat's coming out of nowhere. No, more bats. Be fine quartz. Oh, hey, hey, go down, go down. <laughs> All right, run away, run away from the bats. <laughs> but the bats are at least fine. until we, at least until we have a better weapon. My goodness. I'm just checking to see if we have a free staircase. Ooh, topaz. The, the... I don't have a pick though, so there's a topaz top right. Sorry, I'm grabbing the iron. So mm -hmm. is it is an iron pick better than the copper? Yes. Yeah. Copper one is pretty good, but um iron is iron is better. Oh, this is I forget how long it takes for the special attack on the club to recharge. Let me just I'm gonna just eat some salmon berries before I perish. Don't, Have, perish. don't do that. I don't really wanna mm, I don't really wanna waste that. Run away! Don't run away. Don't run away. Don't run away. It's fine. Urchin can be iffy. You have to get it at the right place and fresh. I've never tried urchin because I don't think I've ever been with somebody who knows what to look for for urchin. So I haven't been brave enough to just try it on my own. Come on. Come on, bat. Found it. Bottom left. All the way to the bottom. Nice. Cool. All the way at the bottom. <laughs> wow. Oh my goodness. So many of you. Good lord. Mm -hmm. I'll keep the ghost occupied. Gosh. Takes forever. I can't little... wait for better weapons. There's no such thing. <laughs> As better weapons? You should have kept the slingshot. I don't I don't know how to use it and I don't uh, have yeah. any ammo. <laughs> I feel like you should be able to just use rocks as ammo for that though. It makes sense. Here, come here. Nope, nope, excuse me. Ooh, nice. Okay, this is one of these really long uh, circles. But it has treasure in the middle. If oh. we had decent luck, we'll find good treasure. Hey, luck is good. <laughs> Run away. For me, things are bad texture wise. Things that are bad texture wise are more like cow tongue or cooked oatmeal. Oh, okay. Yeah. Ooh. I I've never had cow tongue. I've had cow tongue. It's. I personally didn't feel like it was. I mean, it was just like tough steak. Mm -hmm. um, Watch your energy. But yeah, there is. There is definitely a difference in uh, in texture. Oh, if your energy is getting low. Okay, all right. Sweet peas don't. Let do me anything. know though, because I can always I can always take the pick and mine if you'd rather. Yeah, my energy's like almost gone. I don't know how mm -hmm. do, how do you drop it. Uh, if you go into your inventory. Yeah. And then you uh pick same way you would do in Minecraft. If you just click it, it should let you drop it. No, I'm clicking off this. Screen. Oh, does it not? Does it not let you drop? Oh, it lets you drop that. Oh, it doesn't let you drop like main tools. Or wait. Yeah, I guess it doesn't. It's not gonna let you. That's fine. Oh yeah. Um, we're on the last floor before, and I have some salmon berries if you need them. I mean, yeah, I'm almost. Not, I mean, it's all right. I'm not dead yet. <laughs> okay. It's 8 p.m. as well. 10:10 10, 10 now. 
Yeah, so if we can get to the middle and get the treasure, and then we'll try desperately to find the staircase. This. Found it. Hey, okay. Let's get the treasure in the middle. Yeah, I always forget you can go underneath <laughs> because it doesn't yeah. it doesn't look like it, so my brain doesn't yeah. say. Oh, and there's one over there too. Okay, good. Okay, now it's 11 p.m., but it's fine. We'll make it. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Fine. All right, ignore the bat. Go for the ladder. And we get. A dagger that does the same amount of damage as <laughs> what I currently have. A crystal it's, dagger. It's a it's crystal. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. All right. We should leave the mine. It's going to be fine. <sighs> Everything's fine. Doot, doot. And the dagger. And some cave carrots for sustenance. I think we're good. All right. To equip a slingshot with the ammunition, select the ammunition, then right-click the slingshot. Oh, so maybe you can just use rocks. <laughs> You're just doing it wrong. I was thinking it works like bows and arrows. This is how little I've done things with slingshots. I was thinking it would look, work like bows and arrows in Minecraft. Same, where, like same. You have it in your inventory, and it's fine. Yeah. It's like, oh, it's in my it's in my thing, so it should... Yeah, it's just, there. It yeah. should know to use it. Right, just select it. If I wanted you know, to use it, the other thing, I'd put it in my my offhand. Yeah. Enjoy the lunch, Loopy. Okay, okay, the, okay. Sleeping, sleeping, sleeping. Thank you for the people, Pat. I made it! Getting so good at this game. <laughs> Congratulations! Oh, we can make bee houses now! Oh, nice. Well, we can probably only make one of them, but still. <laughs> what do bees do in uh, this game? They make honey. Okay. Well, I mean, Minecraft, but, they have, they'll pollinate your crops, right? So, like, yeah, so they don't really... Yeah, they don't really do that in this game. But if they if there are fully grown flowers around the house, then the honey they make is worth more. Oh. Which is nice. Whoa, okay. Well, Grandpa <gasps> gave me some money. Well, my apparently my mom gave me some money They're that Grandpa left behind that she didn't give to me when moving out to this farm. <laughs> wow. She waited two months before being like, oh, right, yeah, there's also this money that your Grandpa left you. <laughs> wow. So, you know, better late than never, though, so that's... Me that's sell fine. hats. Okay, Poke, come to old, old house, Poke, bring yeah. coins. Hat mouse. Yeah, the hat mouse. Um, it's it's just cosmetic hats. A deluxe some fishing pole like and some bait you can attach to it. You can use bait to make fish bite faster. I've seen some willy. Okay, cool. I have so much mail. Dear Temple, it's Where been are... so long since I heard from you, dear. Mom gave me 500 gold. Okay. Nice. So this sprinkler just automatically waters everything now. We don't gotta do nothing. It doesn't automatically water everything. It just waters the ones that are around it. Oh, oh, just that square or whatever. Just that, yeah. So, and we don't have the recipe for that sprinkler type yet. So we do have to water uh, everything, but we will be able to make another, like a, a sprinkler that is kind of like water is to sugarcane in Minecraft. So it'll do like things that are above, below, and to each side of it but it won't do the diagonals. But that costs a copper and an iron, and that's expensive. So uh, a lot of people don't necessarily worry about doing that straight off the bat. <laughs> what do you mean straight off the bat? This is like day two. I mean, we're already in our next season. Oh my god. Yeah, goodness. I know. We're, it's the 17th of summer. How is it the seventeenth of summer already? I, I don't know how this is working. You're like, your your panic is making me nervous. It's fine. <laughs> it's all fine. We're fine. We've got look. We've completed three community center bundles. 
and we're a decent way down in the mines. Are we? What do we? We don't have any animals. We probably should do that at some point soon. And hmm. yeah, I mean, it's it's fine. We're not we're not trying to complete everything in year one. That's some people try to do that. That's perfectly fine. I don't think that's fair to do if if it's your first playthrough. <laughs> like <laughs> first playthrough on multiplayer, complete everything in year one. I feel like that's way too much stress. So uh, so yeah, we're 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 just it's fine. We're vibing. Like I've seen some people do this, and I don't know what they're doing, obviously. And their farm, their farm, their cropland is like huge. They have so many crops. Yeah. Like is that normal? Is that like advanced or? You know what I mean? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can you can get that kind of size of, of cropland, especially like once once you start selling high yield crops and mm -hmm. you have enough sprinklers, mm -hmm. you can you can do quite a bit. Oh no, they were doing it with a water can. It was big. <laughs> <laughs> did did you see that? Yeah, what was that? What is that's, that? That's that's a slingshot. <laughs> is that you doing that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was seeing if PvP was a thing, but it's not. I was like, what is flying across the screen? Oh, wow. You can do a lot of stuff. You can use a lot of stuff as ammunition. Fruit, veg, eggs, wood, <laughs> stone, copper, or coal, explosive ammo, which is the main way that people will use the slingshot is for explosive ammo. Oh. Iron ore, gold ore, or ready more. Why would you use ore as, as ammunition? It makes sense. In a slingshot, like... Just use, just use why rocks. Not? Why not? Um, um, I forget how the spirits felt about me today. Are you only allowed to give people two gifts? In a week, yeah. Oh. Uh, spirits are mildly perturbed. Okay. And there's a storm tomorrow. Another storm. I'm going to go see whose birthday because I think there's a few this week. We may have missed one. Oh, we might have. Hmm. There's a storm this week. There's a storm last week and this week and every other week. Yeah, storm storm tomorrow. Can't believe you left weather turned. Just kidding. I'm kidding. Iridium ore does the most damage. Yeah, but it's well, I guess once once everything's upgraded to iridium, I guess you don't really have a use for it. So if you're on like year five of your farm or something, then I could see using iridium ore. Actually, oh. No, because we haven't done the crab pot. Have we done the crab pot bundle? What is Did today? We, today's, today's Wednesday? Wednesday? Is it the 10th? No, it's the 17th. The, oh, it's Sam's, it's, the 17th. It, it's Sam's birthday. Oh, okay. He likes Joja Cola. That huh. much I know. We don't have any Joja Cola. That doesn't help. Hmm. Don't know what else Sam likes. But I bet... He'd like a sweet pea, maybe. Well, we're gonna give him something. Um, okay, I'm gonna also, I think we can complete one, two, three, four, five. I think we can complete a bundle in the community center. I'm gonna check the beach though and see if I can find a lower quality uh, oyster. But also, I should get something for Sam for his birthday. Are you giving Sam a horseradish? Yeah. Nice. I mean, I don't know what to give him. So. <laughs> <laughs> I don't either. I'm I'm picking <laughs> sweet pea because it's a flower, and maybe maybe flowers have. I mean, yeah. I, I was gonna do sweet pea, but you're like, I'm gonna give a sweet pea. Okay, well, I'll try something different. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. You can buy notes. You're not gonna know unless you try, right? Oh, hello, Evelyn. Can we... There's Sam. Sam's in the blue house. Yeah. Mm. Good mayor put me in charge of the town's public gardens. I, I'm not going to step on the flower beds. They're raised beds. Why would you step on raised <laughs> flower beds? Sam! 
Give him a horseradish. That's a new one. What do you mean it's a new one? I'm sure horse. I'm He's really glad that that was you coming out of the house because I was looting the garbage. Sam, and Sam's not in there. Oh, he's not there. Okay, he might be. Okay, it, the it, main places he is are over by this tree, or he's over by Mayor Lewis's house, or he'll be at the Joja Mart. Hello, Vincent. Hello, Jazz. Hello, Penny. Is he working? Maybe he's working. He's not at the ice cream stand. If no, that, only that, Alex and Haley go to the ice uh, cream stand. Would it be in the Joja Mart? <laughs> Hello, Lola, Lola Manic. Welcome in. Uh, yeah, he might be in the Joja Mart, like in a in a uniform. I don't see him anywhere. Also, hello, Dr. Zora. Welcome in. Sorry, I didn't I didn't see you. Hello. I'm doing good. How are you? Didn't see him. Maybe he's at the beach. In the summertime, he'll be at the beach sometimes. At this point, watch him be back in his house. We'll have totally missed him. You think I'll ever turn pro? If you practice a lot. So good, I'm not going to have to practice all that much. Okay, Alex. All right, <laughs> all right buddy. Uh, practice. It's fine. Could be better after work, but took a shower, so it's a tiny bit better. Yeah, I know those days. I'm glad. I'm glad the the shower has helped. <laughs> I uh, yep. I know those days. It's most days. Stardew's Stardew's <laughs> going. We're we're still adjusting to how fast time moves in multiplayer. I haven't played multiplayer before. Well, you're adjusting. And Tadpole's adjusting. never played Stardew. <laughs> so, you're adjusting. So it's like, oh, okay, this is going fast. Um, so, yeah, I... Uh, oh, cookies! I thought we were doing good, and then you're panicking, so I'm panicking. No, no, it's fine. <laughs> we're... I am quelling my need to be efficient. It's all mm. good. Mm. <laughs> It's fine. We're in summer of year one. It's fine. Sam, why are you in your room? I ha I need to give you a present. Oh, he's at home. He was not oh, at home. Oh, it might be too late. He might be going to bed. We might have missed him. It's seven forty. He's in bed already. I know. I, mean, I go to bed but early. The house but... is like they, they close at like eight p.m. or something. Co-op is so fun. Started one too many with your online friends. Oh, that's good. I'm super glad. Stepped on a bug. How could you? Anti-constitutionalment. Try to pronounce it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Done. It's locked. I mean, no. I, I'm guessing it's in French, but I don't. I don't speak French. No. We're we're try We keep the chat English only, please, Lila Manic. Oh, what happened? Either French or Creole, maybe. I have a cut, um, cut scene. Oh, you do. Oh, with Shane. Okay. This is a. This might be a bit of a heavy cutscene, not as heavy as the rest of his cutscenes. Uh, I have a cold one. Oh boy. Who's my favorite bachelor or bachelorette? I I like Harvey. Um, I'm I'm at an age where a lot of the bachelors and bachelorettes are very young to me, <laughs> so so I feel a little awkward um aiming for for any of the younger ones. Um, but, to, oh, I was going to finish a community center bundle. Hold on. Wait a minute. Let me go back. Um, but I do like Harvey's story. I think he's very sweet. Um, I do also, I mean, Sebastian is fun. I like a lot of the cut scenes with Sebastian. Or Shane. Um, I've romanced Leah before and that's fine. Who else? Shane's going through it. Sam is your hubby always. Yeah. I, I love how people like find the one person that they like to romance and then they romance that person and like everybody else is trash <laughs> or not necessarily trash. But like the, it's like I will always romance the same person. Why did, I, uh, I have why done did that I, many, many times. Why did I chug all the booze and now I'm like multicolored? Yeah, it's fine. It'll it'll <laughs> it'll pass. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Here, this was this was a whole like not the whole reason I was doing stuff today, but it was it was goal number one, and now it's the last thing I do before bed. 
<laughs> is get the crab pots and then bait the crab pots. <laughs> Old guy up the mountain. Yeah, I like I like Linus. I, I don't even know why I was hanging out with Shane. Like, it was just weird to just yeah. clip to it. Just a cut scene. Yeah. So yeah. once you reach a certain, like, relationship level with the townsfolk, if you enter a map at a certain time of day or during certain weather, you'll get a cut scene with them, especially if they are characters that you can romance. You get a lot of cut scenes with romanceable characters. Oh, okay. Every, every two hearts, basically, is one that, will unlock. Is that just because I try to chat with Shane every time I see him? Yeah. Yeah, probably. I, I don't know how this works. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I guess I don't get to give my radish. Fine. I know. I didn't get to give him my sweet pea. So, you know, it's it's fine. fine. It's all fine. I still cry fine. myself to sleep. It's fine. Exactly. Right? <laughs> Such rejection from Sam. He just <laughs> locked himself in his room. We couldn't be besties. I love how Grey Knight got activated, Jen, with that emote. Not even saying Dra's name. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh. Only trash you can think of is either Haley or Elliot. <laughs> oh, no. See, that's, that's what I love. I love that people have such strong opinions about which characters they like and which ones they don't like. And there are certain characters that I think the entire fandom agrees is like our... our fun characters are not fun char like i don't know that anybody really likes morris all that much there might be some people but a lot of people don't um but then yeah the in terms of like the the bachelors and bachelorettes it's kind of a mixed bag of like who prefers what <laughs> millie, said, millie said alex can get lost at sea <laughs> <laughs> alex can get lost at sea we have good luck today by the wow. way wow oh good okay and it's I'll, another uh, storm Mm -hmm. is, yep. your, is your pickaxe done yet? No. Should It'll we, be done tomorrow. Should we go to the mines or no? I think we should go to the... Well... Just we a, can go to the mines and then... Thank you so much for following Che the Nerd. Welcome in. Um, I feel like <laughs> Dr. Zoro's just like, wow, to Alex getting lost. <laughs> um, Opinions. <laughs> Yeah, people people have strong opinions. I mean, there was who were we saying could go eat dirt? There was there was somebody who could go eat dirt last time. There were a few people. I forget. Yeah, right. Um, Take your pick. Yeah, there's there's a degree of. I'm still learning, everybody, and you're like, no, he sucks. What do you they mean? They can go eat dirt. <laughs> I yeah, there's. Know this person. Morris is a lot more relatable in Stardew Expanded. Dude is yeah. just trying to afford a condo. Ah. Yeah. I'm going to sell a whole bunch of our melons mm -hmm. because it's going to get us a bunch of money. Not that we're like strapped well, for cash, but no. um, more money is more money. More money is more money. Yeah. Right. No always help. <laughs> we could, you know what? Wait a minute. How much money do we have? We could maybe buy a coop. We have 10,000. You want to buy a coop? Whatever you think we need to do, that's what we should do. We could probably also buy a barn. Or, like, we could buy one or the other. If you had to choose, would you rather have chickens or cows? I had chickens IRL. Mm-hmm. So have I. I have not, haven't <laughs> done... I haven't done cows. I'm, you haven't done cows? No, but I live around them, so I don't, I don't know. They're both, oh. they're both something else. Where's Robin? It's Thursday. Is this the day that she goes to the clinic? Is this a... Man, does this happen to be the day that we can? Okay, fine. Well, we can't commission it today, apparently. I don't know. What, so, what are the what are the upsides and downsides, pros and cons of chickens versus cows? Chickens will lay eggs every day. Cows will give you milk every day. Every single um, day. Every single day. Uh, milk is slightly more valuable, and will um. What am I saying? What am I saying? You can turn milk into cheese and that's also more valuable once we're able to make a cheese maker, but we're not there yet at the moment. Um, with ch chickens, you can turn the eggs into mayonnaise and that's more valuable, but it, again, we don't necessarily, you get access to a mayonnaise machine before you get access to, uh, Found it. what am I saying? 
to a cheese maker, I think. But otherwise, oh, come on. Come at me, bro. Where'd you go? There you are. Whoa. What? Whoa. Oh, that was some serious lag. Okay. <laughs> it was nowhere near me on my screen. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Oh. Where's he going? It's fine. Does it already have it? Yeah, I put I put some stone in there. Um, I See, don't know. look at me. I've learned how to use the daggers. You're doing so good. I, I get the daggers. You're winning. I don't get the clubs yet. I'm winning. <laughs> the only reason I know how to use the daggers is because on that randomized playthrough, the dagger was the only thing I had. So uh, I was like, okay, I guess I'm learning how to use a dagger. <laughs> right. You had no uh, You had no choice. You had, uh, <laughs> no choice. No that, choice. That makes sense. I was an unwilling participant. Yeah. No, don't give me, don't give me I found more it. bats it's over here. Oh, good. Run. Go, go, <laughs> go, go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, chickens get mayo, cows get cheese. What? Um, cows are more expensive, but that's fine. We will eventually need an upgraded coop in order to get ducks. And let's be honest, that's like my top priority, but I don't my like I I like cows as well. Well do we have we to get, get do we have to get the basic coop before we get the Ooh. Yes. <laughs> New welcome in. <laughs> wow. Uh so the, just, I found a staircase up here. We can get the coop then, I guess. Um I'm, po okay. I'm poisoned. And I found another staircase. Um, oh good because i found one in the top left oh and then there's one oh oh there you are okay good <laughs> i was like what happened let's just go down you boys <laughs> let's make progress our new mines. creepers yes yes dr zero welcome in thank you for the follow hey you found a staircase eh. oh Oh, wait, you're very curious about this eggs as slingshot ammo? That seems like infinite ammo glitch. Is there a mob that I can try to use this slingshot on? Just want to say hi? Well, hello. I hope you're having a great day. It doesn't, it doesn't work on other stuff, though. That's... I like multi-purpose weapons. Ones that also break stuff. So my perspective is never played Stardew Valley before. Mario <laughs> plays. Perspective is speedrunner. <laughs> I'm not a speedrunner. I'm not a speedrunner. I don't have macros that animation cancel. I'm not nearly that serious. Oh my goodness. I just like picking. I'm enjoying it so much. <laughs> it is so much fun. There is so much to learn. I did not realize how much there is to this game. Like, okay, fine. I'm gonna use a dagger. It's great. <laughs> we haven't even found it. We haven't unlocked the desert. We haven't unlocked the volcano and the island. There's a whole like there's so many other parts to this. Found it. Yeah, cool. Speed run. Speed run. Give me some iron though. Here we go. Okay. Oh, we're gonna get to the skeleton levels soon. That's gonna be fun. Oh wow, I'm not really. It's really comp. It is. It's way more complex than I thought. Okay, so the eggs do a third the oh. damage of the stone. Oh, oh. Oh? Uh, I'm exhausted. Oh. Yes. Good. Oh, there's coal over here. Sort of uh, bottom right this way. There's coal down that way. I'll see if there's enemies over this way. There are! Look at that. Popcorn! <laughs> Gosh, directionality in this Lo game. Lo and behold, Tephole is the one speedrunning and knows the game 999% more than he thought he would. I don't know about that. <laughs> I don't know about that. It is it is fun, though. It is so... This is definitely a game I could play and just get lost. Mm -hmm. Like, you just go and just do the things. It looks like there's something up there. Oh, there's a bat. Mm-hmm. Okay. I got it. But there's nothing. Okay. 
Yeah, I wish Found I, it. it might be. Found oh, cool. Good. I'm debating getting some explosive ammo from um, from the Adventurers Guild and seeing if that can help with mining. I'm sure it will. Oh, but man, I don't know well, how much it costs. Maybe if it would break the break the blocks, you mean? Because it will break the rocks. I just don't know if it's worth the cost. That I we'll know. see. It's I know eventually you can craft it, but I've never paid enough attention to the slingshot to know <laughs> oh, how much worth... it costs to craft yeah, yeah. all of that. That makes sense. That treasure. Is this treasure? Maybe. Maybe. Where are you? Yeah. You're down? Yeah, it is. Okay. Ooh, there's a club. Oh, okay. Is it another of the the big Lead Club. Lead clubs? Yeah, hey, we've hey. got one of those up in the chest as well. Oh. Come on. Nope. Nope. Directionality in this game. Right. <laughs> also oh, lag. Yeah. yeah, the lag is the best. I love it. Yeah, the so lag good. the lag is so rough. It's not terrible though, being like I don't know if you've watched any of the nine lives stuff. It is bad. <laughs> oh really? Yeah. I, mean, I, I watched some of the beginning stuff, but I haven't seen as much since you guys chose your origins. Yeah. The but oh, I have played with origins before and I know that these are like custom made ones, but yeah. oh gosh, my health is real bad. Hold on, wait a minute. Let me Yeah, this is <laughs> I'm an ogre, so I can I'm basically a tank. I have Plus four armor without armor on. Oh and, right. But I have to. I get slowness buff, debuff, and then I uh -huh. have to carry a tadpole in a bucket to not have the slowness debuff. But oh, okay. with the lag on the server, if you go in another and you're trying to eat, and it takes so long, like oh. you, you push it again, thinking you need to push it again, which you don't, and you push your tadpole on the ground. So like the debuff's not bad oh. because you can jump. So it's, yeah, oh, it's but, okay, but yeah. It's, oh, we just went all around the circle. No, that sounds rough. Yeah. Okay. Um, I think we just need to find a staircase here, and then we can, we'll have reached the next level. Yeah. Or the next elevator. It's 920, though. 930. Mm, that's okay. I think we'll get there. And I'm almost out of energy. I have some salmon berries. Oh, I have a, hold on. I have a bomb. I forgot or didn't realize. Hold on, let me go somewhere where there's a bunch of stones. If there are a bunch of stones anywhere. Yeah, I'm gonna like pass out because I have no energy. It's fine. Okay, okay. Working on it. Shh, Melanie. Oh, nice, Melanie. Mm -hmm. Isn't super great, but let's do that. Hopefully, one of those is a staircase. Yeah, I found a staircase. Okay, bottom right. I'm away. And we get another slingshot. <laughs> a Yay! different slingshot. Woohoo! Okay. That's well, a master. Uh, it's a master. It's a master slingshot. I can, Hooray! you know, I can put those on the master slingshot. Oh, wait. Should I have not done that? Um, they're going to be skeletons. So yeah, I'm, uh, I'm if gonna... you're worried about health at all. Yeah, I'm going to die. Oh, okay. Well, that slingshot <laughs> didn't help at all. <laughs> no. Okay. No. Yeah, that's fine. I'll, we're not going to make it further <laughs> tonight, so <laughs> I was just curious how the slingshot would work, uh, and the answer is not super well. <laughs> it's, it, it's fine. Yeah, I mean, it does a thing, but not well, so we're just going to... Yeah, yeah. It's, it's fine. We'll see about explosive ammo. I'll look in the Adventures Guild next time we go to the mines and see how much that costs, because I feel like explosive ammo could be worth it. Right. Maybe. Is there... So is in this... Is there a... You know how normally in weapon in games like this, especially dungeon crawlers, at some point uh -huh. there's usually a weapon that's like so just ridiculous that once you get it, like nothing really bothers you. Yes. Like, is there something uh, like that in this game? It it doesn't quite get to the ridiculousness of nothing ever bothers you, but uh, basically nothing bothers you. Um, <laughs> there's yeah, there's the obsidian, uh, not obsidian. There's the galaxy sword. Mm -hmm. And the galaxy sword is nice. Also, the galaxy hammer. If you figure out how to use hammers, the galaxy hammer is the best weapon in the game. Excuse me. Really? Um, yeah, it does the most damage, and it has a lot of knockback. So it will just take out 
loads of enemies all at once. Okay. But I've never figured out hammers enough to use it. <laughs> but the the galaxy sword will basically take care of most things, and then you can enchant it. Oh wow! At the volcano, um, and it'll do more damage to things. So that yeah. There is also, like, we're going to find, I think it's floor 90, maybe, has Obsidian Edge. It's 90 or 100. It's somewhere in there. Once you get Obsidian Edge, things become a lot easier. <laughs> it's an yeah. Obsidian Sword. Sounds it's like, like it. oh, okay, a weapon that actually does damage. Wonderful. So, uh, so yeah, spirits are perturbed. Yeah, they're always, why are they always angry? It's supposed oh, to be... also, sorry, Dr. Zara redeemed a hydrate three minutes ago, so everybody take a drink, and also med check, if you're supposed to take meds at this time of day for you. Remember to take those. Melanie. Open. Okay. Open. Oh, hi, Demetrius. Oh, cool. So we can we can choose. Remember the cave on the farm where we can choose to either have bats that bring us fruit or we can grow mushrooms in there. Mm -hmm. Demetrius is going to set it up for us. So, um, would you like fruit bats or mushrooms? Okay. So what's what's the better of like what are the? Don't tell me which one's better. But what are the pros and cons? Yeah. 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 Sorry. Okay, so pros and cons. Pros of mushrooms is that you get mushrooms every single day. Mm -hmm. The con is that you have to check it every single day to get the mushrooms every single day. Otherwise, they just kind of sit there. Mm -hmm. So if if it's something that you're happy to remember to do every day, then you're probably going to be fine getting the mushrooms. Um, you'll get six mushrooms a day. Some of them sometimes will be rare. Sometimes they'll be common. Sometimes, you know, different, different uh, rarities of mushroom. Um, and it's access to mushrooms outside of the fall season, which can be nice. Mm -hmm. The downside, though, is that you do need to check it every single day to get the maximum benefit of the mushrooms. The mm -hmm. fruit bat cave, you don't need to check it every single day. In fact, there might not be anything on some days. The bats might not bring anything. Um, they will bring any fruit uh, that is that is like a tree fruit. So um, if it's like... Uh, like an orange or an apricot or cherry or something, it'll give you those. Mm. And it means that you can get star quality fruit because you're picking them up off the ground, which you wouldn't be able to get with normal tree fruit. So it's bats are a way to complete like part of the community center a lot earlier than you would otherwise maybe be able to. Right. Um, and it, it means that like if you're not checking the cave every day, bats is a better way to go because you don't need to check it every day. Whereas mushrooms, you need to check it every day. But if you're happy doing that, then it's perfectly fine. Right. Which one do you like? I have done... I used to be a mushroom cave over anything else all the time, but mm. I've recently switched to the bats, and uh, the, I, I kind of like the bats. What I was gonna, gonna That's what I was going to say was the bats. Was the bats? <laughs> yeah. I the the mushrooms. I feel like the issue of having to check it every single day. It, it it's easy to forget, and then you feel like you're missing out on stuff because you've forgotten to check it. And the mm. bats, the stuff that they can give you is better than most of the mushrooms that you would end up with. Right. So yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. let's go with bats then. Yeah, would you bat? I mean, I don't mind checking things every day, but I always start out good and then I forget. Yeah. Same. Cool. We get fruit bats. All right. And we'll harvest. There's some crops if you want to harvest them. There's a tomato and a corn. Just so that we're both getting farming experience. Okay. Oh, I was going to, we were going to commission a coop, right? We decided to get a coop. That was the plan. I'm going to um, Do we sell have, these winter root. Do we have any seeds to plant now? How do you know? We don't currently. Uh, and I also didn't get... Hmm. Maybe my pickaxe is ready now. Uh, but yeah, I would say if you want to grab some seeds, we could definitely get some seeds. Probably won't be able to do... We won't be able to do melons. And the, the stuff that like has multiple harvests we won't be able to do. We might be able to get... How do you know... The progression of the season, I guess. So you have 28 days in the season. 
Okay. So in the top right, it's it's the Friday the nineteenth. Yeah. Yeah. So. Okay. Um. So it might be something where we need to look at what Pierre's got, because I can't remember. Wheat will grow. Um. That only takes like four days, so we'd be able to get wheat. But I'm wondering if there's a better like amaranth. Is amaranth a summer crop or a fall? I feel like amaranth is fall. Um. Yeah, we'll have a look. Uh, let me go. Do you do you have a preference on where this coop ends up? We can always move it later. Um, n n no, I don't know. No, I, I, okay. like, do you have to check the check it every day, once a day, once a uh, week? You you'll have to check it every day once there are animals in there. Uh, can you put it up here next to the house then? Yep. I would definitely. I would put it up here somewhere because it's close. Like, oh, I'm what? going. I'm going totally the wrong way. I was on my way to Marnie's, which is not where the coop gets purchased. That's where the chickens get purchased. My bad. Um, yeah, if you if you want to go to Pierre's and see what crops there are and what we can grow in nine, eight, eight, let's go with eight days, if preferably, just so we're sure that we can finish growing it before the end of summer. Okay. Eight days, uh, eight days or less. Is today the 19th it's demetrius's birthday by the way oh okay um we'll put that there demetrius likes strawberries but we don't have much in the way of strawberries so pepper seeds take five days oh really yeah uh, wheat seeds take four days mm-hmm Radishes is six. Poppies are seven. Spangle seeds are eight. Hop hmm. seeds eleven. Sunflowers is eight. Hmm. It might be worth doing pepper seeds. Because we can also put speed grow on them. And they'll grow faster. And, yeah. and then they'll give us another harvest as well. That's what I said, yeah. How many do you want? Um, maybe let's go with one, two, three, four, five. They're 40 gold. Yeah. Let's go with maybe, <clears throat> excuse me. 20. <laughs> I mean, we could go with 20 because five of them will be watered automatically. And then it's just 15 of them that we would be watering in addition to the ones that we've already got. Mm -hmm. Which isn't bad. Here, I can start hoeing stuff. I would say 15 to 20. Oh, I got 20. Cool. And we'll do... I think that's quality. We want speed grow. Not good for business when it's raining happens okay. so what does demetrius want oh right demetrius he likes strawberries and there there are strawberries on the farm i'm gonna try and give him a strawberry oh. the doctor fine I'm gonna slam the door. <laughs> Slamming the door is dang. Okay, Demetrius, happy birthday! A birthday gift? That's very kind of you. I love it. Wonderful. Now Demetrius is my best friend in the entire town. Really? Yeah, not an exaggeration. This when you give them a loved gift, it like really boosts their friendship. And he's the first one that we've had a loved gift for on his birthday. So if you get a strawberry, he'll like you lots. But you may want to go soon because I think the house is going to close. Well, I was planting peppers. 
No, no, that's fine. I'll I'll <laughs> fertilize them. I've got the speed grow in my inventory. <laughs> what am I looking to give him? Strawberry. Not in there. Where did he go? Do you know? Uh, he's just at his house. I love how you say that. Like I know where Dimitri's house. Robins, where the near the the house near the mines. Carpentry shop. Oh my! Oh my goodness. Actually, I'm going to go all the way back out to Robin's. Well, not Robin's. I'm going to go to the Adventures Guild and oh. see how much explosive ammo costs. Yeah. Could be worth it. I never know. It might be ridiculously priced. Mm. I don't know what the reward versus... Um... Oh, wait. I went the wrong way. Yeah, it's this house. The... Uh, what's it called? Price versus reward or whatever. Yeah, that's why I'm curious. I want to see. I want to see how much it costs. It's locked. No. 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 Oh, that's so sad. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. You. You can also buy like swords and things at the Adventurers Guild, but you're gonna get half of them for free anyway. So, oh, you can't even buy. I can't buy explosive ammo yet at the Adventurers Guild. I wonder if you have to unlock the crafting recipe before oh, you can buy it. That makes sense. So that's fine. The I mean, slingshots are fairly useless until. I mean, they're not useless, useless, but like I'm not. I'm not good enough with them to, <laughs> to trust them. There's not enough power in there to mm -hmm. be good. Yeah, that's alright. Yeah. Is it? Are you able to upgrade a sword there, or do you have to wait and like find them? No, you just find them. You can buy better swords, but you'll find significantly better ones in the in the mines. Like, I I tend to feel like they're not worth the cost. I got you. And then I will go to Clint's tomorrow and pick up my pickaxe Sleepies. because I keep forgetting. Oh, is it done? I think it should be. You didn't get it's I been got, several days. I got a notification. I, I may have gotten a notification and not noticed it. <laughs> That's entirely possible. I'm like so paranoid I'm gonna miss something on the screen. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, ah, eh, whatever, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Chicken dance. Uh, fortune, no! <laughs> Spirits are annoyed. <laughs> Thank you, Geeky. And there's another storm approaching. Always. Why are they always so mad? All right. Many storms. <laughs> mail. I have mail. Uh, I'm gathering data on the correlation between soil alkalinity and crop fructose levels. Long story short, I need a fresh melon from your farm. If you brought me one, I'd be very grateful, Demetrius. Ah, we do have melons. So, I guess I'm doing that. Yeah. See how I didn't get to take him anything else. It's fine. <laughs> He'll be your friend eventually. He hates me. Chicken coops coming along nicely. Wow. I wish I could work like that. Right? One hammer stroke. Rest. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Watering is done. Are you in your house, Dimitri? I'm gonna take a melon for him as it's well. It's locked! No! Oh, it'll open in like an hour. I or don't... it might actually be open right now. I think it said nine. But it might, it might need nine. I'm gonna go pick up my pickaxe from Clint before I forget again. Nine to eight. No, it's fine. I'll, fo I'll forage. Okay, Willie's birthday is on the 24th. We have to remember, the 24th is important. Yeah, I won't remember that, but yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, I'm not going to remember it either. That's why I was saying it out loud. I was like, maybe if I say it out loud, I'll remember. Um, just going to throw that out there right now. That there's no way I'm going to remember yeah. that. Yeah. Not happening. Yeah. Hello, Clint. Pickaxe. Yay. I can actually do stuff in my... Birthday on the 24th? Whose birthday's on the 24th, Kiki? I remember whose birthday's on the 24th. Who's that? Willie. Willie's? Mm -hmm. Oh. You gotta find something fishy for him. Uh, Demetrius, hello! <laughs> he might be in the kitchen. He is. Always in the kitchen. Okay. Perfect. It's just what I need for my research. It's gonna be hard not to eat it. Thanks a bunch. Done. 550 gold. Heck yeah. Nice. And I think I can do that too. So we're gonna get like a grand just for giving Demetrius yeah. some melons. The power of melons. <laughs> Did you do that? Yeah. Oh, uh, no. I'm glad everyone's not your, listening no more. Your chat is gonna... <laughs> yeah. Are you sure they're not listening anymore? Oh, hey, Gigi. Um, How's it going? Mm -hmm, there it is. <laughs> it's, the power it's, of melons. It's in game. Stop. Not, not just not just melons, Geeky. A pair of melons. Oh. So. <laughs> You're so not helping. I know. <laughs> Look. So, it, You're not helping. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. Um. Okay. It's 11:40. It's a Saturday. The spirits don't like us. What do you think? Should we fish? Maybe. Yeah, because I don't really want to go to the mines and get wrecked by skeletons when the spirits don't like us. Yeah. So tadpole. Same. Yes, geeky. <laughs> How does the foot taste? <laughs> Look, it's the game terminology. You guys can't, you can't be attacking me over that. It's it's fine. Okay, I'm gonna be brave. Oh look, we've got more maple syrup. Yes. Oh wait, and we can make bee houses. Hold on, wait. We gotta make bee houses. How what do we what else do we need for bee houses? Oh we can already make a mayonnaise machine, that's helpful. Coal and iron. Okay, well that's expensive, but sure. Oh, I need way more coal. Hold did you on. water this already? <laughs> I did, yes. Well, that was a waste of time. Behave, yes. Delicious. It's fine. <laughs> Bees. <laughs> Copernicus cat, how you doing? Oh, I should put these away while I'm while I'm here. Let's be efficient. Be, be efficient. Smart. And we can do it. Uh, where's the fishing pole? I have one. Where's the other? Do we not have the other one? I don't see it. Oh, I thought you'd picked it up. Maybe. Okay, I've put mine back. Did I leave it in the mine? Maybe. I'm wondering if it might be. I can go get it. I don't know. I don't. Also, well, I don't know. It might have. It might have been me. I don't know. <laughs> so oh. you, take, you, take, you take the one that's there. Oh, okay. I'll see where this <laughs> other one is. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I'm thinking I did it. I don't remember taking it to the mine. I might have. I mean... Hopefully it's in the mines and not somewhere else because I don't know where else it would be. I have to buy a super, super fisher. Hey, how's it going? The sun is angry today. My skin is a bit too delicate. Okay. All right, calm down. You're not that delicate. There it is. Okay, good. <laughs> I didn't see it for a while and I was like, oh no, but no, I found it. It's fine. It was in the mines. It's good. We're good. All right. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to be brave and go fishing where the Dorado might be. Oh, nice. I don't know what that is. The lost books that you find are, mm -hmm. what, what do you get for the, like, what is? Those become the books in the library that you can read that have tips in them. Okay. Yeah. I found it. Mm, 
I found the fish that shall not be named. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. I'm about to join you over there, so it's fine. 19 inch. Mm -hmm. Yep. Impress. <laughs> hello. And hello. Wow. Wow. Okay. All right. Hello, Evelyn. I want to be your favorite person. I mean, maybe not. Maybe George should be your favorite person, but um, second favorite person. Let's go with that. I mean, your grandson should also probably be up there. Yeah. Look. <laughs> I want Evelyn to like I'm me. just reading what the game said. Right, me too. I got a chub length 11, 18 inches. <laughs> <laughs> You're not supposed to laugh. Shrinking, yeah. Okay, all right. Oh, no. Is that what I wanted to do? When Elliot's over here. Yeah, the sun's harsh today. Oh. <laughs> And why is he standing out in the sun? There are plenty of trees. I, 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 it's Elliot. He's he's special. He's you know living his best life. <laughs> I missed it. He's living his best, most sunburnt life. Yes. <laughs> Seems that way. I need to get some luck of the sea on this fishing rod. I'm not getting anything. Or lure, maybe. There we go. Yeah. Hey, and a rainbow trout, 19 inches. There you go. Woo. So the record is just for you. Feels ignored, man. Yeah. No. Deadpool has a chub collection by now? I do. I have a lot of chubs. <laughs> I have a lot of chub. Fish in game. <laughs> I mean, we sold a lot of them, so we had to downsize. Oh, no. My collection. <laughs> no. It's fine. <laughs> Ooh, I got driftwood. Yeah. So is the junk you... Fish out. Will that ever be useful, or is it literally junk? Yes. No, we will eventually get a recycling machine, and then it can turn it into useful things. Okay. It's not always useful, but it can be significantly more useful than the junk that it starts as, at least. Okay. Like, is there is there anything in the game you can fish up that you absolutely is just, like, garbage? You just get rid of it. Uh... No... Probably sell it at least. Okay. Um. Yeah, I would say everything's worth at least trying to sell. Whereas the garbage, I don't think you'll get anything if you sell the garbage. Well, but I if mean, you hang on to it and then you recycle it, it'll. But yeah, I think that's the only thing that like doesn't sell for anything. I could be wrong. Hmm. I mean, it makes sense. <sighs> From chubs to wood, Temple gets all kinds of things. I do. I get all the good things. That's my first piece of wood, I think. Oh. oh, 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 hold on. This is, oh. What are you doing, fish? No, no. I feel like that might have been a pike. Maybe not, but I feel like it might have been. And rods and poles, don't forget. No, don't forget the rods or the poles. No, we, no, we discussed those in length. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Specifically the length part. No! Oh, I was doing so well. <laughs> Fish harder. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> How you doing, Dan? Fish harder. I'm trying. <laughs> fine, fine. Oh, oh, I'm, you know, eventually I'll be halfway decent at fishing. Ah. I don't know if that'll ever be true, but if I say it enough, you know. <laughs> well, you'll manifest it, yes. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. That's how manifesting works, right? <laughs> say it enough and it becomes true. This will be my last one. I don't pass out again. Yeah, this is going to be my last one as well. <laughs> I love how much energy fishing takes. It's like, I've been fishing. It's pretty relaxing, actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, oh, this is Pike again, I'm pretty sure. Oh, this one was an easy one. And it's a bream. I don't think I've ever had a bream before. Nice. 
Go me. Oh. Okay. It was a pike. And I got it. Oh, GG. <laughs> so nice. That took so much concentration. Look at you. <sighs> right, we were talking about we were talking about diameter of rods. It's true. <laughs> Everybody stretch. Thank you, Valkyrie Kiss. That totally just jump scared me. <laughs> the noise just definitely, definitely jump scared me. <laughs> so congratulations. Oh, I just got kicked. Oh, I okay. Server has closed connection. That's weird. <laughs> okay, hold on. I'll uh, I'll do stuff and then I'll save the day and then I'll uh, yeah. Well, hold on. I know you have to organize everything before you can do anything. I get it. I need to. I need to sell <laughs> stuff. I'm selling things. Also, I do need to slightly reorganize some of the stuff because it's in the wrong chest. But it's fine. It's fine. Steve, I'm fine. Nice. Thank you for the support. <laughs> I wonder if I can jump this? back in now. It's gonna be now. Actually, sell those. Rejoin, okay. maybe. Hmm. Maybe. I, I, it's, it's letting me. I thought I had to wait for you to like. I was thinking you had to wait too. No, it's, it's letting me get in. I'll probably. Pass. Oh no! It lets you join. And I'm in bed. It threw me right in bed, so that works. Okay. Well, cool. Oh no! I'm not sleeping though. Oof. Glad I caught that. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Level four fishing recycling machine. We can make one now. Cool. Oh, nice. We were just talking about that. I know. <laughs> so you have to upgrade level your level four fishing. The fishing is what gets you the recycling machine. Yeah. Okay. Level four fishing. Nice. I've also realized we have plenty of gold. We could uh, we could buy some better fishing rods that would let us use bait. Okay. That's a possibility. I mean, I'm literally following your lead on this, so like. I was I was realizing. Oh, to I totally told everybody to stretch, and that I was jump scared, and then I totally forgot to stretch. So, uh, so I'm I'm a professional. I know what I'm doing. I I'm not. My brain is still here, sort of, kinda, sometimes. Spirits are perturbed. <laughs> is that why today. you only have one recycling machine? It must have been a quest reward. Yes, it's a. Uh, you get one for completing one of the community center bundles. I don't remember which one, but you do get it in the community center. It may well be a fishing one, but if you were able to find all the fish in, say, the traveling cart or something, then you would be able to get one recycling machine, but not be able to make them. Also, remember the the to learn how to make sushi. Yeah, I did. I did that. We're gonna get featured in this in next week's up and coming column of Stardew Valley's Tribune. Woo. Nice. Despite the spirits being mildly perturbed at us. Yeah, I know. Why are they always so mad? I and know. They've been angry a lot. And uh, Geeky said we have to give Willie a chub for the birthday on the 24th. Don't forget. Demetrius just gave me a Nautilus shell, and that was pretty amazing. We're, why? Oh, we're giving Willie a chub? Okay, good to know. I, I just... Yeah, I guess. I mean, Geeky's, Geeky's told us. Jump scares can be stretches. <laughs> yes, very true. <laughs> Yeah, true. That, <laughs> that's true. That is true. I cannot. I was, oh man, that shouldn't have jump scared me, but it definitely did. Okay, now I have a Nautilus shell, and I know that the Nautilus shell is needed for the field research bundle, and so is a frozen geode, and so is a chub. So uh, I'm gonna. <laughs> oh, that was a tree. Hold on. Whatever. Okay, it's not the one with the syrup. It's fine. That, <laughs> that was a tree getting struck by lightning and falling over. I've this never is, watched a game before either. So yeah, right. <laughs> I'm, yeah, me neither, so I'm learning all of this, and wow. <laughs> I'm doing, okay. Tub, and then frozen geode. We have one of those. And then the other one was a purple mushroom, and I don't think we've found a purple mushroom, because those are rare. No, just the red ones. Yeah. Okay, but I'll bring those over, just so that we don't forget what they are and such. Sweet. Well, I'm doing a trip for things like fish. Okay. I think is the it, only fish. Is Sorry? there is there a reason to keep iron as ore or just smelt it all? Not really. Sometimes it'll be it'll be useful for like a quest or something. Or well, hmm. I would say smelt as much of it as you can because even if we do need more, we can get it pretty easily. Okay. 
uh, I will do a sardine. And then we have the shad. We do need a carp. Do that. And then we need a bullhead. And then we need... Oh, we don't need a bream. Okay, good to know. I have that. I'm so used to playing with like remixed community center bundles so so you can have like different settings with them mm -hmm. um that I forget what the what their original bundles are oh. field research bundle is the one that gives the recycling machine that makes sense okay I'm gonna donate a bunch of stuff Cool. You boys want some milk? It's cardio, stretch, and a wake-up call in one. <laughs> right? Yeah. We're a thorough bunch. Your little, Absolutely. Your little Junimo, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Ooh, love. Hope you're doing well. We're foraging. Okay. All right. Fish. So are you just, like, putting stuff in there, but it's not completing the... Yeah, it's like stuff stuff that we have that we may as well put in mm -hmm. uh, before we forget about it, basically. Okay. Well, it was mostly like, since I'm going anyway, I may as well drop these off. Mostly because Demetrius sent me the Nautilus shell um, way, like, a full half of a year before we would normally find it. Like, naturally. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to put this in the community center before I forget about it. Um, I also think I've realized that we can buy better fishing rods and we should probably buy better fishing rods. So I'm going to go to Willie's and buy a better fishing rod. Well, yeah, actually, I'm going to I'm going to check on the map to make sure he's OK. Well, it doesn't say when it's closed, so <laughs> hopefully it's open. Well, it's 1230. It should be open. Jody wants a carp. What's today? Well, nobody's birthday. No, nah, it's the 24th is the next one for Willie. We'll bring well, him something. We're still good rememberers. I just want to double check. Mm -hmm. I was just double checking. At this point, yeah, at this point we've said it enough. We should remember. <laughs> Hopefully. Hello, Sebastian. Never remember If you're anything. lucky, you might see a frog in this weather. Well, I found, I've found i seen a tadpole why quite he, a lot. Why does he always oh. say that? Hello, hello, Willie. Come in, make yourself at home. Okay. Aye, that's good stuff there. The fish go crazy for it. Just uh, make sure to wash your hands good after dipping them in those juices. Willy. You wow. need to know how that sounds. The aroma has been known to linger for up to seven weeks, lad. So, you've been catching a lot of fish. Yes. Let's go with yes. Aha! Man after me own heart. Sure. You can always trust a fisherman. That's what me old pappy used to say, at least. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, keep it going. If you can catch every fish in these waters, I've got a special prize waiting for you. What's wrong? Aye, well, business has been tough lately. It all started about the same time that old community center fell to ruin. My fish just don't sell like they used to. <laughs> I've been working double time just to make ends meet. No time for my own projects. But if things pick back up around here, I might have the time to show you something. <laughs> yep, she's back there. An old friend that's seen better days. Willie, again, like... Wow. <laughs> I don't think you can say that. I mean... That's... <laughs> Someday, uh... <laughs> lad, you'll see what I mean. Ah, <laughs> uh, do I wanna? Okay. Do, well... I, wa do I wanna see... <laughs> I'm going to buy the fiberglass rod, um, but yeah, I'm, mm-hmm, yep, yep. Maybe on his birthday, you can give his job to his friend. Robert Skitch says, come the 25th. What were we supposed to do yesterday? See, that's exactly what happens to me all the time. I remember something until the moment I'm supposed to remember it and do the thing, and then I completely forget. Like, literally happens every day. <laughs> Pretty much. Every single day. Did it's you infuriating. Buy, did you buy bait or no? No, because we have some at home. 
Do we not? Which I should have brought with me, but whatever. Do we need bait? Uh, it. I mean, it certainly the fish will bite faster if you have bait. Right, but I mean, see, I'm saying, can you use it without? You can use the fishing rod without bait. Absolutely. Okay. What? Well, yeah. You know, like the slingshot, you can't use unless you equip the. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's true. Um. Yeah. This. This fishing rod you can use even if it doesn't have bait on it. It's just that the fish will bite at the same rate that they do for the bamboo pole. No, I get it. So what? What's the benefit of this rod? It. It has the ability to attach bait. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, that's like, it. I, I'm looking for the perk. Yeah, that's it. Okay. It's. It's. Yeah. <laughs> it's less exciting than you than everybody ever wants it to be. Well, no, I like, mean, always wants it. To, you, no, it's, <laughs> to get better at, to get better at fishing, you have to improve your skill. So that's like that's how you get better. Yeah. and that's fine. I just wasn't sure. Yeah. A red snapper. Oh, nice! We need that for the community center. It's not gold star. Mm. That's okay. Doesn't need to be. Trash. <laughs> Place has a lot of trash everywhere. Yeah. Seaweed. Oh, got me. Oh. Again. Hmm. I wonder why it's doing that. I don't know. My connection says it's good, but yeah, I don't know. my connection also says it's good. I don't know if it's. Hmm. Oh, now it doesn't want to connect. Right. Oh. Go back. Refresh. Oh. Hmm. Back. I might have to close it and restart it, maybe. Hmm. No, there it is. Rejoin. Okay. Server maintenance? I, maybe. I don't know. I mean, I'm still in the server. Oh, no. Nope, there you are. I'm in bed. I love how it shows me in bed. <laughs> Time for bed, son. Okay. Um. Yeah, it's 8 o'clock, so I'm not going to run to the forest or run to go fishing or anything. Yeah. So, um, we have... You said we have bait. I'm going to look and see. Can do that we can do that there it is so you just like each time you cast you have to attach bait or no you can take like all of the bait in the stack and then just right click it onto the onto the fishing pole and mm. it'll all go in right. and then it'll there'll be a little notification in the bottom right when you've used the last piece of your bait it'll just be like you've used the last of your bait okay but it'll you can still fish with it it just won't he right, fast. but what I'm saying is, like, does it consume one bait per cast? It does, yeah. Okay. Wow. But you can you can have a stack of like fifty and right click it onto the fishing rod, and it, the fifty will be on the fishing rod, and it just won't tell you you've used the last one until you've cast fifty times. Ah, uh, okay, okay, I got you. I got you. What are you gonna put in the chest for the old creeper to come? get? I mean, uh, you know. <laughs> um. Is it better to put the fish in the chest here to sell or take it to Willie directly and sell? It's better to well, it does it doesn't actually make a difference, I don't think. Same price. Um I I'm gonna smelt some gold. I'm gonna smelt a gold bar because no. uh we can finish an entire room in the community center and it's gonna be a game changer. So the downside is that I don't think this gold will be ready before we pass out. But does it cook? It's gonna be a game changer. Does it cook overnight? It will cook overnight. Yeah, it'll be ready tomorrow morning. Oh. I just don't think it's gonna. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be ready in like two hours, basically, because that's normally what I think it takes like five or for, more hours for gold to for smelt. For gold? Yeah. Wow. I think it's eight hours for iridium. It's probably five for gold, but we don't have we don't have five hours. Whoa, that's a long What's time. That? What was the what was the ding? Oh, because we got a coop, so we get a hundred gold back, which means you also get a hundred or er, g g back. Okay, yeah. all right, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna finish the mine carts. It's gonna be great. Spirit, right. Spirits are neutral. 
Oh, okay. All right. That's that's fine. Neutral's okay. It's the 22nd. It is not Willie's birthday. It is Monday. Marnie is not open. Marnie is also not open on Tuesdays. So, you know, we're doing great having our coop finished on a Monday. Um, <laughs> we're doing great. We could also buy a barn, actually. If I mean, if we Well, need, we would need a lot more wood. I saw that we need... Um milk and egg, like and eggs for a lot of stuff yes yeah so maybe if we maybe if we get some more wood together we can commission a barn i don't know exactly how much a barn needs you can grab that blueberry I keep aiming at the blueberry and Same. not hitting the blueberry. Right, right. <laughs> I mean, we could just chop. I could just chop wood all day, I guess. I don't know how much yeah. wood we need. Ducks I for days, right? Either ducks for days. We're gonna. We're getting there. I promise. <laughs> we're definitely getting ducks for days. It's gonna happen. Um. Ooh, there's a silver blueberry in there. Oh, nice. I'm gonna get to a point where I have like 300, maybe maybe if we get to where I have like 350 wood, I've got 282 right now. If I can get 350 and go to Robin's, I think that'll be enough for a barn. I may already have enough, I just don't remember what it is. Thank you for the support. Whack. Sally, how you doing? <laughs> I love ducks. Ducks are the best. And in Stardew Valley, they swim in the ponds. And it's cute. Okay, I've got 315. I'm going to see if that's enough. I don't know if it will be, but I'm going to check. And then I'm going to complete the boiler room. But you should totally come with. Actually, maybe you should complete the boiler room. Hold on, I'll let you know when I'm heading towards the community center and you should join me there. Because <laughs> you haven't seen it before when you complete a room. I've never seen anything, it's... yeah. Yeah, exactly. You need to experience it. Okay, barn buildings. Barn. I need 350 wood. You have like 50 wood on you? Uh, There was wood I just put in this chest. There is 63. Cool. Can you grab that and meet me at Robin's? Mm-hmm. Yep. Mostly because I probably shouldn't chop down all of the trees around the mountain. That's probably... Deforestation is bad, people. <laughs> that's, that's what I'm going with. <laughs> yeah, Dan. Ducks for days. Can you can you replant trees yourself? Because I've seen saplings. You can, yeah. So when when you get um, pine cones and acorns and maple seeds, you can just plant them pretty much anywhere in the ground. A lot of places in the ground. Thank you so much for the follow, your little Junimo. Welcome in. Could you drop the wood on the floor for me, please? Oh yeah. Yeah, cool. Okay. Oh, hello, Demetrius. Bye, Demetrius. Instruct. It means you're Barn. deep in thought. Oh, okay. I mean, <laughs> fine. Way to way to say you're not interested in what we have to say. Right. Um, I'm gonna put the barn for the moment a little bit over. I'm putting it there. We can always move it. Drop. I know that you don't know where there is. It's fine. It's, yeah. It's somewhere. I mean, it's over there. It's over <laughs> there. You'll find it. It's gonna be hard to miss. It is a whole barn. So you know. I'm watching your stream. Wherever you think you're watching my stream. Yeah, okay. I can see you. Cool. Wherever okay. you think is best. Let's head to the community center and then you can finish the bundle and you can see the little Junimos and you can be happy. Ah, but land clearance for fire safety is necessary. Very true, Valkyrie Kiss. So we're doing that's true. That is very true. Fire safety is a thing. Yeah, okay, cool. So. 
Just so you know, we're gonna, over. we're gonna do the boiler room. It's gonna be great. This little Junimo is gonna be so happy in a second. Okay, I'll do a couple here. We'll do this, 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 and this. Wouldn't want the fires to fear, feel unsafe. <laughs> Welcome short. back, Loopy. Where's this guy going with this purple thing? He, well, we gave him a present, so he's going to the little hut in the middle. But mm. stay, stay in the room for a second. Okay. We'll do this one too. We'll give him another bundle. He's gonna be so happy. Okay. That gives us a furnace, and then we should. <laughs> yes. Okay. I'm gonna drop some stuff on the floor, and you can do the last bundle. Ah, uh, no, I picked up... Hold on. Wait a minute. Pick those up. Hold on. I keep picking them up, and this is a problem. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Which one? The last one? Yeah. And you should have the bat wings and the solar essence. Yay! <laughs> There's still one more I'm to do. Complete... No, no, they're all done. So if you open up the present on the bottom, oh. that's our reward. Oh, uh, it's a magnet ring. Ooh, you can have that. Ooh. It'll attract items to you, and then you click OK, and look! <laughs> they get so happy! We're the Junimos, keepers of the forest. Oh, wow. And then they fix the room for you, and then this little guy has a bundle, and he brings it all the way to the Junimo hut in the middle. And then... This is worth this is worth spending time on because it's cute and yeah. They do take a little while. They're little guys. It takes them a little while to go places, especially well, they, with stars. They got little legs. Yeah, they got little legs, and stars are heavy. They put the star in the thing, and then they follow you around. Oh no, kidding! Just in here or yeah. everywhere? Just in here, oh. they follow you around. They should be following. How are? Why are they following me? Probably because you're follow the you. you're the number one. Yeah, but you're the one who completed the. Anyway, they follow you around and it's cute. It's fine. I don't need it. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that's what happens. When that's you, really cool. When you, yeah, when you complete a room, and the cool part is overnight they're gonna repair the mine carts, and the mine carts are the best. It's like one of the best rewards. The minecarts are my favorite one. I do like the greenhouse. The greenhouse is useful, but um, the minecarts are where it's at. Do you use the mine the minecarts in the actual mine? No. Well, yes. You use the minecarts to get around town. So, like the one that's up by the bus stop, and the one that's in the mines, and the one that's over by Clint's, the like the blacksmith's place. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Basically. Yeah. You go to one, you click on it, and you can fast travel to any other minecart uh, in the game. Okay. I gotcha, I gotcha. It's pretty great, which means that we can stay later in the mines and fast travel to the bus stop and get home in time. Mm -hmm. Is all the coral done for the time? Yeah. Yeah. Not the coral. <laughs> all right. I mean, there, there'll there always be a bit of coral across the bridge um, where, like, the tide pools are, but the massive amounts of it is is done, I think. I think it only lasts until, like, this 15th or 16th. Oh, uh, okay. No more passing out in the mines? No, we're professionals. I yeah. Well we're not gonna <laughs> promise anything. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, if we promise it now though, and then we immediately fail, that's gonna be <laughs> Right. It's gonna be rough. Fine. I mean it would be good content, but still. Um yeah. Agenda. Also, I love how I didn't think we would make it to the end of summer in this stream, but we may well make it to the end of summer in this stream. That might happen. What? Well, that's because time is like double timing it through. Yeah. Yeah. What you're normally used to. This is normal for me, but it's it de yeah. it's definitely a little difficult to keep track of everything because it is going so quickly. Yeah. What's this? What's this? What's that? What's this? What's this? 
Just learn the things and go. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm trying. Oh, uh, you're fine. Oh wait, how did I end up with the small magnet ring? Did we both get one? Yeah, we both got one because I equipped my. That's amazing. I love that. That's fantastic. You have a birthday That's... to celebrate soon, I do. So good. Okay. Uh, no. Nope. nope. I know where things go in my chest system. It's a, I'm, I'm a professional. I mean, I hope so. You came up with it. Sometimes. So what, what, ha what happens if we don't water crops for like a day? They don't grow. I mean, will they like die and pop off? They or, don't, or? I don't think they die, but they don't grow. Okay. So it'll delay growth by like a day. Purple mushroom but I don't think. In the I don't grass, think but I'm it's not sure. One of those. Oh no, we should. South in the grass. So this is the way I came. <laughs> I have little legs too. I get it. Hello, Scotsman. Welcome in. Hey, Scotsman. I, I, sorry, sorry. <laughs> I didn't this? say hello before. No. You passed it. Is that it? This you talking about that right there? That's Which? A, that's a rock. That's a rock. What was the purple thing? I don't see it. Oh, it's too dark right thing? now. Oh, yeah, it might just be something that looks weird in the darkness. Yeah. I mean, it might be there. I just don't see. Unless you're talking about this, this is for collecting sap. Eventually, we'll find a glow ring, but uh, we haven't yet, oh, <laughs> unfortunately. It, oh, it was a rock. Yeah, things start looking. Are you sleeping? Oh, it's a cat. Yeah, Scotsman says if we promise it now and then we immediately fail, then it will be all Tadpole's fault because Tadpole. <laughs> Clearly. Well, lovely to see you, Scotsman. Look at how happy they are. They're making the minecarts work again. What the heck? <laughs> it's not my fault. Totally your fault. Definitely your fault that the minecarts got repaired. That's a good thing to be the fault of. At fault, at, um, to be responsible for? I can talk. I can word good. But you could do it for the content. Yeah, we could do it for the content. That is true. I unfortunately thought about the content aspect after I had said maybe we shouldn't promise anything. So. <laughs> and I was like, oh, actually. Oh, the spirits are very displeased today. Wow. They will do their best to make your life difficult. Well, wow. um, so yeah. my, So mine's? <laughs> I mean, we can try. <laughs> this is this is our last chance on these melons. I have one gold star one. I have one gold star one. Nope, no gold stars. Okay, <laughs> well, <laughs> that that goal is happening next year. That's fine. Got a lot of peppers. We do not need that many hot peppers. We can we can actually here. Let's uh let's let's pare this down a little bit. And sell some stuff for realsies. I got, oh, actually, I, let's also help water. I got eight in my inventory and two two silver. So eight regular, two silver. Okay, yeah, I think we can sell all of those. I'm trying to remember where the watering cans are. There we go. <laughs> oh, and I have mail, apparently. Hmm. What is the mail? Spirits, get it together. <laughs> Evelyn sent me cookies. Wow. Evelyn likes me. I need to talk to her more. Right. She keeps sending me stuff in the mail. Okay. This. Okay. We can sell all of those. I love how you that. fill the watering can up by dumping it in the water. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, and then I'll put cookies in here. We have so many cookies. Okay, you, it's you, Tuesday. We still can't buy chickens. I didn't put any peppers in the box yet. In, oh, in the shipping bin? Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna say, oh, no, hold on. If we keep five of the regular ones and then we keep the silver ones just be because we don't have a higher quality one, but you can you can sell like nine of the of the regular quality peppers. Okay. That'll be fine. Yeah. Part of it too is that eventually the greenhouse gets unlocked and a seed maker happens. So um, part of 
keeping a bunch of the crops is so that we can make seeds even if like to plant in the greenhouse even if it's not the right season for that crop uh oh the peppers not the beans oh yeah peppers are red oh some mm -hmm. peppers are green some peppers are green Sorry, I was in the I was in the thing. Oh Sorry. no, no, Sorry. no, no! You're I fine. forgot. I forgot. <laughs> it's okay. I was just showing everybody how if you hover over the green ones, it says green beans, and if you hover over the red ones, it says hot peppers. I, didn't, I wasn't. I wasn't reading. I, I'm not paid I, to read. <laughs> spirits get it together, right? What did Tad do to the spirits? I know, right? Only one more day until it's Willie's birthday. Yes. Okay. Willie's birthday is tomorrow. <laughs> What do you think? Should we should we risk the mines? Should we? The spirits are very displeased. You know what? Yeah. What else are we gonna do? Go fishing? Yeah. Sure. Let's go. What's the oh wait. Let's say hi to the cat. And then also let's check the fruit bat cave. Hold on. Is there anything in here? Oh my gosh! There's a ton. Hello. Cool. We'll put the pomegranate in there, and then the blackberries in the- nope, not that one. This one? Oh, we don't have much space there. Hmm. Okay. We'll do this. I, uh, I forgot about the- the whole, um, the whole tea sapling thing. I- I just plum forgot about it. So, uh, so we're gonna, we're gonna make a bunch of tea saplings in a second. We're gonna make however many... Oh, we don't have much wood. That's fine. We'll put that there. You put all the I just put... Yeah, I just put the blackberries in here because we were running out of space in the forage one. Need a fruit chest. We'll get there. We could just... Actually, we could... Well, we don't have enough wood. It's fine. Let's go try the mines. I mean, if we need wood, we can just chop trees all day. We can, but I feel like going to the mines when the spirits are displeased will be more fun for our audience, probably. Ugh. Farming is such an interesting multi-seasonal job. True. Mm -hmm. There's a lot to do. I know when I was younger, I was like, well, what do farmers do when it's wintertime? And they, they're fixing everything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. Everything that broke when they were everything harvesting. broke. Yeah. You know, fixing it all. Okay, I'll take the dagger and I'll take a I'll take a small sword if I feel the need. Okay. Let's go deal with some skeletons and see how bad this is gonna go. I'm sure to be fine. I don't have any food they're on also, me. They're also ghosts. I still have salmon berries, but um I need to yeah, start they... remembering to bring stuff. I mean I have, there's bread. I think I grabbed the bread. Oh, I but I clicked. Oh, maybe it hadn't recharged. That makes sense. Okay, all right, fine. Careful, there's a ghost. I see that. Oh, lag. Yay. Cool. Nice. Did you get your pickaxe back? I did get my pickaxe, yeah. <laughs> oh, I, I forget how long it takes for the dagger special attack to actually work. Come here. There we go. So I know I saw a skeleton in here the last time we were here, but now it's gone. Yeah, so they'll reset every time you come into the level. The level will reset. So uh, even if we harvested all of the rocks in this level this time, they'll reset the next time we're here. Even if we're here the same day, it'll be different rocks, different configuration. Oh, wow. Yeah. Prepping the soil, field burning. I mean, it could mm -hmm. be... Well, where we're at, it's cold, Sally, so they're not really doing... Some of them will do irrigation here. Oh, here we go. So, like, they'll uh, have a whole bunch of, um, like, drainage tile set up, and then they'll get it all going. Oh. Where did he go? He's over here. Like, over the winter? Oh, what the heck? Oh, is are you getting major lag? No, I I keep 
forgetting that I don't got to move the mouse to move my character and then I move the mouse and I click and it's like on a window uh, or a tab or something. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I, I will get this ghost eventually. Oh, he throws bones at you? Yeah, some of the skeletons do. Not all of them, but some of them will. There's probably a way to tell them apart, but I never have paid enough attention to to figure out how to tell them apart. Or if you can even tell them apart. Well, I found the staircase. Oh, cool. Are you at top left? Mm, yeah. Yes. Cool. It's fine. Scotsman GG's on squirrel in your coat. Wow. Whoa, 16. Oh, oh. There's a lot of stuff here. Okay. Hello. There's, yeah, there's a lot. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay. Let's. Oh. <laughs> right, right, right. Yeah. Go ahead. And now all the bats. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't. Lag. Oh my gosh. We should get out. We should get out. We should get out. Um, we need to get out. <laughs> we need to get out or we're gonna die. <laughs> you should get out. You had way more health than me and you're like, we gotta go. <laughs> Did I have way- I, no, mm, I mean... <laughs> I I could tell that like one more hit from any oh, of those things okay. at no, once your stream, was gonna your, be like... Your stream just caught up, so it's fine. It's fine. Oh, there we go. Okay, all right. <laughs> gonna say i don't know that much more health than you okay all right well you know that was we learned our lesson don't go into the mines when the spirits are displeased with yeah, you yeah they're mad they That's are angry they're very angry today they're very angry angry spirits definitely need to bring some Close food definitely need to bring some food and put it in here that's for sure oh there's a worm thing over here though clay no artifact just clay Wow. Don't die. Tomorrow's the big jump day. Spirits are always angry and sus. It does. It seems to be. I mean, that could be helpful. You uh, know, we both have a decent amount of energy. It might be good to chop some trees. Mm -hmm. If only we would have thought of that earlier today. Look, <laughs> I was thinking about the content. <laughs> the death loop we could have got into? Yes. Spirits are always angry and sus, right? Something other than Tad has to drive me batty. Well done, Scotsman. <laughs> well done. Wow. Yep. Wow. It's fine. Everything's fine. We're just we're just gonna cause some deforestation on our farm. We're gonna clear some land mm -hmm. so that we can make a whole bunch of tea saplings, and then we're gonna sell the tea saplings for a boatload of money. I don't know what tea saplings are. They're the thing that um, Caroline taught me how to make after I visited her sunroom. Well, I mean, I don't know what they like. Is it just food? Is it an uh, item? Oh no, it's a it's a sapling. So it's like a little tea tree that you can grow. Um, but if you sell the saplings, they sell for like 500 G each, and they cost next to nothing to make. Rusty so, spur. Oh, nice. I think we already donated one of those, maybe? Oh, yeah, probably. I don't know. I just, I saw worms. <laughs> I was like, oh, yeah, what? absolutely. What is absolutely. the worms? I found worms. <laughs> nope, we still do need some more wood. Yeah, I can do one more before it's time to go to bed, I think. Mm -hmm. Hey, right here. There you go. Yeah, definitely struggling with the controls a bit because of the mouse and then the directional keys and all that. Yeah, yeah. The uh, if the directionality be behaved consistently while uh, playing the game, it would be a different thing. But it just it just doesn't, and it gets very. I get very frustrated by it in the mines because I'm often not looking the way that I feel like I should be looking. Right. Um. When when fighting something, and there's nothing I can really do about it, and it annoys me. But uh. But yeah, it really just kind of. It's it's noticeable everywhere. It's a thing. <laughs> it's a thing, and it's a little frustrating. But that's okay. We're gonna make ten grand again today that's good. with twenty tea saplings. 
Bedtime. Why? Bedtime. It's not working. And with that 10 grand, we can buy a cow and a chicken. Ooh, nice. So that's exciting. You have to have more than one. Oh, crap. Now you can have. Level three farming. Yeah, nice. Be house, be grow, and farmer's lunch. Or do you just buy more? Like, cool. do you oh, also have level four foraging, axe proficiency, oh, nice. charcoal kiln, and wild seeds. Very nice. Is a charcoal kiln worth anything? Not really. Um, some people <laughs> use it to get more coal, but you have to put wood into it to get coal, which, yeah. you know, it, yeah, I, I find that it's not usually worth not the cost it. of the wood it's like five wood or something to get one coal and it's like oh that's a you know maybe it's you, an can, you can just buy coal from clint if you really need coal but also like just go to the mines and harvest the dust sprites and you're good to go right very displeased um, are very displeased why do they hate us it's fine. i don't know <laughs> what did we do to them They've been so angry this entire stream. I know. Inflation. 10 grand for a cow and a chicken. That'll be 20,000, 2,000. I know, right? Pretty much. We have honey. Hey, where do we put it? I was going to... Oh, not there. Not in the fish one. Uh, oh, right. Okay, hold on. I'm going to make a new chest. Oh, <laughs> we no. Need, Inventory we management. Need, we need a new chest. <laughs> we need a new chest. Just, it's okay, eventually we'll get a we'll get a we'll get a shed and we'll um we'll put stuff. Just get better luck, in the of shed. course. Why didn't I think of that? Oh, no, not the green bean. Hold on, we're gonna put all the fruit in the fruit chest. We're now making a fruit chest. Yay! Except I put a tomato in there. Hold on, which is. Biologically a fruit. There's a whole cut scene about tomatoes being fruits, but uh, the game classifies it as a vegetable, so. Oh, uh, that's not right. <laughs> I feel like you might enjoy that cutscene. <laughs> Don't forget, happy birthday, Willie. Thank you, your little Jinimo. Oh, yeah. I mean, we don't know exactly what Willie likes aside from fishy stuff. Would he. Willie likes. Would he chub. like a rainbow shell? I'm giving Willie a gold star chub. <laughs> I mean, I feel like at this point we have to. Geeky um, reminded I'll, it to you, yes, I'll, you did. I'll, I'll, I'll see <laughs> if he likes. What do I think he might like? Have you giving offerings to the spirits? It might help. It, did, can you do that? Is that a thing? No, unfortunately. I wish. It would be cool. Um, I'm indecisive. I could do a bream. Maybe he'd like a bream. But he ignores ch I don't ignore chat. Stop. I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Oh, these are expensive, but at the same time, maybe he would like a rainbow shell. I'm so indecisive. This is, my brain is like fighting to look at the wiki <laughs> and I need to tell it to stop. <laughs> Birthday gift, thank you. Is that good or bad? Two out of ten hearts? I don't know. You're welcome. That might have that might have been a light gift. I'll I'll try a gold star bream. We'll see what he says. Well, um, he, he wasn't too thrilled about my chub. Oh yeah? Yeah. That's unfortunate. Oh well, I tried. I well, so the th the thing is, is though, is that one of Willie's loved gifts is a super cucumber. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, actually, a sea cucumber, but I think I think he does also like the super cucumbers. So, um, yeah, it reminds him of his grandfather. So he he likes the sea cucumbers. Uh, I got you. I got you. We don't have yeah, any of those. So we don't have any of those. We don't have access to them yet. Uh... So. Like Hello, happy! Welcome on in. I'm sorry I haven't read the rest of your username. I'm not entirely sure that I know how to read the rest of it, but feel free to tell me how to read it. Thank you so much for for enjoying the Spawn Chunks content. Um, we did also have a previous episode of the Spawn Chunks, just in case 
you uh, wanted more of that. That was episode 218, I believe. And Tadpole Milk also was on a uh, an episode of The Spawn Chunks in episode 261, I believe, somewhere in there. Um, so, uh, so yeah, absolutely check it out. But thank you so much for for coming in and saying hello, and th- and thank you for the follow Jagger GTV or Jagger GTV. Hello, <laughs> feel free to correct me on how to pronounce your username. Um, and uh, yeah, welcome, welcome. I'm gonna <laughs> keep the, the those for now, and then okay, all right. I'm gonna go say I'm gonna go give a, a birthday gift to Willie, and hopefully he likes Breams. We'll see. Well, he's not too thrilled about Chubbs, that's for You've sure. You've listened to all of it twice. Oh, I'm so glad. <laughs> I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm happy when people like listening to me ramble about archaeology because, like, it's, well, it's like one of those super nerdy things of, like, wait, people actually like it when I ramble about super nerdy things? Oh, yeah. It is good. <laughs> it is very good. It's good. It's fun. I really enjoy the the spawn chunk stuff. It's been that's been a lot of fun to do with Joel and, and Johnny. Oh, well, they do a and, great job. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's also been great doing the the live stream with them and everything. Drop the word archaeology and we'll happily listen to me ramble. I careful, <laughs> Scotsman. <laughs> careful. I I have a PhD. I can talk about archaeology for a long time. <laughs> Um, I right. mean, it's all cool, though. So, okay, let's see. Does he like the Breen? These guys. Oh, a birthday gift? Thank you. Oh, he had the same reaction. Same reaction? Okay, what... well, same reaction. What? Maybe because I mean... he's around fish all the time. He doesn't want to fish? I don't know. Yeah, it's just a normal gift. Okay, well, that's better than nothing, at least. Oh, I should also talk to him because you get more points if you talk to them. That's fine. So he's just a butt... <laughs> I think he just likes specific fish. But yeah, you live for random knowledge? Cool. Just I love butt. random knowledge. Wow. Keep the archaeology ramble for as long as you want, then more random, surreal, and awesome is always good. Yeah, I can I can do random and surreal and strange. Humans, this is the thing about archaeology that I love, is that humans are just weird. They're weird and ridiculous. Oh, yeah. And... Archaeology is one of those fields where you find out exactly how weird and ridiculous people are and exactly how weird and ridiculous people have been. <laughs> like, we we haven't been any more or less ridiculous in the last several millennia. Like, people have always been this ridiculous. <laughs> it's, it's true. Like, always. Wait, yeah. no, no, wait, you said humans. <laughs> Scotsman. Scotsman goes, yes, I am. No, wait, you said humans. <laughs> I feel like you and V's would get along. Um, but yeah, it, yeah, it's, it's, I love, I love the moments where like Tell you us see people in the past just being people. It's pretty great. Tell us something we didn't know. <laughs> yeah, it's good. It's good. Archaeology's good. It's fun. It's also like, ri- yeah, it's archaeology itself is ridiculous. Like digging holes in the ground to find old stuff and then figuring out what to say about that old stuff based on what you dug up like that's it doesn't feel like you should be able to do as much as we can in archaeology so i feel like archaeology as a field as well is just like one of those very surprising what do you mean you can do this (laughs) sort of things oh i already talked to linus i'm wandering yeah, me too. I'm looking for a moment. I'm just kind of foraging around like, well, uh, yeah. I'm not really sure what to do. Well, like, what? I, I gave Willie his birthday gift that he wasn't yeah. happy about. And right. uh, everybody hates huh? me. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> I believe because it is absurd. Yes. I was saying this to um, to actually one of our consultants on uh, Carved in Stone, which is the the tabletop RPG setting guide that I was the lead researcher on. I'm still the lead. I shouldn't say was. I am the lead researcher on. Um, So it's a setting guide to play in the late 7th century northeastern Scotland and play as the Picts, which is the group of people that lived there at the time. And uh, one of our consultants was was sort of chatting with us a little bit. And I said, uh, honestly, if you tell me, if somebody tells me a thing about history and it's not, there isn't some Thing utterly ridiculous in there. I question whether it's accurate, because <laughs> because because there's no way that humans have you know if you're going on and on at length about something that humans have done, there is no way 
that there hasn't been something ridiculous in there. Either you're leaving details out or you're missing information. <laughs> Always look for the ridiculousness. It's really fun to know humans in the past do what humans now do, like love their pets immensely. Yes, um, that's, yeah, that's one of my favorite things is seeing people in the past being just as human as we are today. Arabic. It's a... Uh, <laughs> yeah, it's really great. Archaeology is awesome because it informs our history rather than just guessing. Yeah, absolutely. Um, archaeology and history, there there are some people who have like a really strong rivalry between archaeology and history, and they'll say one is better than the other. Uh, the majority of us <laughs> are, are happy to work with each other. Archaeologists and historians work together a lot of the time, along with geologists and paleontologists. Like, archaeologists work with a whole bunch of people. And uh, speaking of Carden Stone, is it still available? Couldn't find it on the publisher's website. Okay, so at the moment, because writing has taken longer than expected, b because the research took a lot longer than expected, um, the pre-order is not currently live, but you can still find the page for Kickstarter. And I believe, here, let me, let me look at this for you guys. I believe you can... Um, sign up to a, a thing, a, a link, development ongoing. Oh, it just brings you to this. Okay. I think the link might not necessarily work. Can you follow? So you can save the project on Kickstarter. Um, but if you guys are wanting, like anybody who's interested in keeping tabs on the, on the campaign, let me know and I will speak to the the publisher because they've he's got a whole system for this. I can get links for you guys, and I'll put them like in the Discord and such. Um, or if you if you message me on Discord or something like that, uh, let me know, and I will do my best to also ask him for a link that might work. I think you can sign up to get like updates, basically. Um, but we do have we're we're starting to get artwork in and it's really cool it looks so cool i don't think it's been shared yet officially but it's amazing or maybe <laughs> it has oh it has it has it has okay so if you if you're able to go to the kickstarter page which is that link in the carved in stone thing if you go to updates the one that's behind the scenes number 11 pictish clothing um has has some of our artwork and it's um, i love it so much it's so good it just looks, it, it looks great. It's so good. I'm so happy. Um, yeah. <laughs> it makes me happy. <laughs> That's it's good. just, it's, yeah, it's wild to see, like, to see the research go into something that feels so real and tangible, you know? So, uh, yeah, it's, it's, I'm, I'm excited about it. And, and like, it's stuff that I've been studying for years. So like the fact that people are just wearing penannular brooches and like, you know, there's just, it's stuff is just there <laughs> and they're being human <laughs> with these things, uh, that, you know, I've spent hours looking at like the physical object. It's just really cool. It's really, really cool. So, uh, I'm, I'm excited it. for it. It's good. Anyway, <laughs> carved in stone is great. The YouTube video where the woman talks about how weird humans are by describing the purpose of housing pets and house plants. Yeah, humans are so strange. So strange. All of them take the mick of our geophys because geophys. <laughs> Hi, Les Life. I, I mean, geophys, geophys works for certain. Doing geophys in Scotland is rough. <laughs> it's rough because it's raining all the time and then you're walking through bogs and such misinterpreted the kickstarter page oh no as being done and published no no worries at all because that's an entirely reasonable understanding to have um we were supposed to have it be done by now that was our goal um we just have not been able to do that artisy not because i mean it's very much still ongoing it's going to be better than we ever thought it was going to be at the beginning. <laughs> it's just because of that, it's taking a little bit longer to put together. Um, but it's it's really, really good. There, we, I was actually, we were talking to a master's student on Monday um, about the process because they got in touch. They're doing their master's thesis on games and archaeology and how we can help people learn more through games. And, and that's like a medium that archaeology doesn't necessarily use terribly much. And uh, oh, I literally clicked on the same thing. Um, and uh, we were we were saying to them like, there's so many things, so many major discussions that we've had about like how to frame all of these things, because in archaeology, for example, when we have 
um, like if if there's something archaeologists don't know, then we'll sit there and we say, yeah, we don't we don't know that. Um, sorry, <laughs> you know, and move on. <laughs> but you can't you can't do that in a game, right? People need to know what kind of clothing they might have worn, or like what Pictish songs might have been. We have no idea what Pictish songs might have been, really. I mean, like. It, they didn't write it down. So, uh, and we don't really have, like, we have drawings at best of, well, stone carvings of some of their instruments, and that's it, you know? So, uh, so it's, it's, yeah, it's, there's, there's the point of, like, what do you say to people without giving misinformation? And, uh, that, that was a, a lengthy conversation over several days in various, forms and iterations of like oh gosh okay now this next bit has come up what do we do here so uh so there's yeah we're both we're all, i say both there are like four of us on this both is not the word um we're all really really passionate about this project and also really passionate about archaeology and tabletop gaming so it's yeah it's <laughs> there's a lot the artist the main artist that you're seeing are i mean a lot of the artwork the the stuff on kickstarter has um attribution for. The artist who did the stuff for the clothing, that is Ver. Um, and they are, they should be... Their link is somewhere in the campaign discussion. There's a there's a bit where I'm sure they've got the artist. I know that they have the artist. There it is. Our artist so far. Um, Ver, so at Verface. Uh, probably somewhere on, hopefully on, maybe on Twitter, probably on Instagram or Tumblr. I'm not entirely sure, but I really love Ver's artwork with this project. It's really, really beautiful and really like human. Uh, it, yeah, they've they've brought the Picts to life in a way that I haven't seen before, and it's really, really cool. Anyway, I'll stop. Uh, I'll stop gushing about this project that I'm, no, <laughs> that I'm doing. No, no, no. Talk about. I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying it, so that's fine. <laughs> yeah. Um, it sounds really the, cool. Sounds really interesting. Yeah, yeah. One of the things that we, uh, another thing that we've done is we've made it so that you can have like combat if you're playing D and D or something. You can do a combat scenario and go in and take take initiative and whatever. Um, but that's not the focus of the campaign setting. In part because we we figure a lot of different rule sets already have rules for for how to do combat. Um, so, so we do go into like what kind of equipment you can have and such and do that kind of in real terms where people could easily translate it into their, uh, into whatever system they're using like D&D or Pathfinder or whatever system you feel like using. I suppose you could try like a Blades in the Dark version of late 7th century Pickland. Maybe not with our exam example adventure, <laughs> but, uh, but I suppose you could. Um, so, uh, yeah, so... The, we have an example adventure that's going into the book, and the adventure itself is not conflict-based. So it's entirely possible, in fact, almost encouraged to go through the entire adventure without actually getting into combat. Um, and the reason for that isn't because we think the Picts are automatically pacifists. We know that they weren't. Um, but it's more that like the Picts are often depicted in popular media as you know, angry, painted warriors, and uh, we we kind of whoa. <laughs> All right. Hi, dragon. Sorry. Uh, oh. Dragons raiding. <laughs> Hi, dragon. Welcome in, raiders. Welcome, raiders. Hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Hang on. Let me let me get let me get this. Hold on. Let me. Hello. Hello. <laughs> welcome in. We're talking about carved in stone. Um, if you're not following Canadian Dragon, you absolutely should be. Um, he's part of ArcUSMP, which is my SMP that uh, brings archaeologists and archaeology enthusiasts together, um, and uh, and may well have just been. Did, did, were you? Were, what were you playing? I don't know if it's telling me what you were playing. Were you? Were you? Yeah, I don't think it's told me what you were playing. <laughs> Were you? What were you playing? Were you? Is, was it a Coral Island day or a, a Minecraft day? RQSMP day? Coral Island. Coral Island's also great. Um, it's another farming sim game that is created by an Indonesian team. Um, so yeah, if if you haven't followed Canadian Dragon, click the heart up at the top of chat. And uh, and hello, hello, Dragon. Feel free if you need a raid and run. Feel free. <laughs> Take care of yourself. Um, and uh, yeah, hello, welcome in. 
Um, so I was just talking about, I, I'm a lead researcher for a tabletop role-playing game setting guide. So a setting guide that you can use for things like D&D or Pathfinder or whatever, whatever tabletop RPG you like to play. Um, and it lets you play in the late 7th century in Scotland as the Picts. And I was talking about how there are a lot of different considerations that we've had to make when putting this together. And one of them was what to do about con uh, conflict because and combat because it's, uh, it's strange to people to raid into my stream. I know, it's great. It's lovely to, yeah, it's great to have you guys. Um, I'm usually hanging out in dragons. I'm usually lurking in dragon stream <laughs> at this time of night. Um, so, uh, so yeah. So, the the question became, what do we do about conflict? And we didn't want it to be combat heavy or combat focused. Mm -hmm. So, um, so instead, what we did was we created a scenario that is largely skill and social kind of skills based. So a lot of talking, a lot of organizing. But the other part of the uh, of the, the the scenario is that at the end of the scenario, if the players are the stars of the final sort of showcase thing, then they've failed or they've they haven't done well. So the whole point isn't to put yourselves on a pedestal, it's to put somebody else in the community on a pedestal which is really cool. And uh, it's been an interesting way of framing things because I think we tend to, uh, in tabletop RPGs, we tend to want to be the heroes. And that doesn't mean that you can't be a hero in Pickland, you absolutely can, but it's sort of challenging what the definition of a hero is with mm -hmm. the uh, the adventure that we've, that we're, the sample adventure that we're putting in. Um, so yeah, we're, I like it. I'm happy about it. Oh, disconnected from the game session. Okay. Yeah. Right. It doesn't like hmm. me today. It doesn't like you today. Well, let me I don't I don't have anything else to do. I've just been wandering around talking about archaeology and carved in stone and the picts and such. Let me try um, I closed it. Let me try opening it again. See if yeah, it does see if anything. You can, if you can. And if you can't, then mm. I'll try sleeping and relaunching and we'll see. In fairness, I, I, I'm fully aware that like, oh, I don't know why I'm doing this when, <laughs> when we don't have a silo. That's a silly thing to do. Um, multiplayer Stardew is a little bit buggy. So uh, for viewers, this this may well be a part of, of these streams just kind of by default. I know it, that it's not the greatest, but... It's buggy. No, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> We'll see. We'll see if Tadpole can connect. Nope. It, doesn't it hates me. Why does it hate me? I can close. Oh, man. I can try closing Steam and see if that does. Okay. Anything? Um, one more time. Oh, wait. There it is. It's really oh, weird. Cool. I, I don't know if it's the server ping or... Yeah, I don't, I don't know what it is either, because it doesn't, every time it does it, I look to see if there's something up with, like, OBS or my internet or something, and everything's, like, perfectly fine 100%, yeah. so I'm like, oh, okay, I don't know. Same, I'm like, oh, what's what's wrong, yeah. and I'm checking all my stuff, and it's like, no, this is all good, I don't know what's going all on. fine. Yeah, weird. It's fine. Everything's fine. Weird. Okay, um, we're in bed, we're fine, 7.30, I, and the great thing is, I get back in, and it's... Like, time for bed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The downside of multiplayer. Okay. Tomorrow, we're going to buy animals before I forget. Hmm. Oh, and George needs a hot pepper. I gave... Oh, you didn't do that. I did that. You did that already? Yeah. I didn't do that. I'll, I'll get it to him. <laughs> I was too busy talking about the picks. I completely forgot about everything else that was happening. This is what happens. I go on what my chat called donut tangents. Yeah. Um, because uh, I go on tangents. And then there was one stream where I was apologizing for going on so many tangents. And somebody in my chat pointed out that if you put enough tangents together around a circle, they form a donut. Mm -hmm. That's so true. now, so now That's I true. now I go on donut tangents, and yeah. I have an emote for donut tangents. It's it's pretty great. I love it. That's how that's yeah. how great emotes are formed. Through uh, mm -hmm. and, and I don't say I I you're doing your thing. Like I love it. So yeah, <laughs> you're fine. <laughs> yeah. 
that's an awesome way of thinking about it. Right, Scotsman? It's pretty great. I really like also no pressure to go to bed immediately. I'm just I'm just chilling because I've recognized <laughs> that I'm too scattered to do anything today. <laughs> I'm just like, I'm I'm talk about archaeology. Let's let's give up the pretense that I'm doing right? something like, in the game. <laughs> yeah, we're not doing nothing. I'm 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 just yeah. gonna go to bed so I don't get Yeah. All the bad things happen to me. <laughs> Thank you for the hydrate. Internet's being weird, Loopy. Oh, no. Oh, spreading weeds have caused damage to the farm. That's potentially not good. Oh, no. What, what did it say? Oh, spirits are in good humor today. Well, that's a first. The notification said spreading weeds have caused damage. I mean, normally it'll say that if, like, something's up with the crops or See, something else that we've built, I but it looks fine. I wonder if it's so because not... we're not cutting the grass back. Is that... Part of it is that um, the debris will just grow, like, it'll just keep spreading. Yeah. Um, but, uh, but it, yeah, it looks like everything's fine. I'm not, I'm not worried about it. Uh, I'll do these peppers and then let you do the rest of the, the stuff. Oh gosh, that's so many peppers. Okay, if only we needed gold star peppers. Although, I suppose we don't have... We still only have two of them, so actually maybe. Maybe not. Maybe not so much. Also, uh, thank you for the hydrate, Loopy. Everybody take a drink. Also, med check if anybody is supposed to be taking medications at this time of night for you. And you haven't yet. Uh, take those medications. Uh, lightning just struck me? What? Did it strike you or did it strike... Well, I'll tell you what. It looked like it was right on my player. I mean, I'm still I'm still here, so it didn't yeah. get me. But mm, yeah. Oh, I need to give a hot pepper to George, but then it might be a good day for the mines. Because the spirits are happy. So hot. Just posted about carved in stone elsewhere, really, and someone asked why there's no stat block for wild haggis. <laughs> I have debated so many times getting a little a little plushy of a wild haggis to have in the background of my my stream. It's it, like it's been a serious debate multiple times. I still haven't done it yet, but I feel like I should. Took you long enough, George. Look, I was occupied yesterday. I was talking about archaeology. So, you know, be nice. I'm cursed. Is he like you know. Doesn't like you know. Well, he kind of likes you know. Steam Fire Nice, thank you for the support. I'm Wait, not cursed. Why, why are you cursed? I'm not. I don't know. Luffy said I'm. What cursed. happened? I'm not. Why cursed. is Tadpole cursed? I'm not. I'm cursed of being blamed for everything. <laughs> I mean, I feel like you did that to yourself. Hashtag blame Tadpole. Wow, I did not come up with that. Just so you know, this is not. <laughs> I know, but like, if we're blaming Tadpole for everything, we should be blaming you for coming up with blame Tadpole, right? I didn't come up. <laughs> I didn't come up with. Canadian Dragon would be happy with Wild Haggis. Yeah, <laughs> Wild Haggis is great. Um, Thank you for the support. Yeah. Oh, I didn't do it. Whatever it is, curse for being blamed for stuff. Yes. Yeah. My favorite bit of lore with the wild haggis is that one of their legs is shorter than the other so that they can run on the hills. But if you get them on flat ground, then they just go in circles. True story. Oh my goodness. I have now web searched wild haggis. It made me smile. <laughs> <laughs> wild haggis is great. If you haven't heard of the wild haggis, you should definitely Google it. It's amazing. Um, oh no. There are many children's books about the famed wild haggis. It's uh, it's pretty good. Once you have again, to give them small wooden peg legs when they come off the hills. Exactly. If you get a plush wild haggis, you need to get a soundboard of someone reciting Ode to a Haggis. I do, but it would be l fairly lengthy. One of these days, I'll, rem I'll, re I do. I'll remember to bring food. Not today. Oh. Today's not that day. One of these days, yeah. I will remember. This is why, like, I'll I'll pick salmon. Bear. Oh, I got a glow ring. Oh, GG's. Actually, I said you would have it. Hold on, wait. Oh, you can have it. Let me. No, no, cause cause that way you can see it at night. I found a staircase. I mean, you're speed running everything. That's fine. 
Yeah, I, I know the map better, so <laughs> I feel like I, I know where I'm going in the dark. It's hard to know where you're going in the dark if you haven't played the game before. <laughs> it is nope. true. Nope. Go away, bat. Go away, bat. Go away. All right, okay. I, I went left. I don't know if it matters. Yeah. Okay, I'll go this way. Let's see. We'll split up, cover more ground. Mm -hmm. Split the party. Never we'll split the party see, in D and D. I found a ladder. Pathfinder. Found a ladder. Nice. Never split the party. Really? Also has to be properly done in Scots Gaelic, Al although it's a Burns poem, so it would be just in Scots, wouldn't it? Found a ladder. My uh, my husband is actually from where Robert Burns was born. Down in Air. Well, Air, sure. Alloway, but Alloway is basically close. Yeah. Immediately splits the party, right? Immediately splits the party. Yeah, you know, chaos. I'm the kind of D and D slash RPG player who, when you find a magical item, oh, yes. I found a bone sword. Is that good? Um, I'm the kind of player who, when you find a magical item, I uh, I will. If if we can't identify it, I will put it on, or I will. Uh, yeah, I'll just be like, I put this on because the rule in those systems is like, if you put it on, you find out what it does. Right. And yes, it does mean if you get like a cursed object that you might be in serious trouble. But um, yeah, look, reckless abandon is my style sometimes. So I'll just yeah, I'll just be like, you know what? I put it on, <laughs> or lick it exactly. Lick Someone ordered chaos exactly. <laughs> It might be long, but good things are worth the time. Also true. Also true. Oh. I found Oof. nothing so far. It's fine. We'll get there. They're happy with us, so theoretically, they'll give us a staircase. Mm -hmm. Unless there was a staircase and we missed it. That's what healers are for. Exactly. Oh, it's aggroed on you. Hold on. Wait. Mm. What's aggroed on me? Well, there was a, there was a bat. Um, okay, well, I'm lagging, so I'm not... Pretty big. sure it's in Gaelic, but might be wrong. I, I think if it's a Burns poem, it'll be in Scots, <laughs> but there it may well also be translated into Gaelic. If you look at you own it, Drew, your cler clerics must hate you. Oh, I can't pick anything up, so I'm guessing I'm going to get kicked here again shortly. Yeah, you've, you're... There we go. Yeah, I was going to say, you're not moving on my screen, so... Then I'll get put back into my bed. Hmm... Have fun. Mm. <laughs> I wonder why. Why it's doing that. If you just hate me, that's fine. I don't hate you. <laughs> the, the spirits do. I think we've established that. The spirits have decided that they are very displeased <laughs> with you. Got a little button there next the to you, next to your stream deck. Kick. Kick. <laughs> kick. Kick tadpole. Kick tadpole. Kick tadpole. <laughs> <laughs> because tadpole blame tadpole exactly that, that's right weather that's acting right. up yeah i don't know because like both of our connections are perfectly fine like internet wise yeah so it feels like it's something either on steam or like stardew valley's specific it's nice glitch, here. maybe i mean it's i'm in scotland so weather is rarely uh <laughs> fabulous but um that's a failure. I think it's steam honestly you're being too naughty. The game wants you to be wholesome. Wow. That's it's clearly because Tad. Yeah. Not, absolutely, it's Scotsman. 100% not me. We all know 100% you. That's what I heard. No. 5 mm -hmm. p.m. Can I make it? Can I make it? No. I can't make it back to the mines to help you, I don't I'm, think. I'm hoping desperately that I can get down to uh, another elevator. Maybe. Yeah. If I'm lucky, I don't think. Oh, I come can. on! Clicked on it. Oh, I might be able to do it. I might be able to do it because I've been lucky with staircases. Hold on, hold. So <laughs> lucky. What I'm hearing oh. is that it's really tense. Not my fault. Take the mine carts. I don't know how to take sure? the mine cart. Oh, if you go to the bus stop and then um, there's the mine cart at the top of the bus stop map. It is Scots. It's just such a dense and unusual dialect that it might as well be a completely separate language. Yes, absolutely. The uh, the number of times that the family members have come here and not quite understood what's being said. <laughs> it's, 
when when one of my parents first visited we were on a train and they there was a point there was a while where like this other couple in the carriage was talking about like their grocery shopping or something and then this parent of mine leaned in and was like are they speaking english and i was like oh yeah yeah they're just talking about their groceries <laughs> and then they were like oh okay um so uh so yeah i get it also i do like when i talk to scottish people i can have a Scottish accent and my brain will switch to one. Um, but I don't, I've consciously not done it for stream because I feel like people who are speaking English as a second language are going to be under able to understand my American accent a lot better than a Scottish accent, just because Scottish accents can be rough. Oh, fire bat. Oh, fire bat. I have uh, relatively little health. Um, eat your food. I, yeah. Oh, I found a staircase. Nice. And I found another staircase. Look at this. Look at us go. Speed run. Speed run. Okay. All right. All right. There's Let's a guy see. wearing a mask on the left. That's okay. They they don't generally harm you. I mean, they will if they get up in your face, but they tend to do magic. So they'll give you a debuff that makes you more susceptible from to damage from other monsters, and that's the problem. Um, uh. But they're not they're not as frightening. The the dudes that look like them but without the mask, those are the scary ones, in my opinion. Your accent's been wiped out by the South of England. However, if you're around any of several triggers, it'll come back so strongly, often in streamer Discord calls. If I start talking about Glasgow. Ooh. Ah. It goes. <laughs> it goes hard if I talk about Glasgow or like anything with Scott. I was surprised it didn't do it with the Wild Haggis, but uh, but yeah, it, it goes. <laughs> it goes. When I first uh, when I first met actually a lot of the people I know in Scotland, but when even when I first met my husband, he thought I was like people think I'm Scottish a lot of the time when Welcome they hear back. me speak. They don't. They don't know where my accent is from in Scotland, but generally people assume it's from somewhere in Scotland that they just haven't heard an accent. Elevator. Of. Okay, I think we should um, head home because I have no health left. <laughs> I have so little health. It's fine. It's, it's, so, it's fine. So little. It's fine. So a little. I found um, a void essence. I don't know what that is. Oh, cool. We should hang on to those. Which? In part because they're useful for crafting. Oh, I don't need to go outside anymore. We go to the minecart, and we go to a bus stop, and then we go home, and look at that. It's so easy. Oh, it's so much better. Weirdest one was when you'd been in Edinburgh for a couple of week, couple of days, then traveled to Belfast, and someone asked when you'd traveled up from Dublin. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Why is it always yeah, I don't, storming? I don't know. Don't forget it's, to hydrate. Thank you for the hydrate. The, the most I have seen it storm, um, just in general, in Stardew Valley, especially in summertime. We've had a storm like every other day. I know. What's the for deal? For the entirety of summer. I don't understand. Um, Blame Tadpole. That's that's what it is. Your accent is so broken, you don't think people get it. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Yeah. Scots uh, and Irish sound so different. They do sound so different. But yeah, I can see if you're mixing Edinburgh with like a hint of Northern Ireland, I could see people being confused. But still, <laughs> but still. We're winning. So much money. Not might have went meant, but free hydrate. <laughs> you Scott, follow a Scots word of the oh, day account, and lurking. it's fascinating. Scots being recognized and the push for less slander against the use of it is lovely. Thanks. Is that the the woman on like TikTok and Instagram? She's got red hair. She's like in her twenties, probably maybe early thirties. I think I know the account you're talking about, and she's great. The way <laughs> she's headed fantastic. Upstate New York. Oh, the rain. Yeah, it's been rainy here too. Yeah, poetry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's so good. So back to the wild haggis. Which tastes better, the clockwise running ones or the anti-clockwise running ones? Well, it depends on. It's it's less like which direction they run and more like <laughs> which moors that they've been grazing in. It's so fun. like if they've been, you have to get like above a certain altitude. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> 
I can't, I can't do it with a straight face. It's like, oh, it's, it's, yeah. You were, you were on a roll. I was, I know. And then I was like, no, I can't do it. I can't do it. I'm so bad. Um, yeah, it's pretty great. It's, it's mm-hmm. mildly perturbed. Well, that's fine. Yeah. Don't tell me there's another storm. Oh, cause it's the moonlight jellies. We're going to do the moonlight jellies tonight, guys. I'm so excited. Depends on whether you hold your fork in your left hand or your right hand. Also true. Very, very true. No clue about accents. Your accent's so great that one time a person asked you how long it had been since you moved from the U.S. despite never having been to America. Oh. (laughs) I mean, I feel like that, depending, that could be a compliment, though. But also, it might not be. (laughs) So... The higher the haggis, the better they taste. Exactly. Yeah, it depends which hill they've been on. If they've been on a Monroe, like if they've been living on a Monroe their entire life, that's peak haggis, peak wild haggis. But that's why everybody climbs Monroes. They're hunting wild haggis. Thank you, Zephira. Oh, sorry. I stole all the crops. Oh, you're fine. I autopiloted. Yeah, Loopy's accent can range, and it's great. (laughs) I love it. Now mine mine will change like I sound like I sound, but like if the little bit of time I've traveled, like to the south mostly for family, I, I pick It'll up go back. I, I pick that southern accent up like Yeah. It, not even a full day. And it's like there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I was I was really embarrassed with my brain doing the Scottish accent thing because I knew obviously that it wasn't exactly a Scottish accent and I didn't want people to feel like I was making fun of their accent over here. But, uh, but then I was trying, like, forcing myself to speak in an American accent too often that I was focusing more on the accent than the words I was saying, and then the words didn't make any sense. So I was like, okay, fine. I'm just going to talk. I'm going to hope for the best. And, uh, yeah. Right. <laughs> so, I'm just going to be me. Uh, Whatever happens, happens. Exactly. Depends on, uh, you know, I said that all right already. It depends on whether you hold your fork in your left hand or your right hand. We need to buy animals. All right. Let's go buy animals. I don't know how. Let's buy animals. We're going to go to Marnie. Chat, think of some names for our animals. We're going to get a cow and a chicken. Who knows? Maybe we'll get another chicken because multiple chickens is helpful for reasons. Is Marnie's down here? Oh, yeah. Marnie's is in the woods. Animal bundle. Yeah, because we need the large egg. We need both large eggs, the brown and the white. Purchase animals. Okay, so chickens are eight. Oh, wow. We have so much money. <laughs> we, can... we have so much money. We're rich. <laughs> Super good at accents, recognizing and mimicking them, blame the years of speech therapy. Yeah, I would imagine so, because that's a certain amount of, like, if you've studied speech or how, how sounds are made in your mouth, that helps a lot with languages. Okay, chats. We're going we're gonna to buy a cow. We're going to put them in the barn. We need to name them. I need name suggestions for a cow. Name a cow. Musifer. I yeah, see Musifer. Yeah, Musifer is a good name. Okay, a cow's chick- Musifer. A chicken called Pollo. Nice. Do you wanna? Do you wanna purchase a chicken? I don't. Just talk to Marnie. Purchase like, animals. Chick. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't name and it. And then she'll say, "Where do you want to put it?" And so drag it over to the left to where the coop is. Like, and then you just select the coop. Yeah. And then your name here. And then the name goes in there. Yeah. Angus. I like Angus. You know what's weird is that on my screen, you've just disappeared. You are not. <laughs> there right, you go. I'm right okay, here. There you are. I'm right here. <laughs> yeah. You just like vanished. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I was there. I was there. Yep, you totally disappeared. Angus is delicious. We'll use we'll use Angus for the chicken just to confuse for the, the other chicken just to confuse people. Do you know what color chicken you bought? You might not. Have I been to a strange what? Do, do you do you do you know what color chicken you got? Um, no. Do I get another? Okay. Do I get another chicken or no? I'm getting another chicken. Oh. 
It's fine. We might, it, I mean, like, we can always use more chickens. It's Z fine. Zephyr said to name the second chicken Marco. The first Marco? And Pollo. Oh, because the first one's Pollo. Yeah. Okay, all right. I like that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's really good. Loopy, That's Loopy really, modded really me. Oh, no. Got mis <laughs> you got misclicked on. No. Oh, no. Okay, all right. Um, oh, that's you. I just went to talk to you like you were an NPC. I'm sorry. Wow. <laughs> leaving, was, leaving. I was on, I was on wow. autopilot. I was, I, was, I failed. I'm let me, sorry. Let me, let me say okay. hi to this non-important person because I'm <laughs> obviously the main character. You're so confused, no. right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. My brain was like, who's this? And no. I was like, no, wait a minute. It's, it's no one. Oh, it's just the NPC. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. I'll just go um, over here. We will eventually need some stuff to take care of the cow. Oh, good. We have one of each. We have a white chicken and a brown chicken. There you go. And then if you open up the little doors next to them, they'll come outside and they'll eat some grass. Okay. They might not eat when they're young, but um, but they eat the they're, grass. They're outside. Yeah. Now, now our now Musifer is gonna come out as well. Now, will they eventually. like? We don't have to like make a corral and. Uh, they're okay no, okay. you you can make a fence and such, but you don't need to. Uh, there it is. The cow. There you go. And they'll eat and all this. They, we don't have. They'll to... eat this stuff. Okay. Yeah. There's a there's a point at which they won't go any further to get any. So before winter comes, we're gonna build a silo and then we're gonna um, harvest a lot of this grass because. That's uh, th it, then it doesn't go to waste, and we don't have to spend money on on hay for them in the winter. But uh, but yeah, that's that's that. Okay. We got cows. Well, we got a cow and some chickens, and we uh, still have eleven grand. <laughs> so we're rich. We're rich. Um, what else? What else? Could we? Maybe maybe let's chop some trees. I mean, if we're low Actually, on. Actually, I got an orange. If we're, oh, nice. if we're low on wood, then definitely gonna sit in the corner yeah. and sadly eat my birthday steak. Oh, on the birthday too. No. Birthday Zephira. steak. Oh. No. I'm glad you're having steak on your birthday though. I mean, yeah. Why can't I open this? Next bag upgrade. Yeah, I was debating that, Dragon, but I think it's uh is it I think it's ten grand for the next bag upgrade, so only one of us would be able to get it. But I'm wondering if we should upgrade our axes. Because then, <laughs> keeping cows in the barn, I thought that place was for preserved jars. <laughs> yeah, there, there's also the sheds now. I don't know if 2018 there were sheds, but there, there's now a farm building called a shed, and a big shed where you can keep all that stuff. And it's very useful. <laughs> what stuff are you keeping That upgrade is just ask, axing for it. Yes, absolutely. I totally butchered that pun. I am so sorry. But yes. Scotsman said it better. Okay, all right. Th there are so many trees over on this side of the farm. <laughs> I did not realize how many how many trees there were. You don't remember? Been over a year since you played. Yeah, I think it's ten grand for the next bag upgrade. But I, have, I think I have uh, I have cut down trees in real life with an axe. I wish it went this fast. I know, right? Mm hmm. <laughs> yeah. It takes forever. Yeah, it's so long. We don't say happy birthday here. We say happy steak day. I like it. <laughs> Let me come back. Don't leave. Don't leave. Don't leave, Loopy. Come over to my side. Hang out with us. <laughs> wow. Stealing, <laughs> stealing my mods. Wow. I mean, if they're leaving yours anyway. <laughs> wow. Man, blaming me for it. I get blamed and I lose all my mods. Wow. So glad I decided to do this. <laughs> I mean, Loopy did just pop into my chat, so. <laughs> right? <laughs> I mean, clearly I'm the favorite. I, I mean, I, I, honestly, clearly. I, I, I would... Probably spend my, most of my. Blame Tadpole. I would hang out in your stream more than mine as well. So, I mean, I hang out in your stream a lot. So, 
I don't I don't always talk when I'm hanging out, but like Gee. I I already Gee. have like ten thousand more channel points to spend in the Hall of Fame if I want to. So Heck yeah. Um, and that's that's been during a week where I haven't been watching as many streams. Right. So. I mean, we, so, we, uh, we we stream a couple hours here and there. Little yeah, potato, hello. Yeah. How you doing? Did Myron welcome in? GG's on squirreling your potato. <laughs> You're in both streams. I I figured you were in notes. both, Luffy. Yeah. To the taker of Tepo milk stream will be complete. Yeah. I believe it. <laughs> I believe it. Oh, I'm running low on energy. Same. You're starting to feel exhausted. Gee, I wonder why. I've just been chopping trees. Couple hours here and there. Yeah. Luffy's gone. Gotta go after. Stop. <laughs> no. Everyone's leaving. Okay. Let me. Where are the chests? There they are. Too big to chop down. How we doing? 318. That's pretty good. So you have you have to um, upgrade your axe to chop up the the bigger ones. Yeah, the stumps because they're gonna give. Okay, is Geeky still here? They're gonna give hardwood. <laughs> I love how you <laughs> had to check. <laughs> I don't know if Geeky is still here, but I don't see Geeky in chat at the moment. So. <laughs> well, there's others. So you're. Uh, you're never safe. Uh. <laughs> Little potato, you're doing good. I'm doing good as well. I'm glad you are too. If the cool kids are leaving. Wow. Guys. Okay. Uh, so. Watch out for Scott. I think, I think we should play through this day and then we get to the first of fall and not play the. I think we, we stop stream once we've saved this day. Yeah. A, because it's getting late, and B, because it's a nice transition between seasons, and C, because tonight's festival is the best festival in the game, okay. hands down, yeah, yeah. in my opinion. Uh, it's a very happy day, by the way. Fortune. Oh, spirits are happy. Okay, so maybe, very, we, should, maybe we should go to the mine. Very happy. Not just happy. Very happy. Not just happy. That's pretty good. Tonight at 10 o'clock, a rare and beautiful event will take place. Moonlight jellies will be passing by Pelican Town on our long journey south to the winter. We're all gathering to beach to watch. You don't want to miss. Thank you. Okay, so did you water everything already? No, I was saying hello to the animals. Wow. You have to pet the animals every day? You do. Ugh. And then they give you better products. You got to be friends with your animals. <sighs> Always brow time. Stop. Waiting for the run. <laughs> I left already. Don't expect to be left with. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Stop leaving. <laughs> oh, that was a pepper that we missed. That's fine. Oh, we don't need to be watering all of these. They're not going to grow. I mean, the only one that's going to grow tomorrow is the corn. So actually, that was a lot of watering for nothing. Um, Look, sorry. I, 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 I just, I, I'm, I'm following you. I forgot what day it was. Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Dragon, the auto dump into the chests is newer and it's so nice. And I wish that it existed in vanilla Minecraft, but uh, it doesn't. It's only in mods. Very sad. So inconsiderate the animal's feelings. I don't know the game mechanics. You can't be mad at me. <laughs> I love I love the innuendos that are happening in my chat. Great. <laughs> I mean, somebody had to take over. So, you know, the innuendos had to happen. I'm glad oh. we're spreading the love. Oh, they're going to happen. So to speak. They'll, they'll happen whether you're ready for them or not. Even Arcue places left, they're clearly not paying attention to any attention to all your watering and just letting you do things you don't need to do. Right. <laughs> here, here you go, Temple. Do this. Oh, wait. We don't need to do that. Bye. I mean, I was going to... Oh, I'm in the... I don't have a weapon. Hold on. <laughs> mm. I oh. was going to blame it on uh, ti <sighs> tiredness and chronic illness brain. Once again... We do spread the love. Yes, I phrased it that way, especially I don't have on food. Purpose, Once again, be. it's fine. Oh, really need to 
Oh, this is good. The last time I came down, when I came down here without a weapon, there was a a, a dangerous person right outside the right. elevator, and I was like, oh no, okay. Even Archeo has left. They're clearly not paying any attention. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Just blame mm. it on having mm. left. Far more on topic. That's true. I've we, already left. We do spread the love. There's, what is that there guy? Is an alien. That is, it's a little, it's a little, I think they're called metalheads. I like them, but um, they also cause a lot of pain. So, um, so we have to, we have to make sure that they don't hurt us, but I do like them. They're cute. Oh gosh, there are a lot of slimes here. Oh, I found a staircase. Let's go. <laughs> okay. So these are the guys that are dangerous. These are the guys that worry me. They do 18 when they hit you. It's uh, it's not great. Okay. That dude is locked up. So mm -hmm. actually, let's keep it that way, maybe. Yeah, we just, we don't need him. I mean, he didn't oh. he didn't last long. Yes, I'm already like more than halfway down on my health. <laughs> I would love to get to level five combat because then I think you get more hit points. I could be wrong though. Let you get those. I'll get these ones. There was a dangerous person outside the elevator, but why was Tad down there before you? <laughs> oh, I found a staircase. It's down here. Sorry, I was reading what's gossip. I've, I've, yep. Mm -hmm. I've, I've already left. Let's just, let's just say that. Wow. Wow. Oh gosh, guys, wow. there don't need to be this many of you. Don't mind me, I'm not distracting honest. <laughs> I always I always feel a little badly when a whole bunch is happening in chat and I, I I'm not paying attention to it because I'm playing the game. So every time I see it move, I'm like, wait a minute, I need to I need to <laughs> I need to pay attention. So many things. Streaming is complicated. A little bit. Um Oh cool, that's the last scroll we need to talk to the dwarf. We can't get to the dwarf yet, but it's the last scroll we need. Why can't we get to him? Um, because he's behind a, a rock. Uh, that our it. pickaxes aren't good enough. I to... found a blue mu purple mushroom. Okay. Oh, nice! We need that for the for a bundle. Oh, and then there's a diamond over there. Do you want to mine that? It's gonna take a while, but it'll give you a whole bunch of mining experience. 150 to be exact. My uh, health is really bad. Oh, okay. Mine is not great, but not oh, as bad oh, as yours. Oh, oh, yeah. Nope. Oh, yeah. That that big. Maybe maybe you want to go uh, up. What are we at? We're at eighty-eight. Okay. All right. Hold on. Did you beat him? Nope. Nope. Come at me, bat. Come at me. Come here. That was, I feel like that was skillful dodging right there. <laughs> that was like, given the amount of lag that we have had on this, on this right. server. Pretty good. <laughs> that was impressive. <laughs> I definitely thought you were dying there. I did too. I like, oh, oh okay. my God. Comes another, another one. one. Okay, yeah. okay. Come here, come at me, bro. I mean, as I continue, all right, now my health is in a similar place, but I'm just gonna eat some salmon berries. <laughs> You can craft a juke. <laughs> I can craft a craft a jukebox now. Yeah, we can listen to a record. Omni oh, I have an Omni Geode as well. There's another bat. Oh, do you need a diamond for a jukebox? Is that we? Do we for the mini jukebox? In Minecraft. Oh, in Minecraft, that makes sense. No, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. My brain is definitely here. It's a functional brain. Sometimes. Uh, mine's mine's shutting off. It's fine. <laughs> uh, yeah, mine, mine shut off a while ago. Oh, I found a staircase. Jeez. Okay, let's see. Any dangerous folks? Not that I've seen yet. So that's good. Anything cool? Is it worth breaking no. these things? Which? The, uh... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But if you break them with your sword, they'll break faster. Um... And you won't use any energy. Can I eat fiber? No, unfortunately. 
But fiber's good. Oh, that's a sword, though. You just got a good sword. A tempered bronze sword. It's a little bit slower, but it does a lot more damage. Not that you should necessarily test it out. Gosh. Okay, hold on. I shouldn't? Hold on. Why? Hold on. Um, depending on how your health is. <laughs> well, it's pretty low. Whoa! Hey, buddy. Yep. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's good. I got it. I got it. <laughs> Sorry. I had had to retreat and get a little bit more health before I ran out of again. Mm. Okay, I found it. I'm using... Four I'm, 90. I'm, I'm definitely using... Obsidian the Edge, the best sword. We're going to get rid of the sap because we don't need sap. Okay. This is exciting. Obsidian Edge is such a better sword. 30 to 45 damage plus oh, wow. 10 crit power. Mm -hmm. It's good. It's really good. Okay. All right. Um, we need to let's let's go back to our house and drop stuff off and then get ready for the moonlight jellies. Thank you so much for the follow, Rerun. Welcome in. <clears throat> Soon I'll be used to eight hour streams. You say this, Dragon. <laughs> we'll see. I mean, it would be nice. It would be nice to, but uh, but we'll see. We'll have to. We'll see. Part of it is that today I'm doing a lot better because I didn't stream at all yesterday. So it's as like this is me starting my streaming for the week. But at the same time, I don't know that I'm going to stream tomorrow. I'm kind of leaving. Oh, I forgot about the mine carts and how we could go the fast way. Tadpole <laughs> is smarter than me. Devil dying. The Devil Devil dying. <laughs> <laughs> Devil's dying. Yeah, but Mod. there's nothing dangerous out here. Mod the mind, yes, my first Stardew place. I'm gonna get rid of the sap, but Tad has been following you so nicely, like a little puppy. Scotsman. <laughs> wow. I don't know what Goodness. I'm doing. <laughs> it's all fine. Everything's fine. Uh, okay. All right. Here. I'm learning. I'm learning. Here's... Okay. What did I? What did I put in there? Void. <laughs> we had have we had any maybe haven't brought it back oh it's over here okay what are we looking Let's for in the void essence i'm just gonna put it in the in the the chest with all the other stuff from the mines where do i put the mushroom purple mushroom oh d is there space in the foraging chest no. that one no okay and then that, put that... it in the other green one for now and we'll I put That's this. I put the scroll in there That's too. Vegetable. Okay. Cool. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna reorganize some of this. I'm gonna. Small cat. Gonna put the How you doing? Scroll there. We're gonna put the <laughs> mushroom there, and we're gonna put this fruit <laughs> over in the fruit area. It's fine. It's all good. Excellent. Okay. So let's I mean, head to the I, beach. I, I, I'm gonna die. I have to eat something. You're. You're fine. It's fine. We're just going to the beach. <laughs> They're gonna be jellyfish. Uh -huh. It's gonna be the best, the uh -huh. best event <laughs> festival in the game. Yeah, small. Yeah, plus, it's Stardew. It's so soothing. Exactly. I'm not being a drama queen. I'm gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> but there's nothing dangerous. You're not gonna die. My You're health. Fine. My health is shooting blood at me. I think. Yeah, I but need nothing to can take away your health. <laughs> We're we're in town. It's not hostile. I don't know. Pam's okay. pretty angry when she doesn't well, when she true. doesn't have her uh, things. <clears throat> Drama be queen. Innocent, I just choose not to be. <laughs> yes, Scotsman. Also, functional brains are overrated. Agreed. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is this is the moonlight jellies. As per usual, talk to everybody first. I don't think we should buy anything. Pierre sometimes has stuff that's interesting to buy, but um, we don't need to. It's fine. There's no buffet. Oh, Pam. Life. Yeah. I hope you had a good day, Small. Of course, Gus is trying to figure out how they would taste. So. I mean, right? Life is so easy for a jellyfish. Just letting the waves carry you onward forever. I, I don't know. I don't know that I would say life is easy for a jellyfish. I feel like the threat of being eaten, that, I mean, <laughs> Vincent wants to, okay, there is one thing that makes me sad about this event, and I'll tell you once it's over, but it is still the best event in the game. We're gonna order DoorDash and be a vegetable. Good call. 
If you're a vegetable and you order vegetables, does that is that cannibalism? <laughs> Asking for a friend. Oh well. Stream Taco Bell, here we come. Oh my goodness. <laughs> you definitely maybe probably should stream Tumbleweed Stardew tonight with your best buddies, maybe probably small cats. I mean I I agree with Mod the Mine. I second that. Right, yes. I, okay, hold on. Hello? Jody. And Emily. Minecraft throw. I do all, all these biomes. It's been seven. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Clint, he wore his special shoes and nobody noticed. Can vegetables be cannibals? See, that's that's the existential question we need to ask ourselves. Um, do uh, maybe not. Maybe we just pay attention to the to the jellyfish. <laughs> I haven't spoken to Demetrius yet. Is he over this way? He's on land. <laughs> oh yeah, Evelyn and George are over here. Hold on. They're all in like happy. Thought I saw something moving in there. Something big. <laughs> something dark. So exciting. Also, George likes this festival, so, you know, best festival. It makes George less grumpy. George doesn't like anything. But he likes this festival. I love how he's always by himself, though. George or Linus? George. George? Well, his wife is there, at least. But, yeah, he is always like, hump. I'm going to go not be around people. All right, Grouch. Do we also see, is the wizard also here? Is he up here? Yeah, he's up here. Stardew's well, you weren't well off. hidden enough, wizard. <laughs> Stardew's all the rage is what people want. It's the end of your workday and we're still here. You're grateful and confused. Small well, we're finishing soon, Ms. Halsey, but hello, hello, and Small welcome. <laughs> gifted a tier one sub we're, doing, we're doing the Moonlight they Jellies Festival and then we're going to end stream because it, it will have been almost eight hours at that point and I'm going to turn cats. into a puddle. Thank you for gifting a sub to Mod the Mind. Mod, enjoy your custom sub badge, your ad free viewing, but best of all, your Winston emotes. Thank you, Small. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow, little potato. Welcome in. <laughs> I think that's everyone. Question mark? You can you can check in your relationships tab. They should all be marked off. I think. Oh, for today. Oh, there it is. Yeah, for talking with them. Yeah. Oh, oh no, Pierre. Where's Pierre? Oh, Pierre is uh, up where Caroline and uh, and such were top left. You can scoot in over here. <laughs> Oh, you have to go behind the... Okay. You have to go behind the counter to talk to him. I should have known Pierre's selling something. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm -hmm. nothing, okay. nothing that we should buy at the moment. Okay, all right. Let's go. Let's go start the festival, the best festival. Oh, you have to talk to him again? Launch the boats. Wanted to join the spam? Fair. <laughs> <laughs> the bestival, yes. The bestival? Small, have you got this far yet? Small cats mod the mine and Dutchy Cat are doing a playthrough. They're doing the four corners, I believe. Oh nice. I think. Single player world, yes. Oh, okay. Not on your world yet? No tab because small won't play. Jeff's still at work though, so. 
Okay, so my one beef with this festival is that Vincent really wants to see the rare green jelly, and the rare green jelly comes up to us instead of Vincent. Aww. Jazz gets to see the babies, but Vincent doesn't get to see the green one, and it makes me sad. But yeah. otherwise, this is like the perfect festival. It's very just, nice. Just pick the wrong spot, that's all. <laughs> Quit's job to play Stardew. <laughs> The glow of summer has faded now, and the moonlight jellies carry on towards the great unknown. <laughs> it's good. I like that. That was festival. good. I it's like good that. Festival. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Also, small. Uh, uh, you weren't here last stream. Are you aware that our cat is named after you? Ginger was like, "It needs to be named smallest cat." Uh. Well, smallest cats. And I tried yeah. to fit the second Z, but it wouldn't let me. So it's it it's missing the Z, but it lives here. It's there. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. That's our cat. Also, we should go to bed because it's twelve forty in the morning. <laughs> we should go to bed. Go to bed. If we want, if we want energy, we should go to bed. Go to bed. <clears throat> ah, yeah. All the oh my gosh, yeah. small. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so many, so much, so much reaction to the cat. <laughs> yeah, it's the little gray tabby, and it's, 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 it's yeah. Oh, level four mining. Transmute and glowstone ring. Cool. Oh, nice. That's really good. The glowstone ring is helpful, but it's expensive. And level three combat. Plus five nice. Hit, plus five hit points in roots platter. We haven't cooked any food or nothing. No, because we don't have a kitchen yet. We have to upgrade our house to get a kitchen. So I guess this. And now we're in fall. Yeah. You want to stop here? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Actually, I probably shouldn't. We shouldn't, shouldn't do sneak peeks. All right. I think we're gonna. We're probably gonna end stream here. Well, I, I say probably. We're gonna end stream here, guys. Yeah. <laughs> um, it's been a while, but thank you for joining us for summer <sighs> in Stardew Valley. I feel like we were more organized this time. We got more done, and we grew more crops. Mm. My panic. But my panic wasn't as bad this time. <laughs> I feel like. I, feel I mean, like I, mean I mean, I mean. <laughs> was it? Oh, was it worse? Was it bad? No, I don't know what to expect. And you're like, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. I'm like, what's going on? What? Are we doing something wrong? <laughs> I think it's just because, like, I I don't know. I don't understand the progression of time in the game. Yeah. You know, like I have no no basis for it. But you do, you know what's coming and you know you have to do certain things to progress. And I'm like, yeah. I'm just kind of like, yeah, let's walk over here. <laughs> yeah, we haven't we haven't done anything that's like game breaking or anything in terms of missing stuff. Like th that's the other thing about Stardew is that like the stuff that you miss generally is fairly inconsequential. It's okay. Mm -hmm. so, well, I, uh, I mean, I'm still so, having yeah. fun, so. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it'll be good. Um, yeah, so thanks everybody for joining and uh, for peeps looking for my streams. I, uh, I'm i not going to stream tomorrow, I don't think. I have had chronic health stuff since Christmas that hasn't really completely recovered. So I'm going to take tomorrow to try and make sure that that's actually solidly recovered, mm -hmm. um, hopefully over the weekend. But I will be streaming the week after, like next week. Um, I'll be back to normal streaming, hopefully. And then the week after, it's going to be weird again, because that's when we're probably maybe sort of going to redo the bathroom. So I'll keep you posted in the Discord <laughs> and on YouTube. And yeah, those are probably the best places, um, okay. the Discord or the YouTube. And uh, there's a link to my Discord in my chat. If you want to join, you don't have to be a hey, subscriber. Let's... Anybody can join. <laughs> Um, and Tadpole, you'll be streaming tomorrow, right? Yep. Same time, same place? Same time, same place tomorrow, which is, what, Thursday? And then Friday we'll be mm -hmm. streaming. Saturday is yeah. the tabletop RPG we're doing. Uh, Small will be streaming that along with Rube, uh, Misty and Cosmo. So, yeah, come in. Yeah. Uh, check all that out. It's it's I'm, my first time doing anything like that. And it's so much fun. Want some milk? So much fun. Yeah. Valkyrie, I have to catch up on the VOD for that. I haven't I haven't oh my goodness. seen it yet. So I'm excited. <laughs> it was so It'll much fun. Good. I I cannot yeah. wait to see. I didn't want it to end. I was sad. When it was uh, when yeah. it, you know it was time to break, I was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> I was like yep. screaming in my head, no. <laughs> yep. I know the feeling. <laughs> it was a lot of fun. I'm looking forward to the next session. So 
yeah. Stardew yeah. music grinds its way into your brain. Right, it's good. I like mm -hmm. it. I like it. I'm mm -hmm. enjoying it. Yeah. But yeah, this was great. I mean, I'm still in awe of how much there is, how many different yeah. layers there are to this game. I did not realize it was this involved, and I'm having so much fun learning everything. So thank you again yeah, for doing this. Yeah, it's it's great. It's wonderful. This is so much fun. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Okay. So I think, I think we're gonna end there. I don't know if there's anyone we can raid. Um, Not sure. Looking to see right now. So we can raid someone that's on nine lives that I'm participating in, or we can just raid somebody else that's oh. just an amazing person that's part of the community. So, Up to you. Okay, let's let's raid Cat the Possum. I don't know if you're familiar. Okay, yes, I do have them. It's, okay. They were buried. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so, yeah. But I do have them. We can do that. Yeah, absolutely. So we'll we'll set up the the raid for you guys, and we'll see you over there. <laughs> but but I just got here. I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Endless. Sorry. You work too sorry. much. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. We will be live again tomorrow. I'm not sure what we're gonna do. If I can get everything set up for Halcyon because they upgraded to 120.4, I'll be there. But if I cannot, then we'd probably be on nine lives. So that's that's the thing. <laughs> that's going to be the day. Thanks for putting the raid messages in chat. Guys, grab any old raid message you want. Yep, same. same. Use the emotes, you, whatever emotes you want. I'm going to go ahead and hit the start the raid here. Yeah, cool. me too. We'll go see Kat. And um, thank you all for hanging out. I'm loving every minute of doing this. So thank you for being here, participating. I really appreciate it. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for all the love, especially on both streams. Um, it's really great to see the crossover as well. Oh, yeah. So, uh, thanks, <laughs> thanks for hanging out, everybody. We will see you guys tomorrow, hopefully. If not, have a great yeah. rest of your day and a great week. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Bye, Bye everybody.